Aliu! 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 See, Kane's been here enough that he kn- he knows what to do. He he gets it. He just gets it now. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Once again, everybody, welcome to the stream. My name's Roy. I'll be your bunny host for this evening. I specialize in voice acting, and I host a bunch of collaborative chaos. More mm. importantly, I'm joined tonight by, it's my ranger in action, it's Kane Knight, one for the VTuber group, and Victor, Royal Knight of His Majesty, Ultimate Ikemen, and you are his MC on the second round of his visual novel. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're strapped in and ready for another seven out. No, I don't think it'll it, be seven hours. It probably Who are we will kidding, be. though? I think it will be. I think it will be, too. I think it will be. It's Because Zeus has never experienced Power Rangers before. So we have a lot of explaining to do, as we did with, for all of you. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Gasp, he's hot. Listen, don't <sighs> I know it. Thank you so much. Don't I know it. <laughs> but yeah, we're just waiting for for Zoys. <gasps> Zoys. I heard the notification. Hi. Oh, are they on the Discord call? Oh, okay. I I heard the the. Doo-doo. I was like, what? What notification are you talking uh, about? Uh, hi, hi, guys. Are you? Hi. Are you? Thank you. Please save me. Everyone is throwing gifts to my face, and I do not want. I, they've been oh, tr- hey, thank everyone you keep supporting it. Zeus. Yeah, keep no! supporting Stop Zeus, everybody. Seven days guys, of party. Guys, everybody, hey, keep please. supporting Zeus. No, guys, I, they they bought they bought me they brought me a Nintendo Switch OLED. They bought me a That's Samsung great. phone. Good. No, they also Good. bought me an AirPods. No, Good. make them stop. Listen, no, that's perfect. the only that's way to perfect. make them stop is I'm going to steal them, and I don't think you want that. Right. That's the only I way mean, to make them stop. I, wait, oh, wait, I forgot to forgot to you put can't. you guys on the audio. Oh, okay, okay. We, we start from the top. <clears throat> okay. 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 Get. Thank you, everyone, for supporting Zeus. Yeah. On this Thank seven. you guys for no, supporting no, Zeus. No, no, partner. No, no. Yeah. Thank you for getting the Nintendo no, Switch OLED. No, Keep no, supporting no, Zeus. And the, what, what was the other thing? A Samsung uh, phone. Samsung phone. Was Samsung it, phone. It? OLED. AirPods. OLED Switch. Thank goodness OLED it's not switch, an yeah. iPhone. <sighs> Man, that was close. Oh, oh, they already did bought me an iPhone, actually. Oh, yeah, for trying. I, I mean, you was... need one for VTubing, but... I, true. I, I, Thank you, I everyone. Do, but... True. Yeah. Keep supporting steal Zeus. Them. Steal them. Roy, you can oh, steal yeah, them. Oh, yeah, I said the only, way that I, can, yep, yep. the only way that I can help with is if I steal I'll, them. I'll, I'll, so. I'll throw them all to you. <laughs> Listen, it's okay. I'll be Aphrodite <laughs> one day. <laughs> Listen, I'll be Aphrodite one day. We'll be, we'll be part of the same team, and it won't be yeah, stealing. Yeah. It'll just be sharing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. True, true, true. That is, that is true. That is very true. I, I honestly don't know what to do with half of these items. They're telling me to get an iPad. They're get, telling me to get an Why? Apple Watch. They're Why? telling me to get, I don't know. They like Apple, apparently. <laughs> I mean, hmm, Apple's okay, but but they have very good cameras. <laughs> they do. It's very true. But yeah, we're just waiting for you to uh, join in on on VNet. Yeah. And then- oh, yes, I'll yes, join yes. in the VNet. Let me let me just go over here. I the I, the reason why I went here I went here already is because I don't want them to throw any more stuff at me. Ah, uh, <laughs> you see, it does it does work out like that, you know, and we mm. we appreciate you coming here. Yes. Yes, we thank do. Thank you, thank you for coming in to save me, guys. Of course, of course. <laughs> yeah, no this, worries. This, yeah, this, sa- this save collab you. saved me. <laughs> save you with uh, yes. Power Rangers. Yes, yes. Yeah. Please do save mm-hmm. me with Power Rangers. Yes, absolutely. I would, I would love to be saved by Power Rangers. Yes. That's the only way we know how. Honestly, yes. and I, listen. I still have that same sub goal. I still have that. Hey, we get to four hundred subs. I'll save everybody with Power Rangers and Super Sentai Karaoke. Let's go. Yes, we are we eighty-eight away. Wait, are how, you, how are many you away? hosting? Uh, 87 away. 87? Hey, 87 hey. away. You're very close. Very close. Very hey, close. Chuck. Very, close. <laughs> very, very close. <laughs> uh, wait, Roy, you're hosting, right? I am. Yes. Okay. And then, yes. okay, that's it. And I'll just put the password. <gasps> Ophi, thank you for the support. I appreciate you. Um, I'm excited. Guys, you're going to see the Connor the Waffle video for the third time on this stream. Yes. Aren't you excited? Oh my god. Say yes. So... Please say yes. Yeah, please say yes. Yes. Please say yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. I am excited in a way that I have no idea what it means, but okay. See? Course. Also, yeah. uh, I'll give you guys a heads up. The only Power okay. Rangers, the only season of Power Rangers that I watched, or, okay. ty- or, or like type of Power is a Power Rangers Samurai. That's the only one I watched. Baby. Perfect. So this is going to be a clean slate. Baby. Oh. <laughs> Baby. Yeah. Oh, wonderful. No. Uh, is it 
it Western or is it Eastern? Just to be sure. I think Eastern. I don't think it matters, to be honest. Yeah, I, I genuinely don't think it does. RJ, thank you for a gifted sub. I appreciate RJ, it. RJ, thank All you right. so much. Now we just need okay. 800 something more. No, 86. Oh, it's not 87. Guys, I only need four. Guys, throw throw everything at Roy. Not to me, please. Don't, th don't throw Keep supporting at me. Don't, Zeus. Don't, 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 don't. Keep supporting Zeus. Zeus. No. I'm coming no. for you. Gosh, what is... <laughs> Hey well, everyone, just, what is this? God of War, it, you know. Zeus's chat. Yeah. What? That's no, so no. Okay. Why are you gay? No, don't do. Oh this no, stuff. I just, I was just curious. I didn't know what exclamation point throw. Oh my did. gosh. Okay. Whoa, that's okay, crazy. Wait, you guys are in here. Wow. I have to. That's uh, wild. Everybody's. Kane, don't do it to me. What? What do you mean? We're trying to support Zeus right now. We're not trying to support I know, me. But I'm just, you know, I, I just felt like, you know. <laughs> okay. Wait. Roy, Roy is also coming in. Oh gosh. <laughs> They got, everybody got jump scared. Oh, I saw God, that you joined. Studio. I'm just waiting yeah. for you to come in. I hope that it doesn't do the same thing that it did before, that I had to like close uh, close the collab and then restart it. Because like it took a little bit for Kane to get in. Mm -hmm, so, yeah. mm -hmm. Sorry, it's just because I'm so big. My you are apologies. very big. Don't ever apologize for all being good, big. All I like good. it big. Okay, there you go. Oh my gosh. Uh, we'll give it like another 30 seconds, and if, if Zeus doesn't get in, then I will close the collab and start it again. I'm having to like fix you guys because, oh my gosh, my mouse is not working. <laughs> oh, no. oh, Are you boy. saying that you need a new mouse? Whoa, no, that's no, crazy. No, stop, stop, stop. You guys, you guys, you guys, stop it. Stop gosh, it. Gosh, what is the most expensive <laughs> mouse that we can have? No, no, <laughs> very true. no, very true. No. You <laughs> heard her, guys. Like Support no. Zeus at no. twitch.tv slash Zeus Mythos. No. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, we have to recalibrate. Oh. I think Zeus is coming. Oh wait, in I think my my phone lost connection. Oh my gosh, what the fuck, phone? No. Okay, now hey, it's back. there's Zeus. Hi. Wait, give me a moment. My phone, my phone lost connection for some reason. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. It should. It should. Oh, no. Yeah. Give me a moment. <laughs> I'm I'm like how I lost again. Oh, I lost wait, connection no. too. So like. Wait, oh wait, now oh, it's catching up. Gosh. But like I was okay. just like glaring right. okay. at you for oh, a second. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, you're Zeus, you're a little close there. That's fine. Hi, yeah, you're everyone. the only one that's fine. I'm still having to like fix the. Oh gosh. Oh my God, Zeus! Wow, <laughs> I didn't realize you wanted to be so close. Wow. It looks like we're holding hands or something. New mouse? No, we're not getting a new mouse. I'm buying my own mouse. Kane, I'll literally hold more than your hand. Careful. Uh, okay. Okay. That's oh no! Am... It disconnected me from YouTube Studio. There we go. It was so okay. powerful. It... Kane, what are you doing? I don't know. I just kind of wanted to. Do you want to left out? Do you, do you want to be oh. on this side with us? No, no, no. It's fine. I just, I, I, n never mind. Never mind. You can be. Uh, we can all be no, on the no, right no, side. No, no, no. It's fine. It's but, fine. But I'm, but I'm offering if you want to be. <laughs> like, <laughs> if you want to. I, it's, no, it's just it's wow. Kane Kane hates us, Zeus. <laughs> Surprise, Zeus. Kane hates it's, us. It's, oh, oh my God. Kane hates us. Man, man, I can't man. believe this. Oh, I can't man. believe it. He's just bun phobic man. and uh, goddess phobic. Okay. All right. Damn. That's why I'll never be Aphrodite because Kane you, would hate Damn. me. I can't. Here we go. Here we go. Let's just. Okay. There you go. I didn't Hi. know you were like. Oh gosh. Okay. There we go. There we go. If you guys have any like screen share for me to uh to like live, I, as well, I will I'll do that. I will. But so yeah, before yeah, okay. before we go in. Before we go in, mm. I, I like how we're all clustered in a corner now, by the way. This is all fantastic. <laughs> it's great. It's not like there's a massive... I'll have you guys on a different corner on my end. You guys are right there on this oh, corner. Oh, <laughs> I'm letting you guys move around. So I'm like, yeah. I'm just like, let's go with the chaos. Let's go with the silly, mm -hmm. wild, wacky, inflatable, mm -hmm. arm-filling tube, man. The 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 thing that Kane and I, we kind of need to know, and, and you kind of already started talking about it a little bit. We want to know, specifically, the, the amount of knowledge you have about power. Yeah, let's, let's start off with what you do know. And you you said I, that you've only seen mm. some of Power Ranger Samurai, but what do you what yeah. do you actually know about Power Rangers? What do you know? I know that like there's mm. this uh, alien thing that they're going to. I I'm, I'm just I'm just basing it off of Samurai that I watched. There's sure. this alien thing that they're trying to fight against. There's also other Power Rangers that are in different colors. I know there's a gold one in Samurai. Okay. From what okay. I remember, a gold one. Okay. And okay. then they use a Megazord in which they combine like Voltron and then okay. defeat the enemy in every okay. episode. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. Not inaccurate, not bad, not bad, not, not bad. Yeah, not mm -hmm. inaccurate at all. Mm -hmm. Not bad, okay, not bad, okay. not bad. Okay. Take that as a win. Do, do mm -hmm. you know when the original season of Power Rangers takes place? Do you know how old no, the franchise actually. is? No, actually. No. It I is 30 years old. 
Mm. Oh my gosh. So we're going back to the wonderful year of 1993. Yes, we are. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. They use their powers to stop they intergalactic, stop intergalactic force, force, force fire. <laughs> <laughs> no, they start them. Trust me. They're just intergalactic rescue heroes. Absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think so. Rescue heroes. So glad yeah. you got it. I got you. I got you. No worries. No worries. Oh my so God. I think the video is going to explain pretty much everything, but that's good to know that you you are, for the most part, a Power Rangers newbie. Mm. Yeah. So this is going to be fantastic to teach you. Now, um, yeah. Kane and I have seen this video already, and yes. it's, it's why we want to show you. I've reached out to Connor the Waffle, who is the creator of it, and I'm going to share the link with you. Uh, but I will okay. share my Discord screen as well. That way we can all watch the same video. Yes, yes, um, yes. Okay, okay. I'm going to put it in that that, that group chat. Um, so um, Kane and I have watched this already, and then yes, I watched know. it with Poseidon as well. So this is the mm -hmm. third time I'm watching it, second time that Kane is watching it. But mm -hmm. it is just that good. It is genuinely a lot of it is filled with information that we know already, but will be perfect for you and yes. everyone else that is watching mm -hmm. that has no idea what we're talking about. Absolutely. Okay, okay. We're all here to be educated, chat. They are our professors for today. Exactly. Now, the important yes. thing that Kane and I want you to know is because we are very familiar and experienced with the franchise, if at any time you have questions, there is no stupid question. Genuinely. We know okay. this franchise. Okay. Please yes. ask us. Okay. This is a yeah. very silly franchise with a lot of history and a yeah. lot of lore on and off screen. So yeah. if nothing, mm -hmm. something doesn't make yeah. sense, please let us know. Yeah. Okay. And, and don't feel the need to hide in the corner every time. Okay. Listen, we get that we're very intimidating. I get that I'm like the same height as you and Kane dwarfs both of us. But you don't have to feel like you have to squish here away <laughs> in the corner. We promise it's not a cult. It's just a cult. Okay. Right. It's. You said that it's not a cult, but it's a cult. It's not it's, a cult. Uh, uh, morphing grid for less of yeah, a it's, it's the lack of a better word. Yeah. Anyway. Okay. <laughs> Why are you cuddling up in the corner? Don't worry about it. Listen, we're just trying to make sure that Zeus feels comfy <laughs> and welcome. And yes. we're here to be comfy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, let's get the the video over on my screen real quick. Um, I, I think I am going to have to. Okay, I have a video ready. We're gonna okay. have to decide where everyone's going. Zeus, are you are you gonna be like in the right corner like this? Uh, yeah. Okay. I mean, you can you can move me. I can I can I can. I was gonna say yeah. Here. Kane, you go. Yeah, you guys can move me. You, Kane, you go ahead to the left corner. I, I'm, I'm fine. Okay. And then we 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 sit down here. I was gonna say I'm gonna I'm gonna shrink myself a little bit. Blue do we can do. Yeah, blue 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 do no, we can. All right, so I'm gonna be down here. I will move you, Zeus. Then. Mm hmm. Just to be safe. Um, you control position. Oh my god! I can show her size for free. Everyone, no. come to Twitch.tv slash Royceano. You can see her thighs for free. I have the power. Look at the grippers. Anyway, okay. We're winning. We're winning. We're winning, we're, winning. We're winning so mm -hmm. much right now. We're winning so much. <laughs> All right, Zeus, I My have you gosh. in position because we're we're roughly the same size. So I have you in position now. <laughs> uh, all right, let's get the video up, and I'm gonna go ahead and pause my music, and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna blue skadoo now. Even though even though I I didn't say it earlier, you know, blue skadoo the weekend. Oh, I have your <laughs> I have everyone turned into a reactive. <laughs> I forgot. Definitely, definitely not scuffed today. We are uh, not scuffed today, chat. Whoa. Definitely not. No, no, no we're doing this on day. purpose. Yep. Whoa, that's on purpose. I that's, see. Mm -hmm. Listen, we hold on. We blue skidded too hard. Let me try again. Let me try we again. Did, Let me try did. again. Whew, hold on. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. What did I miss? Just <sighs> scuff. There, there's scuff. There's no, you know, there's no scuff. A, yep. There's, there's no, no scuff. scuff. Never mind. There's I no lied. scuff there, at there all. There was no. There was no scuff. There's no. There's no scuff at all. There was no scuff. No scuff. There's no. There's no scuff at all. At all. Okay. Let's. Let's. You know what? Hold on. Let me. No scuff today. Let me just, let me just, let me just take a look here. Let me just, hmm. I wonder what it could be. I wonder, hmm. Carry the two and the four. Hmm. You know, I, I, I think. Mm hmm. It's like this. Like this? Like this? Like this? Like this? Like this? Oh. Yeah, but there's nothing showing. Where's my what are we, Where's my monitor? What are we like thising? What? Yeah. I what like are we like thising? I like new, how huh? you're 
G gamer subs is blocking my eyes. I That's saw so that. Funny. Why is my monitor not showing up? Not the there. gamer so subs. Yeah, I'll, I'll turn that off. Hold on. <laughs> hey, why is my monitor not showing up? That's the other one. Oh, it is. It's just. I'm so stupid. No, you're not. I'm so stupid. Listen. No, you're not. Listen. More importantly, we got a raid. Uh, welcome in, Raiders. Hello, Raiders. Hi, Raiders. You are just Hello. in time. You are just in time. Welcome in, everybody. My name's Roy. I'll be your bunny host for this evening. I specialize in voice yeah. acting. And I do a bunch of collaborative chaos with my friends, like talking about Power Rangers for the Hello. 100 millionth time it ever. 100 millionth time. 100 and millionth many, time. many, many more. And many uh, more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, more importantly, tonight, we are teaching uh, Zeus all about the wonderful world of Power Rangers. So if you would like to know more, learn more, uh, experience the franchise with us, pull up a chair, kick up your feet, let's have some fun. Lou, thank you again mm -hmm. for the raid. I hope you're amazing. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Can you see it, Zeus? Um, The live. Okay. Give me a moment. Yeah. I'm going to have to pop this out. Sure. To not make it. Can we close this? Okay. Sure. Down. And then where's window capture? That's all right, Kane. Zeus hates us. I understand. No, it's fine. No, yeah, no, it's okay. Is your name, is that person's name Hentai Captain? Based. Pardon? It's pretty pog. It's pretty pog. It's pretty pog. That's all I'm saying. That's crazy. That's, uh, listen, I don't make the rules. I just make the rules. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Listen, all I'm saying, there's a, there's a few out there. There's a few out mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But Zeus, whenever you are ready and you are good. I am ready. Okay. Now, I'm not kidding when I say this. If you have a question or you need to say something, say it. Kane and I will, are going to be pausing this we video will drop a lot. everything and answer. Yeah. Okay, we, okay. we quite literally will. And I'm going to say this in my okay. chat and then pin it as well. Um, have questions about Power Rangers? Ask now. Mm. Ask at any time. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And pin until after the stream. Great. All right, three, two, one. Let's go. go. Let's go. A TV series in Japan. Oh, God. It's still going strong there to this go. day. The series follows a team of teenagers Ginga the ability to transform into colorful spandex wearing superheroes oh, I love known it. as Super Sentai. Yeah. Together, they must defeat the evil all while balancing their normal human lives. I love it already. The series made its debut so in 1975 <laughs> with Himitsu Sentai Go Ranger. Go Ninja. Go Ninja. Go Ranger. After Go Ranger, tons of Super Sentai okay. teams would get introduced to the world. I love this franchise yeah, so Dino much. Man, Denji Man, Mask Man, Five Man, just to name mm -hmm. a few. Mm -hmm. Five Man. Five Man. But the Sorry. 16th team of Super anyway. Sentai to air in 1992 <laughs> would be a oh. special one, at least for us Americans. Absolutely. Kyoryu Sentai Zhu Ranger. Familiar. That's because to the rest of the world, this team would forever be known as the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Oh, the Mighty Morphin. So welcome, mm -hmm. welcome to the beginning of the franchise. Now, this now. is the very, very first season of Power Rangers. Yep. Okay. And uh, as the little introduction was kind of telling you, um, Super Sentai is the parent series that started in Japan. Uh, mm -hmm. Because Power Rangers is a kind of a Frankenstein of a project. And I'm, I'm sure he'll go into this like a little bit more. But just, just so, you know, while Kane and I are getting really excited, we can, we can right. kind of explain this a bit. Um, okay, okay. So Super Sentai has been going since 1975. Right. And Power Rangers... Okay. Uh, came over in 1993. So and Mighty Morphin mm. Power Rangers takes it after Jew Ranger, which is the 16th Super Sentai at this point. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yep. So they're taking source material from that and adapting it into basically uh, an American uh, show mm. uh, and uh, usually dubbing over like how anime dubs, uh, dubbing right. over any of the scenes where like the Rangers are fighting. That way, you know, it's all air quotes original footage. So. Right. Mm, okay, As we okay. get more into it, you will um, understand what we're talking about. But Power Rangers, specifically the very first season, uh, is, or I suppose, the first three seasons. We'll, we'll get into that. But is mm. a very unique mm -hmm. uh, 
project that is never quite seen ever again. Like the way that it's put together, you will understand what we're talking about as we keep going. But that's not something that's ever been attempted by anyone else ever. <laughs> mm. Okay, okay. Very unique. Very, very unique and very, it's very um, unique. Yes. Very hard to explain to some people as well. Mm -hmm. As well. Yeah. yeah. Making their debut on August 28th, 1993. Which is Power the show Rangers was created Day. by Haim Saban mm. and Shuki Levy. The concept of the show would be pretty unique. Create a TV go. show that Very young unique. kids would find entertaining. A group of friends living their daily Got high school life while needing to occasionally save the world. Or KB Toys, now, whatever it was. show would Goodness. normally be pretty expensive to create. Yes. You gotta make set pieces, choreograph mm -hmm. fight scenes, and create cool special effects. That could take so long. But... What if all of that footage already existed? Wow, that's crazy. And you just crazy concept. So wild. took it and dubbed it over. God, every <laughs> time I see it. these, every <laughs> time I see these videos, oh, I get the wave of nostalgia. I remember, because like I never, I never had the green with evil ones, but like, man. The only one I ever owned was Food Fight. That's the only one of these I've ever owned. I think the only one I had was the, and you and I have talked about this, the one that had like the cluster of episodes. It was oh, like, yeah. there was, there was, cause there was one for Mighty Morphin as well, but there was also one that like had like, it had like Forever Red and Countdown to Destruction and like, like the, the big ones, but yeah. Like anime. Mm -mm. Well, there you go. Now half the show is already done. Perfect. Well, after Saban and Levy put together a quick little video of what Power Rangers would look like. They were given the green light to create their show. Yeah! Yeah! I love Power Rangers so oh, much. I, I loved it as a kid, teenager, and chefs. even the adult I am today. Thank you for the 100 bits. Aww. Keeping up with the yeah! Because it's something that just has the softest spot in my heart. And today, I wanted to go through a nostalgic journey through the entirety of Mighty Morphin yeah! Power Rangers. The entirety? So I hope you can join oh, me on this little adventure. And starting with... The the huge benefit that we get from watching this too is because mm. at the time that Mighty Morphin came out, um, there were a lot of games that came out with it too. Right. So like oh. uh, on the Super Nintendo and the Genesis, there were several games that actually used the music from the mm. show. Right. And because of that, you actually get to hear it in this video a lot because the video game music isn't <laughs> copyrighted. It's on copyright. Is it? Uh, co it isn't? Yes. No. <laughs> a, lot, a lot of the original music uh, that Power Rangers used, yeah. used my, uh, is, is, is DMCA. So you can't use any of it. So you get all the video game Super Nintendo music. Which is fine. Oh, and safe. Okay, which okay, is great. Okay. Yeah. Today's lovely sponsor, Play Asia. Play Asia. We do love Play Asia. Play Asia. Play. We do. Listen. Shout out to Play Asia. You know we 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 love Obake Pam around yes, here. Yes, we do. Absolutely. <laughs> Obake Pam, one of my favorite people of all time. Please go ahead and check out Play Asia if you've not already. Get your imports. Get your new releases. Get your figures. Get your voice packs. Get your fun stuff there and support Obake Pam when you can. From the game that were never released outside of Japan. Like these plushies, okay, I think, locking on the right, switch game. I, I talked, talked about. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I already yeah, talked right. about it. Yeah, there's no code Roy. That's gamer subs. Day of the <laughs> or or my coffee <laughs> sponsor, whichever you prefer. Coming across a massive space dumpster, they unknowingly open huh? it, unaware of its con. Okay. A space dumpster. A what? space dumpster. Yeah. A space dumpster. Yeah. What do you? You've never heard of a space dumpster you never before. <laughs> Is it, is it a dumpster from space, or did what? they throw all of space in that dumpster? That what do you mean? It's right there. Can you see it? That's that's the yeah. dumpster. I can't, yeah. That, oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, that's a, yeah. all right. That's okay. a that's a space dumpster. It's a space dumpster. Uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Good. Good. Mm. I'm glad you understand. Mm -hmm. Where it's revealed that the evil Rita Repulsa <laughs> was stored inside for ten thousand years and is ah, to conquer. Earth. After ten thousand years, I'm free. Earth. Yes. Freedom! <laughs> the local youth center is where we'll that is so character. really quick that's a quote that's a very very commonly uh quoted because it's mm. in the theme song um i don't think we could play it without it getting dmca Probably but that's not. literally the first line in the theme song mm. here I've got uh, after ten thousand years i'm free it's time to conquer earth you've probably so i just posted the gif in our chat you've probably seen that gif before yes on the is it? In the small live stream chat. Oh, okay. Wait. <laughs> I, see that. I should probably open that. <laughs> yeah, right there. Oh my gosh, right. There. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you've seen that. Okay. 
I have. Yeah. Good. Just making sure. There's Kimberly, mm -hmm. the valley girl gymnast who loves the mall. Zach, the cool and suave that. dancer. Jason, the martial artist with a good heart. Boom, boom. Billy, the nerd. <laughs> and Sorry, sorry. Listen, sorry. I'm getting, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm getting ahead of myself. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Sorry. Sorry. Don't listen. Bring on the. <sighs> okay. Kane. Anyway, Kane. Don't worry about it. Good heart. Billy uh -huh. the nerd and Trini, the friend of Kimberly and Billy the nerd. translator for Billy when he speaks nerd. Yeah. Despite coming from vastly different backgrounds and lifestyles, they're all really good friends with each other. We also get introduced to the best character yes! in the entire do, do, Power Rangers franchise. Yes! Bulk and Skull. Two friends who start off as generic bullies to the Rangers, but will have the most satisfying character arcs in all of media. It's which true. which we uh -huh. just got to the point. So Connor has made uh three videos now. Uh mm -hmm. he's made one for the I'm sorry, four. Three? He, he's four. Made, he's made it for I forgot we combined Zeo and Turbo. Yeah. So we we've done this four times or three three times. Uh, right. well, I guess I've done it four. But mm. so yes. so there's <laughs> Mighty Morphin, which is three seasons. Well, three and a half technically, but we're gonna say three. Three seasons. Mm -hmm. Then there's Zeo, then there's Turbo, and then mm -hmm. there's In mm -hmm. Space. And mm -hmm. Bulk and Skull are in all of those and have a consistent Whoa. character growth arc that like culminates at the end of in space yes so it's amazing everything okay, that okay. they do starting from this point on is going to make so much sense by the end i don't know if you're ever going to experience that for yourself <laughs> hopefully, hopefully you, you do because it's very satisfying um mm -hmm. but it, you'll see you'll see their arcs throughout this this uh video I'll just start okay, a group okay. watch of Power Rangers in the friend Discord and just be like, "All right, guys, we're starting over the entire franchise. Who wants to watch with me?" From the from the episode one, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> episode one. And for those of you that don't know, uh, if you do want to watch Power Rangers and you do want to get into the franchise, once Hasbro took over, probably the biggest W that happened for this franchise yes. is that mm. they put almost the entirety of it for free. On their Prior YouTube to channel. this, it used to be oh. on Netflix. And, yep. you know, you have to pay for Netflix. You don't have to pay for uh, YouTube. Yep. Well, maybe the internet connection. But beyond yeah. that, uh, <laughs> you can watch or all premium. the for free. That also oh, works. Premium, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Premium, yeah. <laughs> for free. You can free. watch all the for free on for YouTube. Free. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, use the McDonald's Wi-Fi. That's fine. Go watch Go watch the entire Pioneer's franchise there. Easy. Mm -hmm. For now, though, they're just dumb bullies who usually end up getting their comeuppance right. almost instantly. You don't have to say dumb. Anyway, That's Rita mean. eventually <laughs> makes herself at home on the moon and causes an earthquake back on Earth, where we cut to an underground base ran by Zordon and Alpha. Zordon is an all-knowing and powerful oh lizard that takes on the form hey, of a disembodied head. Listen, what, what's wrong? Alpha. What's wrong, Zeus? You got something against Zordon? I, yeah. No, no, it's more so like I got reminded of the Curse of Cowardly Dog head from that. Oh, I think that's where they got the idea from. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, no, it wouldn't surprise me if that, that was uh, yeah. picked up from this. Absolutely. Oh, okay. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Earthquake mm -hmm. caused by Roy's hips. Huh? Pardon? Hey, Listen, yo? if anyone's causing earthquakes out here with their hips, it's... Well, well, probably me, but Zeus, listen, Zeus also no, causes... No, I, I, I don't cause listen. earthquakes. I don't. Okay. Poseidon's not but here. I can't pick like on her. a lightning bolt at the ground? I did, yes. And it usually sets everything on fire, but I don't want to do that. I feel like that's like kind of like an earthquake. I feel like it's like exactly really the same. It's not an earthquake. It's exactly the same. Everyone knows that your hips, in fact, do not lie. Oh, Shakira. <laughs> Shakira. <laughs> Shakira, Shakira. It's basically mm -hmm. exactly Shakira. the same as starting an earthquake. <laughs> <laughs> Poseidon would know. No, your, well, yours, yours would definitely start an earthquake, not mine. Yours too. Oh my goodness. We'll cause oh, an yeah. earthquake together and then put Kane okay, in between fine. it, I guess. Okay. <laughs> robotic helper that tries his best. They're informed of Rita's return. Yeah, he's trying his best. tells Alpha to find five overbearing and over-emotional humans. Damn. Why mm. those were the qualifications, I guess we'll never know. Huh? We don't worry we about still it. Don't know. Yeah, we still don't know. ...and summoned to the command center and are told that they can become Power Rangers to fight off evil and save the world. Save the world. Naturally, Man. when a giant head yeah. tells you all of that, you're not going to listen and probably just leave. I, I, I would too. Which is exactly I what our wouldn't. heroes do. <laughs> heroes, I would huh? probably stay, honestly. Well, I could be a superhero. Yeah. yeah. Which act as her general grunt soldiers. The Rangers try to fight back, but are ultimately overpowered. Yeah! That is until... Yeah. It's time! ...remembers that Zordon said that these power morphers would give them powers. Thus, 
It's Morphin Time! Yeah! It's Morphin Time! They say that in the first episode for some reason. It's only the most popular catchphrase they made. They didn't the know yet. The shout dinosaur names at the top of their lungs, they didn't transforming know. them into yeah. Power Rangers. Where they now have the power to fight off putties in full glorious Japanese footage fashion. So you, play the theme song you can throughout, which I can't play oh, for you sadly because we YouTube about copyright will obliterate me. I can mm -hmm. use the Super Nintendo rendition though, which yep. is actually really good. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> this is what kids instantly so, fell in love. Also, just just fun thing to note. So mm. you know how we mentioned before, Zeus, how uh, Power Rangers uses Japanese footage. Right. Yeah. Anytime you see them in the suits like this, it is very safe to assume that it is Japanese footage. For season oh. one. For season one, especially. Um, you you can almost instantly tell because of the quality of the footage. Yeah. When it switches over to the Japanese footage, it gets ever so slightly blurry. Um, mm. You can tell it's not nearly as crisp. And also the choreography is... Much, much better. And the suits look better. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that's essentially what happens there. Yeah. So as soon as they morph, it cuts to Japanese footage, and then they, mm. they demorph back into their civilian forms, and they cut back to American footage. Um, oh, okay. So every time you see them in suits, it's just going to be ADR voice acted. Yep. Okay. Which so it's it, like the production of this is like incredibly cheap for that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it's so it's funny because Kane said... You know, like the ADR of it, and and obviously you being mm. in in VTubing now, uh, I'm sure you're familiar with some some voice actors now in the industry. Yeah. So yes. some very prominent voice actors got their start in Power On Rangers. Power Rangers. Oh. So are you familiar with Johnny Young Bosch? Uh. What's, Ichigo what role did they have? Ichigo uh, and Bleach. Oh, okay, Luigi yeah. Britannia. Yeah, Luigi oh, yeah, yeah, yep, yep. uh, mm -hmm. Nero and Nero and Kami. In uh in uh but, 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 Devil May Cry yeah you Narukami yeah. good one good one yeah Persona mm -hmm. Four so he's the mm -hmm. second Black Ranger oh um, but we will get to that when we get to that but right okay. now it is not Johnny Young Bosch. it's not Johnny Young Bosch um, yet it will be yes. we'll point him out don't worry okay okay um but right away we have two that are very prominent which is Barbara Goodson um mm. uh, who's I I always forget the name of the character but she's the main male character in um uh, FLCL. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. That's always the one that Luckily. I remember her as. Yeah. Mm -mm. And then uh, Richard Horvitz is Alpha, uh, who is uh, Raz and Psychonauts. Uh, he's Invader Zim. He's Invader Zim. He's Billy and Billy and Mandy. Uh, I don't know the uh, name of the character, but in... Billy? Yeah, he's Billy and Billy oh, and yeah. Mandy. Billy and Mandy? Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is that range, though. <laughs> what is... What? Oh, she's well. Uh, Barbara Goodson is Laharl from Disgaea. That's true. That's true. I always forget that. Mm. Oh um, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Anyway, Love let's it. continue. The martial arts and colorful suits, the rock and roll music, summoning the Megazords, which are these. There you go. Robots. You got that right. And how could young kids yeah. not love this? Anyway, the team eventually save the day and return back to the command center, where they right? officially accept their roles as Power Rangers. They and did promise it. promise to always protect the world. They saved the world. It's an insanely solid start to the series. Yeah. I don't want to go too in-depth right now and give my thoughts on the characters, actors, and arcs, so I'll save that for when we reach the end of Season 1. Right. For now, though... Which will be a while. This is a this is a That's three a hour while. long video yeah. and we're already yeah. forty minutes into It'll the stream. Take a while. So yeah, mm -hmm. I, I just I, I know I warned you ahead of time, but I'm not kidding. Six minutes into video, forty minutes into stream. <laughs> yep. Oh, I just realized the video wasn't this. max volume too. I'm gonna turn that up. Oh yeah. Oh, crank that up to eleven. To I got it. Two. High five. Yeah. With the gang hanging out at the rec center, oh. which acts as a juice bar. Oh, perfect. He he answered that. So a lot of the their off time you're going to see is takes place in this juice bar, which is weird because it it doubles as a martial arts dojo. It <laughs> uh, community events like that happens within the town rec center. Everything. Yeah, like everything that, okay. happens in this juice bar, and it is also connected to the high school. What? Yeah. I I think it is like pair, yeah. There's like weird transitional shots where they'll like walk out of here and they'll be in what looks like a school hallway. So it's like, yeah. I don't know if they ever confirmed it, whether it was or was not connected. We kind of just play around with it. Like just, just, you know, it's near the high school. Okay. I'll take your word for it. I'll take your yeah. word for it. 
I don't know okay, if okay. The, I don't know if the the interior of the school was ever used, but the outside of Angel Grove High School that you'll see uh, probably in a bit uh, is Ulysses Grant High School in Los Angeles. Mm. Um, I I've only seen pictures of it. And I think they just changed around like the lettering outside, but yeah, uh, they shot everything in L.A. Yeah, in one set. Uh, it, it's like sets. it's like three or four sets. Yeah, yeah. They, 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 like at least for like where they're having their off time, it's usually one or maybe two at most. Yeah, it's it's usually <laughs> yeah. not a lot, but you can always tell when it's like, oh, we're back here again. Oh, we're back here again. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're back here again. So mm -hmm. car ran by. Okay, Ernie. okay. Jason's climbing a rope because he's the exercise guy until Bulk and Skull show guy. up to cause some trouble. Where Jason pretty much tells Bulk he can't climb the rope because he's too fat. Where he wow. then proceeds to prove Jason right by attempting to climb it, <laughs> destroying the oh my god! And oh my god! <laughs> but remember, yeah. Bulk and Skull are the bullies here. Yeah. This is also yeah. where we get to see Trini and Gotta Billy's friendship really be at its cutest, with Billy constantly being excited, talking with big words no one oh. else understands. And we should we should probably mention this. Billy, the the guy with all the watches in his hand, is mm -hmm. probably the smartest one of the smartest humans in this entire universe mm -hmm. of Power Rangers. Um, at this time, I, I'm sure he'll go over it, but he's created communicators, which are the watch things, which allow them to talk with each other. Uh, uh, souped up walkie talkies essentially. Yep. Um, oh. But these communicators also allow them to teleport wherever they want. What the um, fuck? Yeah. <laughs> He literally oh. made a teleporter. In like one night after they they became power. Yep. What the? Fuck? Yeah, I made five they, of them. He also creates a flying car, but that'll come later. We will get we will get to that when yeah. we get to that. Um, okay. Yeah. But yeah, he's one of the smartest individuals in the Power Rangers universe. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and for like no reason, and kind of like the video is saying right now, um, he's he's very much like relegated yeah. to being the nerd right now. And mm -hmm. Trini, who is who's our Yellow Ranger, uh, is very much relegated to being his kind of like translator, translator for tech speak. Okay. Um. And and before someone points it out, because I'm sure somebody is like, isn't it oh, weird yes. that the Black Ranger's black and the Yellow yes, Ranger yes, is yes. Asian? They didn't realize that until a couple so, episodes in. Uh, oh. Tony Oliver, one of the original executive producers of Power Rangers, actually brought this up in an interview saying that they didn't quite realize what they had done until the episodes had gotten to like maybe episode five or six. Yeah. Um, mm. And <laughs> by that point, they had already received a bunch of complaints that, oh, yeah, the Black Ranger is black and the, the Yellow Ranger is yellow. And then the preppy girl is in pink and then, you know, a whole bunch of things. Yeah. But mm -hmm. just know that that was an accident. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, okay. Except for Trini, where she's playing translator and putting Billy's words into layman's terms. The plot then gets a little Japanese, with <laughs> Finster creating a skeleton monster yeah. that Rita then puts see, into- You can kind of see, like, the difference in the footage, right? Yeah. So, yeah. That, that'll be, like, the easy tell point. It, it gets a lot easier to tell as we go on, like, oh, that okay. just- that's To a toy oof. spaceship that drives Like, around. all these Japanese totally people just showed up out of nowhere. Yeah. Japanese, yeah. Japanese streets. It's just so yeah, weird. The, yeah. This yep. little spaceship is clearly Japanese. It even has, like, the <laughs> Japanese flag on it. Yeah, the left. <laughs> yeah. And you'll see that a lot, because, like, again, you know, Super Sentai is in Japan, and it's, re yes. like, real world Japan. So there's there's going to be even several shots where we see Tokyo Tower. Yep. So Oh my god. <laughs> we have to assume that it's Los Angeles, California. Well, Angel Grove. It, yeah. <laughs> it's I think okay. I think we've at least established that it's West Coast America, yeah. but I don't think they mm -hmm. ever say California, but yeah, it's, they never it's LA. Quite say. It's just Angel Grove, yeah. which is essentially on the coast yep. from what we assume. Yep. Mm -hmm. footage mm -hmm. that never gets brought up again in the episode. The gang are told to check out the scene oh, yeah. where they get attacked it by doesn't. putties. A pretty long fight scene. Oh my god, it's time. The Rangers are still yeah. getting their butts whipped by the putties. It makes I'm not going to say anything. The Rangers are still Garrett, is there, scary for some 90s thing. wonkiness. It's just funny looking back since in future episodes, the Rangers will pretty much make quick work of the putties, even unmorphed. Jason, mm -hmm. Zack, and Kimberly do this. I don't know what, what the fuck is that? What? Teaches that move. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. What? Let me just. Let me just. Running. Kimberly do this. What? <sighs> what? 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 Huh? <laughs> huh? 
I will defend Power Rangers for a lot of things. And for many people, this is what people love, the cheesiness of the franchise. This is what I personally don't like. I personally do not like this. So the the thing the thing that we can mention for this, because there is still some goofiness in the future with this kind of thing. Yeah. Uh Um, Power Rangers is so new and so under budgeted at this moment um, mm-hmm. that they uh, they don't really have stunt choreography, like proper stunt choreography. And you'll see oh. that as we go on. You'll yeah. see that definitely as we go on. Yeah, okay. yeah. It, it is um, it's goofy. It's goofy. Yeah, ancient goofy. ranger technique passed down from generations. Yeah. <laughs> Anytime you see any of the the American actors or just like for whatever reason, if there is American suit footage, you will notice it's not not very good. Yeah. We don't yeah, okay. we don't start getting like really good fight choreography until the end of season one and mm-hmm. and then into season two, and that's only unmorphed. Yes. Um and we'll okay. we'll point it out because it's actually like a massive like turning point. And again, mm-hmm. we'll we'll point it out. And I'll I'll yes. I'll risk a little bit of um cough cough DMCA just so you can hear some of the music. Okay, this, okay. I don't oh, know yes. what karate school teaches that move. Billy's <laughs> running away and Shrini needs to overcome her fear Ooh, of heights. Just because I saw somebody say it in, in chat. Yes. So it doesn't it was not shot in New Zealand yet until yet. Power Rangers Wild Force. Technically, technically. Oh wait, no, I was thinking of the movie, but the movie was in Australia. Yes. Um but yes, so uh, not until Power Rangers Ninja Storm was Power Rangers shot in New Zealand. Mm-hmm. Okay. So up until 2002? Was that Wild Force? 2003? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So like 10, 10 years. 10 years yes. of Power Rangers were shot in Los Angeles, and then they switched to New Zealand because it's way cheaper to shoot there. It's and, way, way cheaper, mm. and there's a lot more scenery they can yeah. use, uh, tax, and other monetary things. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and... They are now done in uh, New Zealand. Mm-hmm. So uh, the nice. most recent season that they filmed there, uh, they said was their last. And I think they said that they were coming back to the U.S., which I don't mm. particularly I don't... understand why. Yeah. Um, But hey, listen, I'm down. Yeah, whatever. Sure. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> if it yeah. works, it works. It I suppose. Works. It works. It works. It's to help mm-hmm. Billy, which was brought up briefly during the rope climbing at the beginning of the episode. Oh, yeah. She's the right Rangers heights. then. You become Power Rangers because it's a lot easier to fight that way. Yeah. And then the plot just Ooh, goes off the suddenly an amusement park behind them <laughs> appeared out of nowhere. Rangers okay. Super aware on how to inter- <laughs> so he's he's saying it right now, but yeah, um, because this was like the, the first type of show of its kind, they didn't really know how to write plots properly of like having that transition of like, okay, well they're in a bunch of rocks and like, okay, well now we need to use other footage that exists somewhere else. Right. How do we do it? Just do it. And don't bother do explaining it. why. Yeah, exactly. Just do it. Just put, just put it in there. Slap it in. Slap oh, it in the other thing. Come on. Actually, yeah. kind of on that same note, uh, I don't know if you've quite realized it yet, based on the limited footage that he's shown, but the Yellow Ranger in the Japanese footage is actually male. Um, when oh. they brought it over yep. to America, uh, they obviously gave the role to Trini, who is a uh, female. Uh, in a lot of Super Sentai franchises, they like to regulate females with a skirt. So it's just it's distinguishable what their, you know, what their gender is. Um, this is one of those instances where the Yellow Ranger does not have one, but is still a female in the show. Yep. Um, mm. There's been a lot of weird references. I don't know if anyone has seen in chat the 2017 Power Rangers movie, but there's a slight nod to that saying it's like, wow, I really like the Yellow Ranger. She was so cool. How or do you he know was it was so a girl? Cool. Yeah. He was so cool. Yeah. How do you know it's a boy? Yeah. Or how he was so cool. How do you know it was a boy? And there, there's little nods here and there to like kind of poke fun at it. Also yep. in Japanese, the Yellow Ranger's name is boy. B-O-I. It's very funny. So very, very on the nose. Yeah. <laughs> very on the nose. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, he was also a male in the uh, original Japanese footage. So every time you see the Yellow Ranger in show, it's Trini technically, but male uh, stunt. Exactly. Okay. All the right. Japanese footage into the English plots because the Power Rangers then go to a carnival for some reason. There it goes. It's just like you said. Teleported into yeah, the yeah. teleportation. Nothing. Where they then fight a giant knight. Like what? Where did this yeah. come from? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Using whatever footage they have as opposed to what might make sense. The team then saves the day and scares Trini into climbing up the rope to overcome her fear. 
Yeah. Even she already yeah. Did that in the episode. Thanks, guys. Teamwork. Here, Trini and Kimberly are trying to get signatures on a petition to shut down the city dump that's polluting the town. That's crazy. Everyone's on board except Bulk and Skull, who are being obnoxious. Skull even crushing a can and lobbing it at Trini's head like, Jesus, what a dick. <laughs> Listen, the 90s were a wild time, okay? Yeah. The 90s were like basically the Wild West, all right? Yeah. But still, throwing a can at a... They could get away just, uh, with a lot of stuff, yeah. Trust me, that is like very minor comparatively to some of the stuff that happens in the show. So, oh my yes. God. Yeah, yes, just keep, yes, it, yes. Keep, keep, keep an eye out. All right. <laughs> this time. The monster in this episode is a minotaur that's pretty strong. The name of the episode is Teamwork, which kind of implies the episode should be about the gang not cooperating and needing to learn to work together. But no, they're on the same page the entire episode. It's yep. kind of weird. <laughs> Teamwork in this episode, though, comes from the Minotaur being too strong and the Zordon giving the Rangers new weapons. Yep. Where they can properly beat the crap out of him and even combine the weapons together to make a blaster. Teamwork, mm -hmm. man. What the fuck? Listen, it just, to the guys sell toys. Now you understand the primary oh! purpose of the show to sell toys. Combining weapons is something that's very common in Super Sentai as well. Mm -hmm. So they'll sell... Uh, they'll uh, sell a bunch of individual toys that eventually combine into one big one. It's similar in fashion to the Voltron Megazord that you were referring to earlier. Oh, okay, okay. Yep. Okay, that makes sense. Exactly. School where the principal mm -hmm. sees the mess that Trini and Kimberly left after dumping Bulk and Skull in the trash. And his first instinct is to, like, yell at the kids who are trying to save the environment for making a mess. What blows my mind more yeah, don't is worry that, about that how has the janitor not cleaned this up yet? Yeah, uh, it's, listen, it's okay. That's true. We start off with Jason okay. attempting to break the school bench press record, which is like a thousand and eight reps, which is literally impossible. I am not kidding. You, the viewer, right now, <laughs> take a pillow and lift it over your head just a hundred times. You got this, right, Zeus? Feel. Let me know in the comments. The bench record was also apparently created by Bulk. That's genuinely scary. Maybe Bulk is a force to be reckoned with. Yeah, honestly. Jason doesn't break the record at first because Ernie lost count. Bulk then tries to bully Jason, which, again, if he can bench press over a thousand times, I'd actually be kind of scared. I would, too. <laughs> Although, he always falls victim to slapstick. Oh, my gosh. Rita summons a Sphinx monster, and the Rangers fight it. That's about it, really. Yeah, that's not really a yeah. plot with it. It's to the main plot. Like, you might think Rita wants to separate Jason from the group since his confidence might be low after not breaking the record, or Jason going off on his own to prove that he has what it takes to be a leader. Both of those things are kind of... Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> oh, it's this episode! Yeah! It is! Wait, I hold got on. Kane, let, me got Kane. let me let me find it. Hold on. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh what what's oh no? Okay. It's it has become a very popular quote amongst us. Yeah. I'm sure you between heard Kate us and say I. It. Yeah, I'm And sure that and why would you do that? It on uh our mario kart streams uh -huh. uh, okay i found it let me just find the time code okay um oh this is so funny uh what in the world copy the link hello surprise oh surprise it's it's their browser okay there we okay. go okay let me find the time code you put it with the time code. Ad. I got it. Oh my god, it is literally just the YouTube. <laughs> oh, yeah. yes. Yeah, it's, it's literally on their YouTube. We're not kidding. Okay. All right, we'll go go play this. You ready? All right, okay. here we go. Ah, Rita, really? Chase is in big trouble. Why? What's up? Rita has him. Oh, no. You guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. There is, is not a care is, in his voice. Oh, there, no. there is not. He doesn't care. He's like, oh no. Oh no. Why? What's up? Rita has him. Oh no. <laughs> there is so. When I played this he for doesn't... my community, <laughs> we had a whole bunch of reasons for what he would much rather be doing. <laughs> and it's the, the layers of this are just so funny because K Jason at this point has been kidnapped, right? Under attack, uh -huh. all yeah. alone. And so yeah. everyone comes up, hey, Jason's in trouble. Why, guys? What's up? <laughs> Rita has Not, him. You know, he could, he could have said sir. anything else. He literally so could have done. What do you mean he's in trouble? No, no. Yeah. 
There's, what? there's, what? No, yeah, wrong? there's no urgency. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> There's no urgency there. He, like he's not scared oh, for no. his friend. He's there, just like, oh no. There you go. And and again, th this is probably gonna happen a lot during today of of Kane and I just being like, welcome to our inside joke that is now oh, no. to three people. <laughs> yes, oh, I'm so God. happy that you it, know this now. <laughs> oh, I, my God. It, she'll have to come back for a Zio one so we can do the. Why would you do that? <laughs> why would you do that? Okay, okay. <laughs> that, but not really. Oh, the episode man. focuses more on the individual rangers being able to now summon their own megazords by themselves. Yeah! Bring on the power sword. The episode ends... <sighs> do, you wanna, do you wanna talk about bringing on the power sword? <laughs> is, is, that, is that just a giant sword that the megazord has because of their combined power? Yes! Okay. Very so, astute, Zeus. Okay. Very astute. Jason... Mm -hmm. <sighs> <laughs> the actor in the show, mind you, he gets better as the show goes on, sort of. But kind of. he has a very stereotypical meathead way of saying his lines. Um, <laughs> to the point where it comes off as, <clears throat> oh, guys, I saw the power sword! Oh! It's very, oh, it's no. very throaty. Oh, it's no. very oh, meatheady. Oh, no. Yeah, it's so funny. Oh. Um, what is his other quote? Hey, horse face, we're gonna send you back to the barn! Ah! Yeah, oh li God, literally no. that. Literally that. 100% oh, spot on. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is it? Pa pack sacker? Rat sacker? <laughs> send you that was pretty spot in. on. Everyone is saying, yeah, we'll see my chat. Spot on. So now you know, oh now you know inside joke number two, which is, Burn the power sword! Burn the power sword! Ah! <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm like getting that. I'm getting to know so many jokes now. <laughs> so I, I mean gang. Jason isn't quite a meathead exactly. Mm. He's not exactly a himbo. But for some reason they have him do this. <laughs> I don't they know. Give him a that's himbo own, voice. Yeah, I don't know whether or not that's his choice or that's a direction he was given, but that's mm. literally how he sounds. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love it. Gotta love oh, it. Oh gosh. <laughs> With Jason Gosh. breaking the bench press record. Oh, he did it! Being genuinely upset and accidentally flying into the cake. Well, then kick a man while he's down, I guess. Listen, that looks like a <laughs> great hey, cake. No. I'm just saying. With Billy trying to learn how to dance, but he has two left feet. Poor guy. Eh. We also get introduced oh, well. to a deaf girl named Melissa. She's Kimberly's friend who also takes part in dance class. She messes up during the lesson, and some girl gives her shit. Like Jesus, she's deaf. Give her some leeway. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> really speak to Melissa with sign language is really cool to see in a kids show in the '90s. Rita then representation. I was about to say something that yeah. Power Rangers actually did well, even back in the '90s, is yeah. they they have a lot of really good representation of real world issues. Like there's uh, uh, people people being deaf and showing ASL. Yeah. Um, mm. I don't I don't think they tackle racism really until like God, I want to say like Dino Charge. <laughs> A lot of a lot of mm -hmm. racism uh, addressed in the show is kind of addressed in the way that Power Rangers is more or less a quote unquote perfect world, yeah. um, where everyone is equal, everyone is you know, and so um, that's something that equality, racial equality, I think, is very interesting handled yeah. here rather than Super Sentai because everyone is Japanese on that cast. Rather than here, you can have literally anyone and yeah. they can be a power ranger and that's one of power rangers biggest strengths is that anyone can be a power ranger you could be a power ranger zeus yeah the mighty morphin mythos yeah. rangers <laughs> you could be the, the, wait the... i kind of like that mighty morphin mythos rangers hold on a second here i might be i might be cooking hold on a minute here you might be cooking something here. twink representation for it. yeah 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 hold on a second yo wait did you say fan artist huh fan artist i mean what? Yeah. It could, there could be fan art for that. Oh, I mean, there be. is of Poseidon and I when we did this. I haven't seen that actually. Can you send it over? Uh, let me see if I can find it. Hold on. It's like from forever ago. Um, let's see if I can find it. Take your time. It's all good. Oh, I found it. Well, that actually, did not take me very long. Hold on. Um, nice. Kami Kami Sentai Mythos Ranger. Kami Myth, Sentai Mythos Mytho Ranger. Kami Sentai Mythos oh, Ranger. Kami, Kami Sentai. Wait, that looks so good. What? And then someone did like a manga of it of like us fighting putties. 
<laughs> Yo, that is so good. It's so it's so funny. Yeah, so I'm I'm pink because I like pink and Poseidon. I love how, I love how they really showed your your ass there. Right? Yeah, they like turn oh, me to yeah, the yeah. side. They're like, hey, here's your really fat ass. I was like, oh, thanks, I appreciate it. That's your pose. Yeah, and yeah, everything. Yeah, clearly, clearly. That is your pose. Mm -hmm. I do like I do like this one. This is honestly this is one of my favorite like fan arts because it's just like it's just Poseidon and I punched a bunch of monsters and we both look <laughs> it's amazing. So good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love the the little Poseidon. It's morphin time. It's, it's morphin time. It's morphin time. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, no, she's flying, time, kind of. Morphin time. <laughs> yeah, she's flying, kind of. What? Uh, okay. uh, apparently, she can fly too. Don't the worry about it. Power of water the makes you fly, I guess. Power yeah. of water. Power of light. Lawn, no Powers lawn. unite. Powers unite. Powers unite. <laughs> girls and Melissa needs anyway. to save them. She goes to Jason for help, who doesn't understand sign language. Oh I like no! How she just gives up and grabs a piece of paper and writes a note. So I mean, hey, it works. Next. It's morphin' time, bust out the blaster, we need dinosaur power, day is saved. And, and you'll you'll find that to be a oh very common God. theme. <laughs> where like like, hey, there's the, the message of the week. We go and fight a monster. We're not beating <clears> the monster. <throat> Bring on like the power blaster so you know the kids can see the new toys that they could buy. Okay, yeah. it yeah. beat the monster, but then it got big. So now we have to bring on the Megazord. The Megazord. Which is another yeah. toy that kids can buy and that yeah that that's gonna rinse repeat yeah. a lot for for a lot of these early episodes it's really just that they here's the problem of the episode they have they encounter a monster for some reason they can't beat the monster so whatever teamwork friendship thing that they learn will allow them to be a better power ranger they beat them they have them blow up rita makes them grow they beat them with the megazord and then they resume their lives and that's oh, like okay. a lot of these episodes. That's the formula of these episodes, yeah. early episodes. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah. Zeus, what was that head? Hand on your head? It was a hand oh, on your head. Pat. That was a hat. Pat. Whose hand was that? It was a hat pat. Whose hand was that? It was it was my communities. They gave me hat pats. Did you sever their hand? Just to I, summon magically? Are you, you know, cutting never, off people's hands? Never now? Yeah, we, we, don't, we don't talk about it. We don't talk about that. I've we never don't talk <laughs> What the you can't say that and then bring it back out, Zeus. <laughs> Are you taking people's hands now? <laughs> Zeus's chat, no, listen, blink no, twice no, if you need help. Blink goodness. twice, Zeus's chat, if you need help, or just uh, gift 86 okay? subs to my chat, and then, yeah, no, then no, we know you need help. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Give, give, give subs to Roy. Give subs to Roy. No, it's a Why joke. Why are you just spamming that? <laughs> Now they're spamming that. No. Oh, Deserved. Goodness. Deserved. I'm just saying. Listen, if you're going to take someone's hand. Not Roy's chat blinking. <laughs> oh, what? Hey, now, oh, now, now they're God. saying they're blinking as well. No, don't blink. I'm not keeping oh, you guys gosh. here hostage. What the fuck? No. Zeus is chat. It's okay. Mm. Everything's going to be fine. You know it's why? Okay. All you have to do why? is. Burn the person! Burn the person! <laughs> 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 You are not me. This is not me. Thank God, Kane's wheezing. <laughs> I'm trying really hard to keep it together because you're new to Power Rangers doing a cute gun, but I'm... Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Kane's wheezing should be a sound bite somewhere. Oh I swear God. to God. It has to be. I, I can't. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, because oh, hearing you laugh makes me laugh, Kate, and I wheeze yeah. just as hard as you. Okay, owl oh down, owl gosh. down, owl down, owl oh down. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Calm, okay. calm. All right, Billy, calm. Billy dancing. Billy to yeah. mm -hmm. The hood accepts Billy as one of their own. <laughs> Immediately. Hey, thanks for the hundred bits. I appreciate it. I'm so familiar with this episode. I hate that I know so much of this episode. New friends, like the nunchucks. Yeah. It's really messy and goes on for a bit. It looks like yeah. they had tons of fun no, the filming food. the scene. I wish I could have been there. I mean, meanwhile. Wait, hold on. What the fuck was that? I wish I All right, listen. So. Jason was on like the Amer like they, they did like food from like around the world and his yeah. station was like America. And so they okay. had like like sausages or hot dogs here. And because like bulk is being a menace and throwing like whipped cream pies at people. So naturally, naturally, yeah. You would grab sausages. And what would how would you use a sausage in a fight? Oh, Let me ask you. I 
I and in in a fight, I probably like choke him with it. Wow, that's a that's incorrect. a pretty good answer. Oh. That, that is that is that is yeah. a good answer, but that is incorrect. Oh. Nunchucks, you use them huh? as nunchucks. Yeah. So. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Anyway. Meanwhile, Finster has created a pudgy pig that is... that's going around eating <laughs> that's... all the food wow. in the world. <laughs> the Rangers have to deal with it, but he eats their weapons. Wow, it's crazy. There's one way to oh, do it. Oh no! The pudgy pig eventually makes its way to the food festival where he eats. God, this everything suit probably got like destroyed. Yeah. yeah. Which Trini points out and hatches a plan to lure the pig out with. Oh food wait, it happened again. Hold on. Which Trini points out and hatches. Every time I see it, I have to point it out. Doesn't, yeah. Doesn't this kind of look like Joel on Zach's shirt? <laughs> doesn't it kind of look so, like him? You are, you are so. You are so mean. That's what so you, funny. I'm not being mean. It just kind of looks like Joel. How does that look like Joel? Hold on. Let me let me move to the other side. Okay. Look at that. Yeah. It it looks it looks like a little doll. <laughs> Where? On Zach's shirt. Wearing the it, beanie. I, it doesn't I, I I don't see it. I re, I really don't. <laughs> All right. Zeus, Zeus conf confirmed blind. <gasps> no, I'm done. Zeus confirmed blind. I oh think my gosh! Well, it's a good thing you got that OLED switch. Yeah, Honestly, what? true no, and real. No, no, no. no. How how does oh, me being goodness. blind? How is the cure an OLED switch? It just is a better just screen resolution. I'm you know, just saying. Plan. You know, it all works out. Anyway. The pig out with anyway. Food to only have the final piece of food be something spicy. To yeah, make spicy the food. And spit out the weapons. Yeah. I guess they're lucky the weapons oh. came out that end and not the other. <laughs> <laughs> Big oh, sister God. has Trini and Kimberly <laughs> looking over a young troublemaking girl for some program. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my Sorry. God. She looks, she looks, uh, she looks crazy. She looks simultaneously like six and 60 at the same time. At the same yeah, time. Yeah. Who somehow manages to look nine and 39 at the same time. There we go. That's the joke. She's also terrible at acting. I don't care if you're a kid. I just wanted to get your attention. She gets stolen by Rita and the I'm pretty sure she was cut. dubbed over. She sounds very familiar. Yeah. So you're gonna see it again, but there's another kid that's also dubbed over. And it's yeah. better than okay. that, but it is weird sounding. Like it's very okay. obvious that it's not his voice. Okay. Mm -hmm. Attack Zordon, but communications and teleportation is down and That is wait, a giant tub of ice this. cream. Zach that orders is, yeah. the Ernie special, which is I want this. I'm not gonna lie. I this I, is this right is gonna now. give anyone a diabetes immediately. <laughs> You'd share it with me, right? Immediately. Immediately. You share it with me, right? You will have diabetes eating bite. that, right? Oh, man, the three I of us. Diabetes. The three of us. Right we can now. tackle yep. it. Yeah. All right. Great. This is the biggest ice cream dish I've ever seen. Like, there's no way that didn't cost anything less than a hundred dollars. And he just leaves it to do Ranger stuff. Yep. Yep. Anyway, with teleportation down, waste. Billy yep. introduces the gang to the Rad Bug. His oh, there we go. Flying car. Flying car. Billy doesn't need yeah. his power coin. He yeah. created his own Iron Man suit. <gasps> he what? built a flying he could, car. He could, be, he could be Iron Man for yep. all we care. Oh, my gosh. Yep. I love your reaction during that, which is the mouth open and then just the shaking. No, it's like, it's a flying yeah. car. Yep. In, yeah. in 1993. In yeah. 1993. Yep. Not like any, you know... Not Bill Gates, not Elon Musk, not no, any yeah. like world government military. No, this, <laughs> this, this high school Rangers. student. They yep. started it at all. <laughs> He's like a freshman too. Yeah. How the Rangers then morph just and need to save with, the little like, girl like, no from this reason. giant chicken monster. Yeah. Which, is, which is obviously a little Japanese. Okay, it is. But at least they yeah. got her to wear the same outfit and pigtails. That's true. So you know what? True. You know girl mm. from the sentai footage that they made look identical to which is hilarious and i love it the episode ends with kimberly accidentally dumping chili all over bulk like bro he's he did minding it. his own business eating some he didn't even do anything leave the poor guy alone he I didn't even do anything now. yeah he didn't do anything yeah my guy what a name oh in this episode if you guys oh, don't like this? eyeballs eyeball warning yeah uh, oh. I eyeball warning. This, while I'm not particularly uh, freaked out by eyeballs, this monster design lives in my head rent free. Um, I think about this one in often. In a good way or a bad way?
Uh, I hope you're okay with eyeballs. I hope you're okay with eyeballs. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't even answer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And yes, I agree with this statement. Are we sure the Rangers weren't the bullies? I think they were. I think, I think until like the second group of Rangers, which we will uh, get yeah. to. I think that's yeah. that's when there's a clear like distinct pivot of like them not being mean to them. I think in some capacity, a lot of the Rangers is just like it's self defense, but they kind of push it to a point where it's like, no, you're being the bully. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, he's helping a young kid with a science project. His science project apparently being the Oculus Rift, yeah, a virtual headset oh. that simulates a yep. roller coaster yep. ride. This kid's ahead of the curve. A lot of this episode wow. takes place with Ben <laughs> yeah. Skull being annoying and getting their slapstick said, karma. It's literally like half of the episode with the gang messing around until the monster even shows up. That's a lot of eyes. The monster that is a lot of eyes. Guy, who's a monster <laughs> covered in eyes. It's kind of disgusting, honestly. <sighs> the Rangers eventually blow him up, and Billy's little friend wins the science fair. That's it. Okay, we're done. Yeah. 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 Thunderbird invested in this years later. For whom the bell trolls. No more, no more. Trini is doing a show and tell presentation. Where also, keep in mind, none of these are plot episodes. Yes. We've had, these we've are had. These normal, These like, are just get to know the team. Yep. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay, okay. They're, they're, they're very much filler episodes. We've get had. To know the team, get to know what's happening. Oh, okay. This is the formula of an episode. Cool. We've had one. That, that's what these episodes are. Four okay, okay. not filler episodes because we had the first episode. We had, um. The power blaster with the weapons, hmm. and we had the everyone gets their individual zords. Mm -hmm. mm, okay, so three, okay. three so far. Where she's showing okay. off her doll collection, which is adorable. One of her favorites is Mr. Tickle Sneezer. Yeah! What the fuck? Listen, don't worry about it, okay? <laughs> Just tickle your sneezes, okay? What's wrong, dude? She's she never owned a Mr. Tickle, tickle Sneezer. And brings him to life, no. Oh, ordering him to steal the. <laughs> He's he's like is a terrifying. He like, Mr. listen, and brings <sighs> this suit scares me, dude, because it's not like rubber. It's like something else. Like you see the shine yeah. in his face. Chat, have any of you owned a Mr. Tickle Sneezer doll? Yeah, all of you guys had Tickle Sneezer, right? Uh, certainly all of you have owned Mr. Tickle Sneezer. <laughs> Hold on, I let mostly me had Barbies, Legos. <laughs> You've owned uh, a Mr. Tickles. Transformers. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, yes. A what now? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Listen, uh, I'll tickle okay. your snooze. I'll tickle your snooze. Okay. Don't worry about it. He's in the okay. life, ordering him to steal the Power Rangers and anything else in his way. I'm legally not He's allowed to talk about it. Fella doesn't know any better. <laughs> sure, a little creepy, but innocent nonetheless. Yeah, just, you so know. Rita makes him giant, and it's up to the dinosaur to... <laughs> I, I want you to digest this image really take, quickly. Take, take a look at the picture. Yeah. Do you see anything Why that's a little... Why is there like a guy there? He no <laughs> she noticed a immediately. Japanese child. Yeah, why is there just a why is there just a child there? Also, Let's... why are they are, are they are they are they are they like taming a fire or something? Let's educate what? you real quick. And this J Japanese kid to save him. This megazord sized Japanese child. <laughs> How did this slip by? What? Is it that hard to crop him out? Look, here, I'll do it right now. Boom, he doesn't exist. So the Rangers <laughs> defeat Rita and save Mr. Tickle. So the the thing is, is in the Sentai footage, yeah. a kid becomes friends with that with Mr. Tickle Sneezer because all Mr. Tickle Sneezer wants to do is basically explore Japan and see cool sights. Mm -hmm. And to like memorialize them or to keep them as memories, he sucks them into his bottle. And that's what that, that gas thing coming out of the bottle was. But they don't ah. they don't really do that in the episode. He kind of just kidnaps shit and it looks really scary. And and then they okay. undo it. Yeah. And then they just never explain okay. why the kid was there. So These are, Okay. But hmm. wait. also thank you, Kane, for, for being a moderator. <laughs> <laughs> kind of kinda like a moderator. <laughs> Tickle Sneezer. Also, you can kind of see it. I miss, I missed it again, but this yeah, is Tokyo Japanese, Tower. Japanese, yeah. It's Tokyo Tower. Uh, Tokyo yeah. Tower. Because he yeah. takes Tokyo Tower in the Sentai footage. Oh my god. Young. But anyway, wait, it turns out this entire adventure was just a nightmare Trini was having. She makes what? a remark about having too much Rita on the brain, which I feel like could have been an interesting episode, focusing on the Rangers being overworked with school, all the volunteer work they do, and being heroes. Also, True. the adventure just being yeah. a dream can justify some random kid being there. Sure. Dreams are weird like that. Sure. Happy yeah. birthday, sure. Zach. 
The yep. gang's at the juice bar trying to set up a surprise party for Zack. All's going well until... This is the episode I you say Zack is hot. Balkan skulls I think it is. show up to ruin everything, acting like total jackasses and even harassing Kimberly and Trini in a way that's weird to see on a children's show. Like, hmm. Skull ruins Trini's painting and then grabs her arm, literally saying, how about I help you paint another one after oh, we have God, some fun? Oh, God! Oh, God! Yeah. God! Oh, God! Oh, Remember. Oh, Women's Day! Oh, God! <laughs> no, 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 Women's Day! <laughs> Listen, all right. In, in Power Rangers Defense, this came out in the 90s. It was a very different time. And <laughs> also in Power Rangers Defense, Trini and Kimberly kind of beat their ass on numerous occasions. This is true. So, like, they don't need protection. They just kind of beat the ass. Like, okay. <laughs> it's fun. All right. Well, I, they there you go. This one. At school the next day, Zach is excited. All right. Why is All right. Every time I've seen this, I've had to mention it. Walter Emanuel Jones has no right. Zach has no right being this hot. Like, how attractive this man this is. This is true. Like, how attractive this man is. Like, They're very attractive. Can we, can we get men to, like, wear clothes like this again? I'm just saying. <laughs> Can show the show, like, the near Roy their titties, like, you know, just a little that's, bit out of there, that's you know? I'm saying! Mm -hmm. Men need to dress like whores affectionately again, okay? That's all mm. I'm saying, all right? And we'll mm. get that We'll get that again mm. when when uh, Tommy shows up as well, where he's just wearing, like, a fishnet, like, jersey. What? Yeah, it's... I Listen, the 90s were a wild time. When we get You're there, you'll understand. who Tommy is. We'll, we'll get to it. <laughs> no, okay, she's okay. Like, wait, what were you asking what to? The fishnet. <laughs> the fishnet. I'm not. Yeah. I'm not kidding. The jer the jersey I can see. It's a fishnet like jersey. A fishnet. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, what? We'll get there. Uh, it's uh. We'll get there. Okay. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> we'll um, get there. The I decent style choice, I would say. Yeah. The nineties were a wild time. But due to the surprise party, they all act oblivious, pretending like they forgot. This naturally upsets Zach, where he's angry that oh, his no. friends forgot his yeah. birthday. At least yeah. he's angry for a bit. Because out of nowhere, a monster attacks what? him. Yeah, why, why did, why did he just Japanese go outside, and touch a grass? Ranger well, he was, he was something. sad, you know? His friends didn't I remember his birthday. I know he was sad, birthday. but I thought he would have, like, maybe either, like, do school, because they're in school. That's crazy. Like, he like, in, a, in the valley, be, a canyon. Yeah, he yeah. ended up in the valley out of nowhere. <laughs> that's crazy. Wait, 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 hold on. All of a sudden, they're all morphed, and they're all in, like, a completely different yeah, location. Wow. Whoa, that's... Yeah. That's crazy. Anyway. <laughs> Being upset with his teammates, he just forgets all about it and is gung-ho with everyone. I don't know, it's kind of weird seeing Zack be so upset with his friends, only the seconds later have him being super friendly and talkative. Ah, I'm like, sure it's there's fine. there's not even a, oh, nice of you guys to remember me now, piece of dialogue or anything. Yeah, I don't, I don't yeah. agree with that, but... <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I personally think it's one of those things where it's like, duty first over personal feelings, but mm. I digress. I feel that. Surprise Zack with a big party. It's every surprise party plot in any TV show Aww. ever. Crazy. Still good though. Wild. Wacky. No clowning around. Right, this episode's creepy. In Angel Grove, but it's made pretty clear from the beginning that this is no ordinary Ooh. carnival, with putties taking the form of clowns, and they act extra creepy here. Yeah. Since they're yeah. Guys. Trini even bringing her younger cousin around, and a clown straight up abducting her in plain sight. Wow. It's pretty creepy to watch, honestly. It is. Uh... It's one thing when a kid gets abducted Oof. in Power Rangers by a guy in a rubber monster suit. It's another thing. I was gonna say this is just a dude. Like. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, 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 yeah. 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 When it's done by a creepy, realistic clown. The clown's even threatening Trini, and her getting ready to throw down on a second's notice is great. The episode definitely feels the most threatening and realistic. <laughs> yeah, did you did see how point. menacingly he was approaching? Bro, yeah, yeah he's, just like, he's, he's just like, listen, I'm, I'm spinning. coming for you. I'm spinning. Oh, I'm spinning. That, honestly, that'd be a good horror game idea. <laughs> like you're stuck in like an, an abandoned park, but then like the clouds only appeared out of nowhere. There's an on rail shooter like House of yeah. the Dead that's zombie clowns. So mm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this episode definitely feels the most threatening and realistic. Yeah, we all spin here, point, Rangers. Dealing with realistic weirdos yeah. and needing to lay the smack down on them. Power Ranger oh, Punks is another classic. We start off with the gang playing Very a nice classic. game of volleyball until Putty's attack. 
Amongst the chaos. Yep. Just out of Rooster nowhere. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it happens. Out of nowhere. Drinks with a potion. Rita, Rita started to get relatively smart with attacking them while they were in their civilian forms. He's mm -hmm. like, oh, I know who these people are. Yep. Let me just attack them randomly. Um, never attacking them at home, mind you, but waited till, till they were all together. But mm. was smart enough to at least attack them while they weren't morphed. Yep. And, and those okay. attacks, I think, get smarter as it goes on because it stops being... Oh, the group's together. Let me attack them. And it starts being, one ranger's by themselves? Send a group of putties. Yeah. yeah oh, okay. Because yeah. I, I remember, I remember like the enemies, I think, not knowing who the rangers were. They do. And the rangers being secretive about like, about what they do to like their friends or family. Oh, I think, from what I remember. actually, I don't think we've ever talked about this, Roy. Like so not. when Zordon uh, has them become Power Rangers, he has three very hard like rules that they can never ever break and, it, and it's kind of like taken into future iterations of power rangers but they're like very loosely following them mm -hmm. um i don't remember off the top of my head the first one is that they can't ever reveal their identities um they can't escalate a fight unless the enemy escalates it so which is why you never see the the megazord uh, stepping on like this the smaller uh, monster before it grows and then mm -hmm. the third one was oh goodness what was it um roy do you happen to know i think it's never use your powers for personal gain yes that's it um but yeah so there's a lot of really like interesting rules of like so that's why they always try to keep their identities a secret um mm -hmm. they can't just summon the megazord to just step on people and then they can't like Oh, there's uh, the the news station wants to interview me. Yep, let me just morph into a Power Ranger and uh, get some fame and glory. So yeah, they mm, can do that. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Um, yeah. Well, these are Zordon's it. rules. Yes. Law enforcement rangers obviously broke that. Yeah, yeah. a uh, lot of future <laughs> a lot of future rangers break this. Like for example, there's a whole season where like these people are known to be the Power Rangers. Like yeah. if you see them walking down the street, yeah, those are the Power Rangers. Yeah. Which is very I interesting know? that. What? Yeah. It, it uh, depends on the season. Yeah. Mm. Like, um, okay. Lightspeed Rescue is very, because it's like a government rescue agency. Um, mm. SPD, because they are cops. Um, Time Force, kinda. I feel like they picked and choose which episodes they were fine with it knowing. Yeah. Um, Wild Force, I'm, I think they were pretty open about it, unless it was, like, a relative that was near them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, like, it, it just depends on the season. It depends on the situation. But the first couple of seasons, it is keep your identity a secret. No one can ever know. If your families are in trouble, no one can know. Yeah. Like, you oh, have to okay. find a way to go, go away, morph, and then come back. Yeah. Or something okay. like that. Okay. And that's it. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, back to them drinking spiked drinks. Yes, 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 yes. Then mm -hmm. take a drink and immediately undergo personality changes turning into rude and crude punks. Even showing up to school the next day dressed like rebels, bullying kids Wait, for they, lunch they, money, they, they, Billy that drip, friends, <laughs> both. <laughs> also, sorry, but like they're drip though. That, that do something for you, Zeus? <laughs> I mean, they're both, they're both hot, not gonna lie. True, <laughs> true. I would also true. like to point out, mm -hmm. this is the first time we, we get to see it. We'll get to see it more later. I always point it out anytime I watch it with Kane, whether I watch it with Poseidon. Mm -hmm. So David Yost, who is playing Billy, uh, who is playing mm -hmm. the nerd is actually mm -hmm. the most in shape out of everybody in the show because prior yes. to oh. Power Rangers, he was a gymnast. And oh. look at the size of his arm. Look at that muscle. He is picking up bulk and pushing him into a locker. Picking bulk up. That's crazy. Yeah. And you can tell he's picking him up because this hand is completely free. So he is yeah. not yeah. like balancing on something. Okay. That's a, mm -hmm. like, that's a foot off the ground, he is picking him up. Yeah. <laughs> so they're very strong. He is, oh. he is really he is strong. Very, so mm -hmm. and a lot of these future uh uh early episodes, you see them trying to cover up how incredibly buff he is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um you can notice it by the baggy clothing that they make him wear because he's supposed to be a nerd, but mm -hmm. as the seasons go on, you will notice that they're just like, you know what? You're buff now. Yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah, like you've been fighting monsters for a while. You you, you you're fine. And Kimberly Floyd yeah. with Skull saying that they're going on a date. It's really funny, and this won't be the last time Billy and Kimberly have some kind of personality change. Yep. Watching the nerd and Valley Girl turn into anything else will always be hilarious. Alpha needs to go on a mission to find a cure for the two while a giant frog monster attacks Angel Grove. Jason, Zack, and Trini try their best, but are inevitably eaten by the frog. 
What? Huh? Don't, don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it, Zeus. Okay. Okay. Where Alpha okay. returns just in time, turning the two back to normal. <laughs> Again, it's. I had to listen. I had to say. have an episode where the blue and pink it. ranger change identities, <laughs> so we don't get to see Billy and Kimberly don't, more. No one say it. And accidentally don't say it. Mission with their bad attitudes. Uh, Chat. Still a fun episode. It ends okay. with Skull asking Kim if they're ready to go out on their date, and Kimberly's like, "Ew, you wish." Like, dude, you asked him out. Yeah. Even if you were under a spell, <laughs> it's not his fault. He's asking about it. And there's there's the one of the few times that it's like they get punished for no real reason. Yeah. Mm. Like, she okay, did. Okay. She did ask him on a date. He looks so hurt. Poor Skull. Aww. Peace, love, and woe. Yeah. The school dance is happening, and everyone's excited for it. Everyone except for Billy, who doesn't really care for dances. Yeah. That is until he bumps into a cute girl who's just as intellectual and nerdy as him. Well, that's cute crazy. Girl. Almost instantly. And it oh, I guess we didn't mention this either. Um, yes. Mm. David Yost is gay. Oh, oh. yes. Yes, yes, yes. Um. This is one of the bigger role later. I don't know if we should explain too too much we, of it right now. Yeah, we we won't spoil too much about it. But um, th this right here, this episode with him running into a girl like this, um, this is a very large recurring theme that they try I'm and ship him to push Billy onto random girls. Yep. Um, okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's super. So cute just keep that in mind. Billy talk to a girl that's just like him. There's a part where they're both too awkward and nervous to ask each other to the dance. So Jason's like, Billy, come here really quick. We got a ranger emergency. And when Billy goes over there, the gang's like, come on, ask her out. And Billy says, huh? That's your emergency? They eventually agree to hang out <laughs> until Rita kidnaps her, where it's up to Billy I mean... to save the day. The Sentai footage works well here, with the Blue Ranger leading the charge and taking the monster head on. It's a good it's episode, nice honestly. It is this is episode, Billy's yeah. first moment as leader, and without hesitation. Also, <laughs> what the fuck? What the wait, 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 huh? This is an example of the just they don't know how to move in their suits, so the helmets are very, very hard to see out of. Yeah. Also. A lot of the American stunt actors, the few that they did have, didn't know how to move in the suits. Because once you're in the suit, you have to overreact um, just to uh, accentuate all of your movements. They don't okay. understand that. So <laughs> you get scenes like this. They look so <laughs> stiff. They look at what am exactly. I supposed to do again? And What's my it, job? it gets worse the more you look at it because it's like, why oh, is no. Trini so tall? comparatively yeah. why is zach's yeah. like belt falling off why is yeah. kimberly's suit so wrinkled like yeah this so this is what we were telling like you can know you know the difference when it's mm -hmm. when it's american footage versus japanese footage and japanese the other footage, one yeah. is the big neck piece oh yeah yeah okay so that can be explained a couple of ways. Uh, that is typically known <laughs> as the hero hero neck. Um, so essentially, whenever they were like taking off their helmets to do uh, <laughs> promotional shots without their helmets and just the actors, they would use this so it just wasn't this piece of cloth. But it became like a huge staple of like the American Power Rangers, where they had this giant roll of styrofoam around their neck, and it made it look so thick. Like, oh my god! Th not not yeah. thick with like two C's. Thick with like three C's. So thick, okay. thick with know, like, like oh my god, thick, thick, thick with like thick? seventeen yeah. K's. Like yeah. oh <laughs> it's god. like it's not even the fun thick, you know? Yeah, yeah. Oh no! Um, uh, for it's anyone like comfortable to chat, wear. It yeah, is. for anyone in chat that has seen the the Netflix special once and always, they bring this back for all of the sequences rather than just some of them. Uh, so mm. yeah. Uh, okay. They do eventually fix this, but mm -hmm. as, as someone that has cosplayed Power Rangers before, uh, the the thing that you do is you get a um, a a hood essentially, um, mm -hmm. that that has this kind of neck piece on it, and then mm -hmm. a little strap that goes around your neck to help cover anything else. Yeah, that is mm -hmm. like paper thin, <laughs> like it's anyway. It's Billy's yeah. first moment as leader. And without hesitation, taking on a monster himself. Yeah. All for a nerdy girl. How romantic. Aww. Hi, Kai. Oh, she's ever brought up again. She <laughs> literally she isn't. Guy. Never. Ever. Kimberly's uncle is a pilot and never again. take her on a flight. Bulk and Skull notice this and have an interest in flying too. They ask Kimberly if they can come along and it's pretty sweet, honestly. They yeah. have no schemes or ill intentions. They genuinely just want to fly in the plane. 
This oh, is can so bad, I guess. just vibe into the music. Happens, and most of it takes place on the plane. <laughs> Kimberly's uncle gets put under a spell and needs to land the plane herself. A monster eventually shows up, so something can happen in the episode. Eh, it's not my favorite. Dark Warrior. <laughs> the Billy's getting bullied again by Bulk and Skull, even being shoved into a trash can. Poor Billy. Billy decides to once again enroll in Jason's karate class, which doesn't make a ton of sense. Like, weren't you whooping a monster with kung fu just a few episodes ago? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, don't worry about it. Don't, don't ask questions. Don't, okay. don't fret. Everything's gonna be fine. Billy, being both brains and brawn, he pretty much tells Billy that violence isn't always the answer. Which is a good big brain. Is it's a good me weapon. message. Good lesson. Mm -hmm, the mm -hmm. uncle then gets kidnapped, so maybe violence is the answer sometimes. Absolutely. <laughs> the need to save him and have a big battle with a dark warrior. The episode ends with Bulk and yeah, Skull man, the dark bully warrior. Billy I hate that again, guy. but Trini's uncle drinks his invisible potion and teaches the bullies a lesson. So, oh. violence <laughs> with some science is always the answer. Yeah, listen, oh, violence, yeah. violence and science. Violence, violence and science. Violence and science, in as conjunction long as they're together, with each other. It'll, it'll be fine. Together. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. The most harmonious mm -hmm. pairing ever. This is another mm -hmm. fun yes. Billy and Kimberly episode. Billy creates a device that lets you read minds, and after trying it with Kimberly, it malfunctions, <laughs> swapping their minds into each other's bodies. So it's a fun Freaky Friday episode with Billy's head in Kimberly's body and Kimberly's oh, mind no. in Billy's body. Yeah. Seeing Billy talk like a valley girl it's is so funny. And it's Kimberly actually genuinely a very fun like episode. Is very attractive. I think I've fallen in love. <laughs> Most of the episode follows the two around school having a hard time pretending to be each other. When the monster shows oh, up, we do get a little babble with Kimberly and Billy saying things they normally wouldn't. Yeah. So it's good. Fun. It's fun. Now, these next group of episodes is a It's time. Here, Here we go. Oh. It's it's time Here for plot. Because again, we still. It's in time. It's, oh, it's time for plot because we haven't had a single okay. plot episode since the last right. time I brought this up. Plot episode. All right. Uh, okay. Not plot episode. For, for plot a lot episodes. of people, this is. Power Rangers. This okay. these next five episodes are everything to a lot of people. Okay, it's a I don't quite feel the same way, but this is the first plot plot that yeah. we have since the series started. It's so good. Parker mm -hmm. in the history of Power Rangers. Green with Evil, part one. Here we go. Now, up part to this one. point, Power Rangers part has mainly one. focused on the fun and quirky teenage lives of the Rangers. You know, school dances, surprise birthday parties. Yeah, porcelain made on his shirt. Et cetera. Exactly. That Those were the main Ooh. plot points, while the monsters and superhero Sorry. duties were secondary. Those were never the focal point of an episode. Green with Evil, though, is the first episode in a five-part story focusing five. on the action and the Power Rangers. We start off with Jason in a karate tournament with a new kid who will turn out to be one of, if not the most There he is. There he is. Popular oh. Power Rangers character of all time. Tom, Popular pa played there you by go. the late Jason David Frank. He's shown to be on par with Jason from a fighting standpoint, ending the competition in a draw. Kimberly clearly being attracted to Tommy and having a little crush. That's crazy. The Wild, next day at wacky. school, Bulk and Skull harass Kimberly, where Tommy shows up and does some spin kicks to intimidate the two, complete with his patented Oh yeah. That, yes. that is a very like Power Rangers is very famous for its uh it's a, it's a, the girl you know. sounds okay, all right, I got gotcha. you. Specifically gotcha. Tommy. Like, Tommy mm -hmm. specifically has this this rhythm that he does in every fight. And, and anyone that knows Power Rangers will immediately recognize <laughs> Welcome to Midnight He was him. That's not ever missing the goat. <laughs> it, it, it's specifically Uxixia. Sia. Uxixia. Sia. Oh my god. Lot, lot of, Wait, it sounds so there. Japanese. Yeah. Action boy now. Action girl now. now. <laughs> Be prepared to swim across the ocean. Just to make up. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'm like, take the can. <laughs> <laughs> Elevator going up. I'm screaming. She has no idea. Right, she has no time. idea what we're talking about. We'll no get there. Idea, we'll get there. We'll get there. The buddies to attack Tommy. Oh, you ready? Oh, you ready? Ranger power coin. She puts anyway. Tommy under a spell to make him a mindless slave to Rita, and more importantly, become her evil Green Ranger. Ooh. She even oh. tells Tommy the identity of the Rangers. Tommy then infiltrates the command center and wreaks havoc. Important thing. I'm gonna scroll it back. Just, just, just a split, he tells a Tommy split the second. Identity of the Rangers. Tom His costume is very different. So hmm. I'm glad you pointed that out. What, what do you think yeah. is the most different part? 
it may it like I mean the the what do you call it the shoulder thing connecting to the chest. It may, it makes me think that he's the leader. This thing, so right? That's commonly yeah. referred to as the shield, or in this particular instance, the dragon shield. Yeah, I don't know okay. why they call it a shield. It's not a shield. It's like it's like a, it's half, a chest plate. It's like a half plate. Yeah. yeah. But yes, so I'm glad that you noticed this. Yes. I'm going to bring this up again in a, in a, in a few moments, and you're going to mm -hmm. see why. Tommy then infiltrates the command center and wreaks havoc, turning Alpha offline and even destroying Zordon's communication and connection to the Rangers. The Rangers eventually try to contact Alpha, but to no avail. Oh man, so if only we had a flying bug to show oh. up, but they're too late. Flying they car. To fix Alpha, but for again, a lot of no people, luck. really quickly, Just for, for a lot of people, this. These this episode is so visceral for a lot of people yeah. because mm. every episode prior, as Connor has said, has been very like, okay, here's the power of just having fun, blah, 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 blah. Funny, yep. goofy. Mm -hmm. And yep. then you've come to associate that because we've had these like episodes where nothing has been going wrong. You associate the command center as their safe space. And now mm -hmm. you have this person that comes up and just start ripping everything out of its sockets. That's that meant so much to a lot of people growing up. Yeah. Because it's like, mm. oh, here's my safe space. Not my safe space anymore. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and the the shot that we're seeing here, because remember, Tommy, now evil Green Ranger, uh, we don't we don't get to see the shot leading up to it, but I will I will post the the gif. And, yeah. and this is a very popular fight scene. And they this one gets brought up very, very often when talking about the popularity of him. Mm -hmm. Um there we go. I found it. So the 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 gif. There's a subtitle there that's "Go to hell, Zoo Ninja," because <laughs> he literally just jumps into the Megazord. Punches. And he, he just, just punches it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they just get punched in the face, dude. And like, oh my god, it's so funny. But every anyway, time, they all look someone, behind like, what? Yeah. Huh? yeah. Every time Why someone talks about this scene, they always talk about he is that guy. He, he went up into the Megazord, punched them out. <laughs> so this oh is that. Oh my god. And I'm going to I'm going to pause this again in a split second. Green Ranger yeah. is attacking Angel Grove and the Rangers Do you I'm not, hold on, I missed it. Have to stop. No Go luck. Go back. Just then the Green Ranger is attacking Angel and Grove. And pause. Okay. Do you notice anything different? <laughs> Do you notice anything different about that that shield, maybe? It's a diamond. Uh, okay. That's what I'm thinking. Good. But at the same time, it's not made out of styrofoam from the yeah! first few. Yeah. So it's actually this one looks cloth. like it's made of rubber. Yes. You saw the eye. You got it. Yeah. So this is a huge downgrading quality. Well, th this is the upgrade, but like the yeah. the American footage. For some reason, they could not get this shield shipped over to them with with everything oh. else. So they made their own out of cloth, and it is yeah. like so obvious when it's there versus yeah. this. It's mm -hmm. also not a like a triangle for some reason. It's like a weird Pizza Hut looking <laughs> logo. Oh my god! I don't, I don't quite know how to explain it. It's oh just there gosh. are edges there that don't need to be there, and I. <laughs> Whatever. So the point of this a lot of the time is just for whatever reason, America always had such a hard time getting props from Japan. Yeah. So in mm -hmm. a lot of cases, they just had to like wing it. It's like, oh, this is the closest thing. So <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yep. I mean, they tried kind of. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah. You, you'll yeah. you'll see, when you see it later, it's uh, it gets worse. Also, for okay. some reason, you can you can more so tell it here. The shade of green is very different than the it's American. It's very shade. different. It's a yeah. very deeper green. So, mm -hmm. anyway, and the Rangers have to stop him. Unfortunately, the Green Ranger is kind of powerful and easily wipes the floor. Ah, uh, yes, the my leg spreading technique. Yeah, them to retreat. My favorite. He like throws the swords at their chest. <laughs> yeah. The oh happened. my. God. He beats the ass. They lost Zordon, don't have Alpha, and are seemingly fighting one of their own. Realizing that this is easily the biggest challenge they've ever been faced with. To be Leading continued. To green with evil, part, part two. two. Part two. Billy and Trini are trying to fix Alpha. I've seen this episode a million times. Who this Same. New evil Green Ranger is. They eventually get Alpha working again, but can't remember anything due to a virus that Tommy put into him. 
We see how all of this stress is affecting the oh, creatures. Girl and Trini are tirelessly working so with this good. technology. They Sorry, don't understand I, I told Roy on. about this before. Haunted. This specific scene, when I'm working mm -hmm. on the bag and I'm, I'm doing uh, drills, this specific... Uh, Jason does this rhythm. It's and that I do that often because this episode lives in my head. <laughs> I, that specific rhythm. A core memory. Yeah, yeah a core memory so unlocked. I, every time I'm working on the bag or anything like that, this is what plays in my head. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh headed beating up a punching bag saying how he just wishes he could get his hands on the green ranger again which is pretty uncharacteristic being able to normally keep his cool I can't get him on my mind <laughs> yeah honestly he punches everything it's, that's, that, what, that's it what he does he's like i can't get him out of my mind <laughs> yeah just punches a bunch of stuff <laughs> and that's when he punches it so <laughs> oh my gosh. also uh, hmm. Hmm, what's that he's wearing zeus Oh, wait, is that the vest that you were talking it, about? It's me. About <laughs> ah, wow, that's... No, it was the, the jersey thing you said. Yeah, it's the weird evil. fishnet jersey. That's crazy. Uh, that kind of looks like when Trash washes up on the beach. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> True. Tell me okay, oh, my God, just what... See, this is what I mean, right? And it's like a, cr it's like a crop top, too. What? Yeah, listen, the 90s were wild, okay? And I know the 90s are wild, but I didn't know it was like that. Uh, the 90s oh were wild. Gosh. The 90s yeah. were wild, honestly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But anyway, uh, he, you know, he he tells her, you know, Kimberly is not the center of everyone's universe. So she responds with... Mind control acts really mean to Kimberly and calls her <laughs> selfish. Where Kimberly gives the funniest response when she says... Well, excuse me for living. Like, Jesus, it's so cheesy. I love it. So, there's a whole lot more to that sequence. Uh, <laughs> excuse me for living. Oh, my well, excuse God. Excuse me for living. living. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. That whole sequence is very funny, but there's another very similar one that happens, I think, later in this episode. Well, um, Pink Ranger. <laughs> <laughs> is that, is that the one? And the other Power Ranger. Sorry. We'll get to that when we'll we get, get to it. We'll get there. Okay. So he then gets a super-powered evil sword and captures Jason inside a dark <laughs> dimension. What the fuck? Oh, wait, he just became Bro, Spider-Man. What? Bro, motherfucker just, just, just said Z. So he has the evil ranger <laughs> coin, right? And his task is to try and isolate all of the other rangers from each other. Yeah. And so okay. he has this, right before he does this, he has this conversation with Jason. It's like, hey, have you seen everyone else? No, nah, man, I haven't seen him at all. Oh, okay. Well, I'll keep looking. And so he turns around mm -hmm. and he walks away. And then he does this, his eyes d do this uh, green flicker in the same color as that, that beam. And then he does the, as you called it, the, the Spider-Man. Spider <laughs> the Spider-Man. Somebody just in my chat said it. green piss laser. What the fuck? <laughs> it's not the it's first. Not, it's not going to be the last yeah. time we see it. I'll say that much. It's not really obvious, but there's this like green fire texture in the beam but because it happens so fast you don't see it and yeah. also uh -huh. because of the quality of the filming yeah it's not great but there's this green fire thing happening in there don't say green with piss shut the fuck up <laughs> <laughs> i won't be as mean uh but don't say that don't say that yeah <laughs> anyway where Goldar is essentially playing with his food after stealing Jason's morpher. Oh no. Beating him oh, up gosh. and teasing Jason oh, no. to fight back. Looking for this Red Ranger! Red Ranger. Ranger. <laughs> and the <West laughs> cheat to get the upper hand. But I love this. All right, to be fair. So, so Kane had mentioned before, they're not supposed to escalate a fight. Meaning they're, they're mm -hmm. not supposed to like summon the Zords unless they really need them or like go go pick a fight with Rita kind of thing. But they are losing. They're losing so bad to one dude, to Tommy, because he is him. He is him. He is him. He is so, him. He's the GOAT. He's the man. So Zordon was their father figure. Or it still is, so mind is. you. Yeah. And now they have no access to him. They have Alpha who had a virus in him and, and could not function correctly. And they're losing a fight against another Power Ranger. So, yeah, this is escalating the fight. <laughs> yeah. This so they, is escalating, yeah. Yeah, because Tommy doesn't even have a Zord. And they're like, we're just losing. Call a giant mech and beat his ass. They summon the yeah. Megazord, and when Tommy shoots a beam of energy, they use the giant shield to deflect it back at him. <laughs> and bounce it right back. <laughs> so, like, it's already four on one, which is unfair. But to then summon the Megazord to yep. fight regular-sized Tommy, 
It shows yeah. the Rangers' desperation. Yes. But with Jason missing and possibly going to be killed at any second, and Zordon still gone. And now I think it's time to end this game. <laughs> is it right after this that Goldar's voice swapped too? Because this was still original uh, uh, Goldar, right? This is still right? original Goldar right now. Um, but he switches, like, I think sometime after uh, Tommy joins... Uh, to something happens with Tommy. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> Evil part three. Jason's still getting whooped. That's by crazy. Goldar, Wild, wacky. To make matters worse, Rita has summoned a new general, Scorpina. Oh, Scorpina. She's very attractive. Oh, very oh she's pixels. yeah, she's very attractive. Those pixels. <sighs> oh, what the fuck was that growl? Kane, Kane, Kane does not like her <laughs> at all. What? <laughs> 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 yeah, <laughs> she's hot, but yeah, Kane, Kane, Kane does not like her. <laughs> it's just so sad to see. Alpha eventually gets teleportation working again and frees Jason from the evil dimension. Moments before being killed, he never really stood a chance no, against he Goldar. Was, Rita he's also concocts a plan to cause an eclipse that will cut off the solar energy that's required to power the Megazord. So oh yeah, it's no. solar powered motion, by the way. She sends down a giant Goldar to attack Angel Grove. And with no Zordon still in sight and Jason just recovering from his traumatic events, they have no time to waste. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> See, now you're getting it. Still trying to contact Zordon, but needing to take care of Goldar, Scorpina, and the Green Ranger. We get some Vulcan Skull shenanigans with them taking a bus to drive far away from Giant Goldar. Wow, it's crazy. The Rangers mm -hmm. summon the that Megazord, good. but unfortunately get overwhelmed by all three villains. Yeah, it's not so fun when it's not a fair fight, isn't it? Rita's <laughs> That's plan crazy. actually works, shutting down all power in the Megazord, and even ends up destroying the Megazord and sending it to hell. G so go to uh, hell, shoot it! <laughs> Roy has some fun trivia for this. They reused this shot, like <laughs> this, <laughs> this shot of the swords going into the fire, like forty thousand times. What yeah. the fuck? And even more so. This fight scene Get that we were talking about, mm. that yeah, also gets reused like 40,000 times. Oh Rita's my gosh. But yeah, specifically the Zords going into the fire like this gets used yeah. a lot. A lot, mm -hmm. a mm -hmm. lot. So, yeah. This is a really visceral scene for a lot of people that obviously, you know, really like the dinosaurs because now there they are going they're up gone. in flames. Yeah. They're uh, gone. In the Japanese footage, the the zords are considered gods they're they're not just robots they they're like living gods yep. um mm -hmm. and so this was this hit really hard for a lot of people that like cuz they have personalities and they here they are dying <laughs> yeah oh gosh no yeah th this is super traumatic in in the sentai really mm -hmm. really bad throwing the megazord and sending it to hell jesus with that the yeah, there we go. See? To <laughs> once again Oh, Things no. are looking pretty grim for Not like team. this, man. They even consider just giving up at one point since they have nothing left. But Jason Soft convinces powers. the team to keep going. There is one new development, though, that Alpha was able to figure out. And that's the identity of the Green Ranger. I love this shot for the no reason. of everyone in the yeah. command center is shown to be Tommy. Leading in to the Green with Evil finale. Oh gosh, Part no. Five. Yep. Yeah. Well, Pink it's gonna start now. They're gonna try to find a way. Kimberly goes to confront Tommy. Well, Pink Ranger! Oh my she gosh. Here we go. Identity, and Tommy immediately threatens her and everyone else so casually. L literally, well, like, Kate, Kate and I are not kidding. Like, she comes over to him and she's like, Tommy, I know you're the Green Ranger. And he who you are. He slams the weights down. And he's like, and he Well, goes, Pink Ranger, you should know that you and your other friends. Will be gone soon. So Jason David Frank, this actor, he has a very, very specific way of speaking. It, mm -hmm. Also, when he's evil and not evil. Yeah. So he goes, okay. "Well, Pink Ranger, you and the other Power Rangers will soon be destroyed." <laughs> <laughs> the, co the comical, well, well thought out, like villain voice well, in every does, other show. He does mm -hmm. this even when he's not under this spell, and he does well. It's not nearly as ridiculous, mind you, but there are know. still mm. elements. <laughs> there are still know, elements Kate. of it. <laughs> you and the other Power Rangers will soon be destroyed. <laughs> it's just a lot of very, very overacting, mm. but it's actually really fun. Yeah. Yeah. Tommy mm -hmm. then is given the Dragon Zord, which is an awesome Zord. It what? looks like Godzilla and even Godzilla. Godzilla! 
The Rangers, unfortunately, yeah. can't yep. do battle with it, though, since, again, their Zords are kind of being burned alive. They're in hell. All seems hopeless once again. That is until Alpha finally manages to make <gasps> contact with Zordon again. And with his power, yeah. he's able back, to open boys. up the earth and revive. <laughs> Whoa! Doesn't oh that shot God. look familiar? Doesn't. Wow, yeah. Whoa. That shot looks so familiar. Whoa. They just reversed it. That's yeah, crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. You can't, listen, you can't say that, Zeus. They didn't just reverse I... it. They. Anyway. A battle ensues where <laughs> finally the Rangers get the upper hand and knock Tommy out of the Zord. Where Jason has that one on one battle he's been craving since the beginning. He destroyed. <sighs> What? So isn't this Jason isn't this an awesome looking fight? Like they do a really cool pose. Yeah, one they like one, they throw a really cool weapon. Like, like you see like this really cool angle and everything. And yeah. then all of a sudden, um. <laughs> it just shoot, just shoot a gun. Just definitely shoot a gun. Action gone. Just shoot like, the. the, the Shoot, shoot, shoot the gun. Yeah, shoot, pew, pew. Yeah, yeah he pew, destroys pew. the of yep. darkness, apparently the source of Rita's mind control. I hate that. I can't just, just went, just went from that. like being awesome to like, all right, time to stand still. All right, shoot gun. Five episodes of dealing with this, and it's dealt with with. It's so I will I will point this out just just for the sake of pointing it out, um, and I won't uh -huh. I won't give all of it away, but because Connor does uh -huh. mention it later in the video, in the Super mm. Sentai, um, the Green Ranger is actually the Red Ranger's brother, mm. um, and they mm -hmm. they didn't they didn't know each other. Well, the Red Ranger didn't know the Green Ranger existed, and oh. he's basically for the past five episodes been refusing to fight him in like actual seriousness because it's like, oh my god, you're a brother I didn't even know I had. Like, okay. I, I want to, like, get to know you. Like, I, I don't want to fight mm -hmm. you. So he's been holding back. And right. this is the only time that he legitimately is like, I'm tired of this. You've hurt too many people. I don't care if you're my brother. I have to take you down. And he bodies him. It's like, oh my gosh. It, he Absolutely destroys him. him. Yeah. So that's that's why it seems so, like, one-sided. Because that's mm. it, it was. He finally started actually caring. The Rangers mm -hmm. then mm -hmm. yeah, and then we go. comfort Tommy, where he feels terrible for what he's done under Rita's control. Jason gives a heartwarming speech about friendship and teamwork oh, and how the go. world will be safer if they work together. We then get an awesome scene that I wish I could show you in its entirety. The Rangers then morph again, including Tommy, who gets to shout Dragon Zord. Everyone then triumphantly That's gives so a quip, good. saying how they're back and better than ever. One. And the Ranger better look out. Five! We're gonna fight against evil! Wait, wait, Tony. Fight against evil, come on, guys! Oh, what is it? Hold oh, on, gosh. uh... Uh, this is a it's a really corny scene that we're back and we're better around. than ever five yeah. working together to fight against evil and to <laughs> stop Rita and all her nasty monsters from healing the universe with evil and something like that it's like it's so it's, it's yeah. so weird it's so corny it's so <laughs> weird and it's corny but I mm. guess in the context of this it's like oh you know what okay all right you deserve this win yeah you deserve this win yeah sure we're you not can, backing you down monologue. cause we're the power rangers we're the power rangers yes the dragon zord and that it can combine with the saber tooth tiger mastodon and triceratops go, go, sword Rangers. to create the dragon it's zord Rangers. fighting mode it's Whoa. so yeah. satisfying to see the team finally be on the up and up after constantly being kicked down and losing every battle goldar escapes though like a coward and we don't get a fight tommy officially earns his yeah. the yeah center yep yep with a team that only has a new friend but a new ally in battle Hands Let's go! In the middle, yell Power Rangers! Episode end. The Green with Evil saga was so amazing, mainly for being the first handful of episodes to have a more action centered storyline. Which was yeah. great. Apart from some Balkan Skull moments, this episode had no real An high school drama plot. or action yeah. lesson. Yeah. Whoa! It was really just a massive Nutty. evil force that the Rangers had to take on by themselves. I don't mind the Saved by the Bell sitcom episodes at all. Which I really what they were don't. trying to do. I like the characters enough, and seeing them do anything is them. enjoyable, but having the show Sometimes finally I mind them. feel like a superhero <laughs> show and not a sitcom was a nice change of pace. Yeah. And again, introduce the world to Tommy, who would become a lot of people's fan favorites. 
There's also no proper time to mention this, so I guess I'll talk about it quickly now. Yeah, here we go. In 2001, Tui Trang, who played Trini, would pass away in a tragic accident. And mm. in 2022, Jason David Frank would also tragically pass away. I'm bringing yeah. this up now just so we can focus the rest of the video on all the happy moments they brought us throughout the years. So mm -hmm. let's continue on with the show. Yeah, Jason, I, I, I know I know recently a lot of people have been talking about like uh, you know the passing of Akira Toriyama uh, and everything yeah. like that. And obviously yeah. that's still hitting a lot of people hard. Um, yeah. But I, I, I think I can talk for, for Kane and I both. When right. when we heard of uh, Jason David Frank's uh, suicide, it was I had to. I, had I, I I talked about it on stream and I cried. I don't know if any of my MCs are here that can remember that, but that was not a fun stream. <laughs> mm -hmm. It it was bad because I I mean like I'm sure I'm sure for you can like you got to uh, like properly yeah. address it and talk to your MCs and everything like that. I I hadn't found out yet, and I had people DMing me because obviously I'm you know, a massive power in your yeah. But like, that's how I found out. It was like a flood of DMs of being like, oh my God, did you see that this happened? And I was like, well, well now I did. And then I yeah. I just shut down for an entire day. It, mm -hmm. yeah, no, it was, I, I think I had to wait like a day before I went live, but I definitely, I saw all the, social media was definitely like, so, hey, Jason David Frank is gone. And it wasn't confirmed yet. And so I was like, no, this is a joke. This is some like I, I thought it was too. joke. <laughs> There's <bad>. no way. <laughs> so mm. but um obviously like Tui Trang as well, um, unfortunately passed away in a car accident in two thousand one. Um, were she was on her way to a wedding. Yeah. Oh yeah. so um and there are there are plenty of other Power Rangers actors we've lost as well, but it I, I felt like it I, I mean Connor does a good job bringing it up now that it's worth mentioning yeah. that, mm -hmm. you know. Um but yeah. Let's get back to the goodness. Just good Hold to acknowledge on. that. What? <laughs> you want to check live chat really quickly? <laughs> which which one? What? Uh, which one? It's uh um hold on. Live text, sorry. Oh, live text. Live text. Oh, did you put something there? No, I didn't. Oh, what's going on a real loud to join? <laughs> <laughs> Hazumi wanted to know if she could join. I mean, if they, I mean, that, that, if they want to. I mean, I mean, if, if you want to get mine. brain rotted I'm with fine. Power Rangers and want to be on stream. <laughs> oh, I remember man. my brother and I rooting for Green Ranger during this whole saga. Aww. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Um, for a lot of people, the Green Ranger is forever their favorite ranger. You know, mm -hmm. uh, when you ask more times than most, when you ask people, what is their favorite Power Ranger? They won't tell you a very specific ranger, but they will say, oh, yeah, the Green Ranger was my favorite. Yeah. Not Aww. knowing that there are other Green Rangers because this is this is him. So, yes, you know? it's him. This is the Green oh, Ranger. <laughs> I got two reads. Uh, welcome in, Raiders! Hi, Raiders! Welcome in, everybody. My Hi. name's Royal Beer, Bunny host Hello. for this evening. I specialize in voice acting, and I do a bunch of collaborative chaos with my friends. Like today, we're teaching. I'm sorry, we're indoctrinated. I'm sorry, we're teaching Zeus. Huh? Yes. Uh, yeah, about the cult. I mean, the the wild, wacky yes. world huh? of huh? Power Rangers. What? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, we will we will give this a second if if this person wants mm. to join. Just to, if they do mm. join, I think it might be safe safer for us to switch to Fugies for everyone else. Yeah. Just just mm -hmm. so we can have everybody on screen and not like taking up too much. Not break Zeus's computer. <laughs> yeah. Let's let's yeah. let's switch over into live stream just so more people can join mm. if they want to. Right. And I will share my screen again. I'm going to move. We're switching. I moved you over. I moved Zeus there over too. There we go. There we go. I moved you both over. Oh, hi. Hi. There. Yeah. Hi. All right. Uh, Give me okay. a moment while I just get food. Okay. Sure. Uh, Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, we can entertain my chat. <laughs> I was gonna say, Kane. I'm gonna leave that to you because I'm gonna use the bathroom and get water. Oh, okay. So, well, and if, hi. If Hazumi jumps in, just let her know what's gonna happen. Have fun. Okay. All right. Hi, everyone. How are you? So, um, I really want to uh, thank all of you for supporting Zeus and Roy. Um, 
they're wonderful people and i adore them so so much um i've been seeing all of the the purchases that you've been making for <laughs> uh for for zeus please keep it coming if you can if you're financially responsible please consider doing so um i'm not gonna plug myself because i <laughs> this is not my stream this is for zeus and this is for roy and i i care about them greatly so please 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 give them all the love in the world um i'm gonna quickly because they're not around i'm gonna do uh exclamation point throne uh so if you want to help them and uh, make their lives a better and cooler place there you go um also i know that uh roy has also said that uh if uh he reads a certain sub uh, what was it 80 something that he'll do uh, uh karaoke for power rangers and whatever i mean that's cool that's great but listen if you just hit roy with a sub that'll that's everything you know that's just more support for roy and that gets him to do all of the things that he loves to do and i, I know a lot of you already know that roy's been a lot happier lately doing what he loves and so it, it really makes me happy knowing that he's smiling while he's streaming with all of you and, and zeus uh having the uh a new computer coming the switch oled and a whole bunch of other things zeus has a lot of really fun things coming um I can't wait for all of you to see it. Really. <laughs> Was it 400? 400 with 80 to go. Yeah, see, there you go. Hit Roy with 80 more subs. And you can support, not only support him, but possibly oh my goodness sigmund thank you thank you thank you i, I normally i would name off everyone but that's what i do on my streams <laughs> In the, in the words of Joel, it's coming. That's actually a Power Rangers Zeo quote. Also, not not taking away from Joel, but when Power Rangers Zeo was was coming onto the air, all of the commercials had this really high pitch, um, person saying, "It's coming!" And it's coming! it was so funny. Oh, we... <laughs> it's coming! It's coming! Did I get gifted subs while I was away? What the heck? No, 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 huh? no! What are you guys no. doing? Nothing. What are you, what are you guys doing? Don't worry about it. What do you, I, what do you, what do you mean? I'm Are worried you about a it. Dog or a wolf? I am a wolf. Thank you so much for asking. It, it means a lot to me. Oh my god, Mito and Sigmund, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. Come on, you guys yeah! got a hype train. I just got back. Oh, Bring so on the power subs. Bring on the po power subs. Bring on the power subs. Ah! <laughs> And Kami Char, thank you so much for buying a cup of coffee. I thank appreciate you. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. <laughs> a level five. Well, now it's level six. You're breathtaking. No, you're breathtaking. You're builder. breathtaking. Yeah. You're breathtaking. Well, we'll see if we'll see if Hazumi decides to join us as well. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah. Here, Did you guys give more? Mace, thank you for five gifted subs. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah! That's what oh, I ooh, like to see. Six, 60 more until the, the, the Power Rangers Super Sentai karaoke. Wow, that's yeah. so wild. That's so crazy. Unless it's unless it doesn't count the other parts of it. Oh, it doesn't count. Is that like power okay. <laughs> <laughs> I will not elaborate. I oh will do gosh. no such thing. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, whenever whenever Zeus gets back, I will be here. Yeah. Yes, Sentai karaoke. So I, I've I've been saying this for mm -hmm. I want to say like mid February is when I started actively talking about it because like. I I've I'm really bad at like telling people about things that I'm monetizing or right. like goals that I'm trying to reach and Joel Shia and Phoenix have tried very hard to like get me to come out of my shell for that. So <sighs> Uh, they they yell at me a lot about it. So here's the sub goal on stream on screen right here. You can see it. <laughs> 340 out of 400 subs. At yeah. 400 subs, I will plan a karaoke stream where I will do uh, Power Rangers openings and some Super Sentai openings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Kami, thank you again. I appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. Feel free to go back to Zeus's stream. Uh, tell her to stop staring into everyone's soul. She's like. I mean, Zeus? well, hold on. What if you, what if what if they're into that? Well, what if they're into that, it's okay. But like, cum lupins, do you do you do you like that? Yeah, cum lupins. Do you, you just do you like that? Stares into your soul yeah, like that. Yeah. Does that do anything for you? <laughs> does that uh, rustle your jimmies at all? Does it does it jingle your bells? Yeah. Does it deck <laughs> your halls? Does it <laughs> does it egg your nog? 
<laughs> your noggin. <laughs> does it? Um, does it? Does it? Uh, oh, okay. Um, Zeus. Zeus is apparently ordering some food, so we're gonna we're gonna take it. We're gonna take it back to the. Okay. I guess we could just hang here on the screen. It's not. It's not that big of a deal. Yeah, no Zeus worries. is gonna order some food, so we're gonna be here for a minute. Zeus is streaming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi guys. Remember, you can also come hang out here. You know, because yes. Zeus is staring into your soul. Like, I'm sorry. I mean, you can wait at Zeus's stream and still, you know, communicate with us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. But yeah, yeah. Thank you, everyone, for supporting time. Roy and Zeus. Thank it you, means guys. A lot I, it means a lot. Well, it means a lot to me. What do you mean to you? It means a lot to me. Oh my Listen, I've told you in private, as have I told Zeus. It makes me very happy to see both of you happy, and that's that's everything to me. I could care less about what you know happens what? to me, but as long as you two are happy, as long as everyone else is happy in chat, that that's what makes me happy. I am gonna hug the shit out of you. <laughs> or ask you, you try. or ask you to do very saucy ASMR RP with me. One of the two. Bring it on. Oh shit! Here we go. Oh hey, thank you, <laughs> Jeff Howard, for a prime sub. Hey, that's one more. Fifty nine to go. Holy My shit. bells have been jingled. <laughs> Listen, I'll jingle Kane's bells all night long. All right then. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Sigmund, thank you for the tier three. Holy <gasps> shit. Sigmund, thank you so much. Almost a year. Holy crap. Zeus stare. Oh my don't worry goodness. about Zeus. Listen, don't look at Zeus. Don't look at Zeus. Don't look at Zeus. Don't look at her. Look at me. Look at Zeus. Look at and Roy. Look at look at me instead. Look look at look at me. Look at me. Oh, sorry. Uh don't look at me anymore. I, I changed my mind. <laughs> 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 I changed my mind. Never mind. Look at Zeus. <laughs> there we go. Thank you. Yes, everyone keeps staring at Zeus. Oh, don't, my don't look at me. Gosh. Don't yeah. pog. <laughs> don't pog. Oh, so do we watch Super Sentai? Okay. Um, yes, yes, yes. Kane, oh, Kane this has is seen... probably a very good time, really yeah. quickly. If anyone has any questions about Power Rangers or Super Sentai in general, yeah. now is a great time to ask. Great time. Great time. Okay, um, but now continue. So someone did say, uh, have you seen Super Sentai? I have seen, I think, 12 seasons about. So I've seen uh, Jetman. All the way up to Gal Ranger, and I watched like the first ten or so of Hurricaneer. Um, I I want to go back to Hurricaneer. Literally, yes. the problem that I have with watching Super Sentai um, is because I have a lot of these on DVD. I don't have like right. a consistent good way to watch them in my free time because my free time is usually like three to yes. four hours, like at the end of the night, where like I just want to sit down and watch TV or you air know, quotes. It's TV. available on Tubi, right? Whoa. That's cr yeah, but I don't want to watch commercials. I want to like sit down and like. I, that's fair. I yeah, because especially because I own them on DVD. Because like I like supporting Shout <laughs> Factory. You know fair what I enough, mean? Fair enough. Um, I did sit down and watch Kuga though. The Blu-rays. Those were Kuga. Kuga, Kuga. Oh my god, Sorry. those were so pretty. Because Common Rider at when it when it came back for the 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 Heisei era when it first started, they started filming at fifty uh, sixty frames a second, and it's shot in mm -hmm. HD. Yes, and it's so pretty. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I hope at oh. some point we get more of those. Really quickly, I know we're not quite done with this, but yeah. uh, Sigmund has a question. Uh, yeah, do man. all the various Power Ranger series lead into one another, or is there a clear disconnection between certain ones? For Super uh, Sentai? That is a loaded question, um, because it depends. Uh, but continue on about uh, Super Sentai. Wait, was the question between Super Sentai or Power Rangers? Uh, Power Rangers. The first, like... Five seasons are all like direct continuations of each other because MMPR yes. goes into MMPR two, goes into MMPR three, goes into Zeo, goes into Turbo, goes into In Space, and then there it technically also goes in a Lost Galaxy, but it's a, a much looser connection than the previous yes. ones were. And but then it's still connected. Yes. It's still the same world. And then Lightspeed Rescue is the first time they really start like cutting it. In Assume that every single season of Power Rangers is connected up until Power Rangers Jungle Fury. After that, they kind of go into this AU alternate dimension universe. Yep. Um, and then it's very loosely connected up until um, <laughs> dimensions in danger. 
Kind of. I don't want to uh, talk about it. Thing. I don't want to talk uh, about it. I like the Master Morpher, and that's like it. <laughs> just assume. So every single season of Power Rangers is connected, with the exception of the Power Rangers Dino Charge universe yep. and the Power Rangers RPM universe. Yes. Um, but every single season of Power Rangers is connected in world. Yeah, that, that's but it. Th- there is also... Uh, <sighs> some weird variations of like, oh, the Dino Charge Rangers are in another world, but they're also yeah. canon within this universe, yeah. but they shouldn't be because reasons and dinosaurs. It's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. Roy, but, do you yeah. want to sing? I mean, singing's fun. I, I am working on my second cover song, so. Yeah. <gasps> I am working Your on my second, second cover? Yeah! You can see my first cover, exclamation point YouTube in chat. You can check it. It's my, uh, my pinned video. We can watch it on YouTube! You could. Wait, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Hold on. I like singing. It's I'm not I'm not like amazing at it and I'm still learning how to improve and things like no, that. I know that. But you know? No a fucking cover, shot. A cover yeah, oh, there we go. No, hold so on a, a shot. Cover actually huh. takes huh. a lot of like financial huh. you know. Wouldn't it be crazy huh. if you had some way to support Roy huh. and help him make this second cover? Huh. That would be wild, wouldn't it? Why did you just get 50 subs? Let's huh. go! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Apparently we're close to beating my record, like all-time record too. Holy yeah. crap, dude! Hazumi, oh, look at this! Did Hazumi just join? <laughs> yes! Hazumi! Hi. Roy just got 50 gifted subs! Yo! <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Oh my god. That's and then fine. another five. Oh <laughs> no, dude. He what is... Coming. Wait, wait, wait. Only eight left oh until we God. hit that goal. That was Wouldn't three it be left. crazy if we hit that wait, goal wait. tonight? No, we just hit no, 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 there three. it is. Whoa, that's yeah. wild. Okay, well, <laughs> we just we just hit the the sub goal that I now have to do a karaoke stream of Power Let's Rangers and Super go. Sentai openings. I will schedule that for probably next week. <laughs> thank you so much, everyone. Oh my God, guys, seriously, thank you. I'm gonna have to come up with a new sub goal. I. I, I, uh, 600 subs and Kane sings it with me. Yeah, what, we hot pardon? Uh, yeah, listen, I don't make the rules here, I just make the rules. Uh, what do you like? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me, let me, let me do some finagling real quick. I'm gonna turn off, uh, the, the, what's it called? The, the capture for, like, the, the group. Okay. And then I'm going to turn on reactives and we're going to switch to uh, reactives good. for everybody. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. No, no, no. no, no we no, we apologize. want you to be here. We we also just don't want to overload Zeus's computer. Yeah. And yeah. we want oh. everybody to feel like they can participate in this because we love Power oh. Rangers so much. So. Oh. Okay. I, really quickly. Yeah. Pause me. Mm-hmm. What do you know about Power Rangers? What do you know about Power Rangers? Let's, let's start um, here. I'm not going to lie. I don't really know much. I know Kamen Rider. But not Power Rangers. Wait, how much do you know about Common Rider? Yeah, I know that Hazmi knows about Common Rider, but I don't think I've yeah. ever talked to you about it. Oh my no, gosh. I don't think so. Well, uh, guys, thank you for all the subs. I really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still in disbelief. Wait, how close are we Let's to the record? Go. What is the record? Uh, we completed level 11. So. That's apparently. Oh, my all time is level 13. We're on level 11 right now. Okay. Ooh. Dang. The next level is the level. The next level is the level. Dang, mm. guys, thank you so much. Holy crap. Thank you, everyone. <sighs> well, well really Hazmi. Quickly, while I'm throwing. Uh, no, continue. Sorry. My I, fault. I was going to say, Hazmi, you're going to learn today. Oh, mm. okay. I can't be here for too, too long, but. I, <laughs> you're going to learn while you're here. You're going to okay. learn while you're here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm, da- I, I, I'm pretty interested because I've never really. I never watched Power Rangers growing up. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. Right. So. Okay. I, yeah. Hey, thank you for the hundred bits. Also, yes, W community. W community. Absolutely. Yes. Thank yes. You yes, yes. Bits. So yes. let's let's break it down pretty simply. So you know okay. you know Common Rider exists. You know it's a Japanese franchise. Mm-hmm. Mm. There is a sister franchise to Common Rider called Super Sentai. Are you familiar Are you with aware that? Of Super Sentai. How's it mean? I know Super Sentai. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Okay. More so. Oh, thank you for the two hundred bits. Universe. My gosh. Thank you. <laughs> um. Super Sentai 
is the source material for Power Rangers. Imagine if someone wanted to bring Super Sentai to the West, but adapt it. Mm -hmm. That's what I figured Power Rangers was. Yep. So that is okay. the idea. Okay. It started with okay. um, Kyoryu As Sentai Jurenja. So that was uh, the 16th season, which came out back Guys, in 1992. <gasps> Welcome back! No, the food's not here, and I'm dying. That's you. <laughs> oh, okay. I mean, we could keep watching in the meantime. We can, yeah. But so. wait, let me just put your Fujis up. Actually, I was gonna say, yeah. Do you say Fujis? I would say Fuji. Is it Fuji? Say it. Is it Fuji? No, it's it is actually Fuji. Oh, okay, Fuji? I don't, I don't know. No, I don't care either way. It's actually Fuji. <laughs> I, except, Thank you for the hundred okay, bits. So, so, Fuji was my old roommate. And I always told him, like, I refuse Wait, to call me... it Fuji because it's spelled <gasps> Fuji. And he was like, it was, I created the name when I was like a kid and I didn't know how to spell the difference. Oh. Between like Fuji. Mount That's Fuji funny. and yeah. Mount Fuji, Mount Fuji. I'll work. <laughs> I like that. Well, there's the end of the hype train. Guys, thank you so much for the amazing support and thank you for helping me get to my, uh, my Let's sub go! goal. Thank Holy you so crap. much. Crap. That is insane. Thank you, guys. Thank you Good for all the support. We'll definitely talk about that after stream on Twitter, and uh, I will plan that stream uh, accordingly, and we'll make sure it gets to be a lot of fun. But yes, uh, so Hazumi, um, yes. Power Rangers, uh, started back in 1993, uh, and they adapted yes. the uh, series Jurenger. Kyoryu Sentai Jurenger. Yep, which was uh, okay. dinosaur-themed, because dinosaurs were very popular back in the 90s because okay. of uh, Jurassic, I do Park. Know that Jurassic one. Park. Yep. Yeah. So... Uh, we we kind of have gone over like the first thirty minutes of the first series or so, which covered up to a uh, a very pivotal character named Tommy the Green Ranger. Right? Are you familiar with Tommy the Green Ranger at all? I thought Tommy was the Red Ranger. He, he also is the Red you're Ranger. Not wrong. You're not oh, wrong. Oh really? Oh, let's go. And, and the White Ranger <laughs> and the Black Ranger. The what? Huh? Don't it's, worry about it. Don't worry thing. about it. Don't, Zeus, we'll get there. We'll get there. Zeus, Stick with us, Zeus. Okay. We'll, get, we'll get there. Oh, we got you. We got you. So we just covered um, up to Tommy's introduction and him joining the team. Mm -hmm. So you, you may have mm -hmm. missed 30 minutes, but you probably have come in probably at a good time because the whole team is here now. Nice. So. Everyone is here. Yeah. Anyway, let us dive back into the wild world of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Oh, uh, Power okay. Rangers. Here we go. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The trouble with shell shock. We start off with the gang playing some basketball, including Tommy. Look at that. They're all such great friends already. <laughs> I have to play this basketball, back. Including Tommy. Look, Look how much he just eats shit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I freaking love it so much. Also, yes, I agree. We do need more Lord Dragon at some point. More Lord Dragon, mm. absolutely. No, I got you. I just read it. Thank you for the 500 bits. I'm sorry, I was just delayed. Oh, no! We're just, I was wheezing, you know? Yeah, already. yeah, yeah. Rita is apparently asleep, and Squat and Babu decide to make her happy by destroying the Power Rangers with their own monster. A turtle with a spotlight in its back. And a baseball that enjoys bat. enjoys baseball with a cannon and a hook. <laughs> I think this about this one often. This is what a child would come up with when creating a Power Rangers monster. I think about this it's one very powerful, often. pretty powerful, though. Honestly. It makes Trini run indefinitely with its green light and freezes Billy, Zack, and Kimberly with the red light. Oh, Whoa. no. I mean, that's all. Oh, no. <laughs> down already. The Maybe gang. Oh, no. And not Rita. <laughs> Trini is sent to find the cure since... You know, she's already out and about running around. True. Might as well. <laughs> Jason fights <laughs> running. Shock on his own with his Tyrannosaurus sword. But aren't we forgetting someone? Are yeah, we? Tommy. What's nah. he doing? Playing with a stick? Uh, nah. He's, like, yeah, he's getting the hang of it. Tommy's he just being killing. Yeah, he's just, he's just vibing. Just until she uh. <laughs> the magical cure. <laughs> hey, thank you so much. I appreciate it. And once again, continue their game of basketball. It Where Billy absolutely dunks on Zack. <laughs> Yo! I believe it. Go. Yeah, absolutely. Believe there it. we go. So somebody somebody brought this up, and I, I I'm gonna answer oh, yeah. it just because it's it's a funny thing. Um, mm -hmm. I why am I struggling? Oh, Bri so Brian Cranston was yes. actually a massive part of Power Rangers, mm. and a lot of people didn't know that he actually did voices for some of the monsters. Yes, he did. Uh, oh. And it's why Billy is named Billy Cranston. Yes, mm -hmm. it's why he's named uh -huh. him. We haven't gotten to the monster okay, okay. yet. But we will. Okay. So that's uh, Walter White or the dad from Malcolm in the Middle. Yes. So. Oh, uh, and Zordon okay. from the 2017 yes. Power Rangers movie. And Zordon from the 2017 Power oh. Rangers movie. So. Um, I, on another note of naming yes. like uh, 
off of other characters. Uh, one of the original executive producers, uh, Tony Oliver mm-hmm. of Power Rangers, um, he has a story about how his grandmother uh, could never quite pronounce his name correctly, and so would always say Tommy Oliver. Oh, now, that's so uh, <laughs> funny. I didn't know uh, that. Yeah. So when they got to naming uh, Tommy. Tommy. They thought it'd be very funny if they <laughs> named him Tommy Oliver. And that's why he's named that. <laughs> I love that. That's cute. Um, and Hazmi, that's I don't know how cute. much you know about voice acting in today's day and age, but uh, <laughs> Tony Oliver actually runs uh, Bang Studios or is one of the oh, higher ups. I know Bang Studios. There yeah. you go. So, mm-hmm. Bang Studios. There you go. He's yeah, still yeah, very he's active in ADR. Or something like that. Mm-hmm. I, I was going to say, I've seen Re- Rita, the, the villain. Barbara person. Goodson. I've seen her before. Yeah, well, I've seen like the character before. Yeah, I don't know where the gifts are I, shared very often about Rita, so it wouldn't surprise like, me yeah. at all. If you check in, I'll I'll post I'll start posting them in here. Uh, oh wait, um, I think my order is here. All right, go grab it. Let me get that one first. Yeah, I posted uh, it. In I'll, be, I'll be eating while well watching. So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah give me a moment. I'll just get it. Hey, no worries. Okay. Take your time. Um, oh, yeah. I, I'm sure that you've seen it. Uh, that is because... the gif I've seen. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the uh. <clears throat> After 10,000 years, I'm free! It's time to conquer Earth! That's her. Wow, you that's know. really good. Yeah, well, listen, Caden's a very talented man. You should see what he can... I don't know what you're talking about. <clears throat> anyway. <That's> <laughs> uh, but you'll probably notice a lot of um, pretty pretty famous people. Because um, I, I know you like anime, Hazmi. I've, I've seen mm-hmm. you around. Uh, do you know Johnny Young Bosch? Of co- I love Johnny Young Bosch. This is where he I'm got his start. you do. I well, oh, I I have heard that before actually. Yes, he's he the is. second. He's a frog. <laughs> he's a frog. <laughs> too too early. Oh. Too early. <laughs> too early. Too early. Too early. Too early. Uh, we will get to him eventually. He's not in it yet, but he does join uh, the show uh, during the second season. Of the um. Ah. Oh, okay. Okay. Around. Around like we're getting there. Yeah, you're, you're getting there. The, <laughs> around. I'll definitely not be there. Around. That, but... Around, <laughs> around this point. There we go. There he is. Yeah. There, there he is. Let's go. There, he is. there he is. He's on the left. There we go. There he is. So in in an <laughs> hour and Kurosaki. Yeah. There's Lelouch V Britannia. There's that. <laughs> you Narukami. <laughs> Hold on, Kane. Yes. Can you believe the audacity of some people in my chat right now? By the way, Dan Southworth was a Power Ranger too. Wow, that's crazy. That, what? Whoa! Did, he, you're, he was what? You're telling me the Quantum Ranger, Dan Southworth? Huh? That's ins- <gasps> what? <laughs> That's <laughs> near. Whoa! <laughs> Virgil from DMC? <gasps> no way! I don't believe that? No! That's, you're lying! Whoa! I'm. I'm. Listen. Next, you're gonna tell me that Aaron Cahill, who has done plenty of movies on I, like I the Hall- Cahill, actually. Cahill, Cahill has yeah. done tons of movies on the Hallmark Channel <laughs> and voices Rebecca Chambers in the Resident Evil franchise. <laughs> <laughs> or that. What is Whoa. it? Is it Austin Font? Who, whoever plays Wes? Is it Austin Jason Font? Font? Jason Font. Jason Font. Is also a motion capture artist who has done stuff in Devil May Cry as well. He's a what? Yeah. You're not going to hit us with that. Trust me. <laughs> you ain't going to know anything <laughs> that we don't already know. Did you know that the red RPM Ranger is in the MCU? That's crazy. <laughs> next, you're going to tell me he was Jessica Jones' crackheaded neighbor. That's yeah. insane. <laughs> Whoa, next you're going to tell me RPM Yellow starred in a franchise called iZombie on the CW. Wait, Did you no know way. that the, uh, Jungle Fury Rider Ranger is also in the MCU? Yeah, That's it, wild. Is there like a background character though? <laughs> <laughs> I think so, yeah. But did you know that Archie Cow from Power Rangers Lost Galaxy isn't I, I don't I actually don't know the series. It's like a it's like a NCIS series or something like that. I, that doesn't surprise me. It doesn't surprise but me. But he's in that and <laughs> <laughs> Next, you're going to tell me that Mariska Hargitay, huge star of the franchise Law & Order SVU, was supposed to be in the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie. I had no idea. That That's is so crazy. That is so wild, wacky, <laughs> crazy. I've never, I've never heard any of this ever. Also, Tyga, are you in chat? Hold on a second. I see you posting the, um, actually, what are you? Yeah. What are you doing? No, I think he posted it because I, I think he's just. It. I think he's just in the live chat or live text. This. I can't believe he would do this. I can't believe he would do this to us. That's wild. <laughs> That's crazy. 
<sighs> yeah, uh, Hazumi, we know a lot about this franchise. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. I can tell. Yeah. I can tell. There's a lot. <laughs> There's a lot to digest in 30 yeah. something years. There's a lot. What is your favorite um, Kamen Rider series? <gasps> Common Rider Denno. I'm back. What name. what sound that I heard? Don't worry I'm, about it. I heard I heard a I heard a <laughs> screech of a of a mammal. <laughs> Is that what I heard? <laughs> uh, yeah, I heard that. I heard that. Yeah, that's, I've that's what I heard. Once been called the <laughs> the screech <laughs> of a mammal. <laughs> I don't. I, <laughs> what? <laughs> Anyway, yeah. uh, so uh, so anyway. Kane Kane likes Deno. I have not seen as much Common Rider. I've only seen I've seen Ichigo, uh, V three. Uh, You've seen all the show eras. Not all the show eras, but I've seen Ichigo V three. Uh, some oh of uh, X. Uh, I saw Black and Black mm. RX, which I thought were really good. I saw mm. Kuga Agito, uh, Ryuki, uh, Fies, which is hot garbage. And is the worst season I've seen. And I so hot garbage. I love how you were so confident I, with saying it's that. so bad. It's so Fies freaking is bad. So beloved, which is so wild to hear Roy say that. It's so bad. Mm. Like literally, I watched it with my Discord community over like the course of like two months or so. It's it was it took mm -hmm. us two months because it was just I was having such a hard time with it. Um, oh my! And we started Blade, but then I got busy with other things. So mm -hmm. <laughs> all good. Is all good. Anyway, let's get back into anyway. Power Rangers, shall we? <laughs> Sorry for the long break. Oh, I can't believe gosh. this. I can't no, believe it's this. Fine. Listen, we told you it was going to be a seven-hour stream, and we're only thirty minutes into oh, two fine. to a three-hour movie. I mean, it's, uh, it's my yeah. afternoon. I think I'm more concerned for you guys. Yeah. No, no, no. Please, oh, this is nothing. Oh, we'll be fine. oh my gosh, I, I can't believe that Hazumi is going to be here for the whole thing. Too. That makes oh, me so I'm happy. so let's happy go. that Hazumi is going to be here. Uh -huh. Thank you, Hazmi. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, that's you're going to stay here for seven or to eight hours, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hazmi? Wait. Yeah? Wait, it's your afternoon? Yeah, it's my afternoon. It's 1 27 p.m. Yes. What the? <laughs> yeah. Mount Olympus has crazy time zone differences. Yes. Yep. This is why Zeus is always streaming at like. <laughs> this time three in the morning for you guys yeah mm -hmm. i was gonna say but this is usually the time that i start to stream too what's my excuse oh my the time i start to stream as well <laughs> oh my goodness anyway it's more time in the middle of my streams oh my gosh mm -hmm. Okay. Itsy Bitsy Spider. Hope you guys Angel like spiders. Is going to tear down the long-standing spirit statue that's supposed to protect the citizens from bad bugs. Also, yes, Everyone's I saw the Fies movie. Saving it, especially Zach. He hates bugs. He's so attractive. Vulcan skull and skull mm -hmm. that throw these roaches not be allowed everywhere. To wear that shirt. It's pretty oh. disgusting, honestly. With a tarantula oh my God. ending up on Zach's shoulder and him freaking out. Yeah. Which, honestly, bro. Same. Rita <laughs> takes notice of this and overnight switches out the real statue for a fake one. We cut to Zack teaching his hip hop keto class, which I believe is the first mention of it. Hip hop yep. keto being Zack's dad. I, I just love the name hip hop keto. So, remember how we were talking about how Billy created a flying car? Well, mm -hmm. Zack creates his own martial art called hip hop keto. Yeah. <laughs> think Not hop keto, hip hop hip, keto. Uh, hip hop keto. Hip which, hop keto. Think, hip hop keto. Think honestly like traditional uh, karate. With like uh, -huh. uh capoeira almost. Yes. There's a lot of like flow and dance and, and things like that to it. And mm -hmm. it's pretty cool. It actually looks really good, especially in the second season when they actually let him do it. Dance. Honestly, his shirt style. is doing him great. <laughs> he's sleeping bugs to put so, Zach's so attractive and he's he no right to be. Because they're mm -hmm. bugs and runs to the statue for safety. Where he realizes there's snakes in the statue's hair as opposed to flowers. Well, that's crazy. Oh my goodness. It, that's enough justification to morph and blow it to bits. <laughs> where it reveals a giant spider monster. Oh, ew! Yeah! <laughs> which is even worse for Zack. Especially with the spider being pretty powerful that and spider disassembling has a big the dumpy, I'm sorry. It do. <laughs> it's got that thorax. <laughs> it's got that thorax. <gasps> Larry, thank you so much for the 55 months. Mode. Holy Besides crap, thank you. Zord, we finally get to see the Dragon Zord fighting mode in action. With it drilling like, a hole I love right this. through the spider. Look at that oh shot! Yeah. Oh wait, I gotta, I gotta play that again. Hold on. Drilling a hole right through the spider. <gasps> Look at that! That's that would so never cool. fly. No, they can never that do stuff never like that again. Today. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty metal. The day is saved, and Zach is still afraid of toy spiders. Oh my gosh. Again, I don't <clears throat> same. In the spit flower, we have one of Rita's worst plans ever. 
Kimberly is designing it's, a float. It's for a pretty the bad one. Parade where mm. Rita sends down the putties to destroy it. What, Just what to mess with her. <laughs> like, yeah, Kimberly is sad by it. I mean, you know, it, what what's worse, this or destroying her grandmother's spinning wheel, Kane? <laughs> Gosh, I don't even. I. <laughs> I thought you were gonna. I feel like the grandmother at... one. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, we'll get there. To begin. <laughs> we'll get. We'll get there. Don't worry. We'll, we get to see that Amy Jo Johnson, who portrays Kimberly, is actually a very good actress. And I love mm -hmm. this outfit. Power. Oh, it's, yeah. it's very good. But Oof. yeah, Power Rangers is down there it's, acting it's a lot. Just a minor inconvenience. She then creates a flower monster. All right, that's a little more threatening. The Rangers are sent to deal with it, all except for Tommy, who's busy rebuilding Kimberly's float. Concept. Wow, that's crazy. That's the. Aww. That's the second time he wasn't involved in a fight. Hmm. That's so wild. Man. It's almost as if there's a reason for that, but we won't get into that right Man. now. Yeah, I was I was about to say like, why has Tommy to just been yet. in the in the bench for like? To help the where is right there? He's right. Where is he? Right there. there. <laughs> That's crazy. And we see that Kimberly's float does end up being in the parade, all thanks to Tommy's hard work. What a Aww. guy. Life's a masquerade. That's crazy. There's a costume party going on at the juice bar. Oh, actually, and this episode because it's so up. stupid. Rita even gets in on the fun, creating literally the Frankenstein monster. And then the Sentai yep. is literally Frankenstein's monster as well. Yeah. <laughs> is this Frankenstein? It must be a slow creative yeah. day for him. The monster oh, shows gosh. up to the dance, and he kind of sucks. A girl mistakes it for her boyfriend, and they dance. They and he's be like clearly that. trying to hurt her, but is too slow. Like, how is this supposed to be a threat? <laughs> There's a really cool part where the monster... Which is very ironic, because he's moving girl, very fast. <laughs> yeah. ...will stand up for her. <laughs> Shoots him in the head with a dart! They just shoot the him with a dart. Throw the girl Listen, but and Bulk and Skull are like, whoa, you can't do that. And they try and, like, stick up for her. See? Yeah. Bulk and Skull are good guys. You can't, you can't say that when they suddenly her. did that thing with Trina. Well. Okay, Trini, listen. Trini. I'm not saying they're perfect yet, okay? I'm just saying, <laughs> I'm just saying, there's more they're to them than the meets the eye, eye, okay? Mm -hmm, yeah, mm -hmm. for them, but it's more nice to see them eye. try to do something good. <laughs> I also like when Billy morphs, and instead of saying it's morphin' time, he says, it's time for molecular transmutation. Like, who are you trying to show off to? <laughs> Oh my god. It, it, a nerd moment. Again, and makes it back to the party. Just Does he do that every time? No. I think, it's, I think it's the oh. only time he actually gets a solo morph where he says it's time for, it's time for molecular, molecular transmutation. Because remember, he's the nerd. It's why they keep covering his arms because you're not allowed to know that he's actually the most ripped character in the entire show. He really is. I don't know if you know that, uh, Hazumi. No, why would I know that he's the most ripped character? <laughs> the, guy, the guy, the guy on the far right, he's the nerd. Anyway. His actor's name is David <laughs> Yost. Uh, he's he's in. He was an IRL gymnast. So prior to the show, yes. he came on like giga fit, giga jacked, mm. and mm -hmm. is. They have to hide his physique a lot because they're like, well, the nerd can't be like the most ripped person on the show. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that's so funny. Costume contest, yeah. Got it, yeah. <laughs> which turned out to be Alpha. That's crazy. He even gets all the ladies. <laughs> Gung Ho is a really fun episode. Jason and Tommy are training for some ninja duos competition. Whatever that but means. They're having issues working together, both seemingly hmm. having pretty big egos and trying to one up each other. Wow, that's a so wild. Huh. That's like so a wild. Reel for Asian Austin kids. St. John and Jason David Frank, both showing off their impressive martial arts and athletic abilities. <laughs> But hey, I'll take it. Most episodes of Power Rangers we, has people talk. We will, we will talk about it later, but there's a reason why their mm. rivalry seems so good in the show. They actually mm. really dislike they each other. I, I would even other. argue they hate. Do? Yeah. Really? They hate. I would argue even at this hate. point. Yeah, even at this yeah. point, they hate each other. Like the actors. Yeah. Yeah, they, they, <gasps> don't, make, they don't make it that way or something. No, oh. they... So they... <sighs> There's a lot of actor drama, but a lot of the reason is that like JDF would always say like, oh, you know, Jason mm. or Austin St. John, the Red Ranger, tells a lot mm -hmm. of tall tales. And then Jason also didn't like that Tommy came and took the spotlight. And there's a whole lot of reasons that are thrown around. I'm not, this isn't the stream for it, but just know mm -hmm. that they don't like each other yeah. at all. Okay. And it's, it's okay. not acting when they don't like each other. It is it's pretty genuine so yeah it's real it's, it's acting when they do like each other so <laughs> Strong and rangers fighting yeah here though you get humans fighting and rangers fighting 
Lots of fighting. This episode is like 90% spin kicks. Meanwhile, Rita is creating <laughs> super putties. What makes them super? They get a belt now. Although they are pretty they indestructible. And Zordon That's the only one. To find the a belt. Weapons. That'll be able to destroy the putties. As well as teach them the importance of working together. Well, it's crazy. They struggle at first, so but eventually get the hang of it. Even coming across a new sword, Titanus, who initially attacks the rangers oh, as gosh. a test. They find yeah. the blasters, destroy the super putties, and Jason and I would just like to point out rangers that as a test. They these. Find so in, in Power Rangers, these are called the Thunder Slingers because they're mm -hmm. essentially slingshots that attach to their blasters. Oh. This is the only episode they're ever shown in. Yeah. They went through this whole trial and tribulation to yep. only use them once. Yep. The only, wow. the I only thought, episode. But I hey, they were like guns. you know what? New toy. I mean, they are, essentially. Essentially, new, okay. New toy. New, new toy. Yeah, new toy. The blasters destroy the super putties. <laughs> yeah. And Jason and Tommy go on to become Angel Grove's best ninjas. It's That's a really good episode, mainly because of the long scenes of Jason and Tommy showing off their moves. Yeah. Wheel and their of bodies. misfortune. And their bodies. The school's yeah. doing mm -hmm. a play on Rumple. Oh, here we go. Which for some reason, Bulk and Skull are taking part in. We finally get one of the props. Amy Jo Johnson Kimberly's acting. Yeah. Spinning wheel, which Bulk abuses and eventually breaks. And Kimberly giving one of the most genuinely yes, terrifying go. shouts I've ever heard. Hey, you ruined my grandmother's spinning wheel. Jesus, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, that is she, she, she was mad. She yeah. was mad. Yeah. She she can act, you know. She's like her she, actual Amy grandma. Is yeah, such mm -hmm. an actor. I love her. I love her so much. Kimberly sat her wheels broken. Tommy goes off to fix it. Monster attacks. Save the day. Whoa, that's crazy. Tommy mm -hmm. wasn't. Tommy, part Tommy the, just fixes it. Okay. Well, Tommy wasn't part of the main fights again. What? That's so mm. wild. Man, that's that's crazy. Tommy was missing again. <laughs> Whoa. I, I wonder anyway, why. Anyway. <laughs> Island of Illusion Part One. Ah, yes. We start off with Zach practicing for. Wait, some do they dance all know that they're rangers, or do they? Go ahead, Kane. No. Your your turn. So. <laughs> no, not everyone knows that they're Power Rangers. Uh, they shouldn't, anyway. It's one of Zordon's rules. Um, so no one can know it, that they're Power Rangers. Mm. Uh, there are a couple times where they let it slip, but it's like future but, like, seasons. The friend group knows. Yeah. Like the, the friend group that is. Okay, oh, they that's, that's all know I... that they, they are Power Rangers. Yeah. Okay, okay. That'd be, that'd be a little interesting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they're working with people that they don't know who they actually are, but they're all disappearing they just, at the I mean, same isn't, time. Isn't that miraculous ladybug? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Miraculous. yeah. Oh, you're right. You know, you sound a lot like my friend Zach, but never mind. No, no, no. Hi, Black Ranger. <laughs> yeah, How are you? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that yeah, is kind of miraculous ladybug. I ironically, <laughs> Gal Ranger is kind of like that. They they know what each other looks like, but until like three fourths of the way through the season, they yeah. don't know each other's names. Like it's yeah. it's just you're you're red, you're black, you're yellow, you're yeah. blue, you're oh. you know that that's a different season for a different plot and for different reasons, but yes. Mm. <laughs> mm. Taking confidence and doesn't feel like he could win. That's important. Remember that. Wow, it's crazy. Meanwhile, Rita summons Low Car, this giant Okay. We have to talk okay, we got Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, go ahead, go ahead. Do it. So Zhu Ranger. Kyoryu Sentai Zhu Ranger, uh, uh, mm. Bandora, who is Rita in, in, in the Japanese footage, uh, is, a, mm. is an mm -hmm. evil witch uh, that comes from the right. time that the Zhu Ranger come from, which is from the time mm. of Pretty dinosaurs. Story. Dinosaurs. Yeah. yeah. So okay. she is a witch in the literal sense, meaning she gets her power from Satan. Oh, this is Satan. Go. Meet Satan. This is Satan. <laughs> Canonically this in is Power what Rangers. Satan looks like. they, they get their powers from Iron Mouse? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you know, uh, I, this this may have been an imposter because, like, you know, this is not Satan. This is Satan. Mm. You know? Ah, uh, okay. Satan. Yeah. Okay. Satan. Satan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, quite, quite literally, this is Satan. Um, this is what mm -hmm. the devil looks like. And okay. he gives Rita powers and does a lot of really goofy stuff sometimes that doesn't make sense, but honestly is not that big of a threat. And then also has a nephew that shows up later in the franchise. And most huh? people forgot who this guy. Yeah. It's listen, it's wild. like, yeah, it's like 25 years in the future. I'm not even kidding. And this is like one of his only appearances. And they were like, everyone's going to totally yeah. remember low car. What the fuck? <sighs> 
Oh, say, oh someone, someone said in my chat, Satan at, uh, say, Satan at home. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, yeah. this is Satan at home, guys. <laughs> Can I have Iron Mouse? We have Satan at home, darling. And then <laughs> this. <laughs> we have oh Satan God. at home from Japan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And Rita hates kids for, for because dinosaurs killed her child. So she was like, hey, it's Satan. Oh. It, complicated situation. That's in Japanese. In yeah. Japanese. In in. Mm -hmm. in English, Rita is just evil for the sake of being evil. Yeah, it okay. be like that. Anyway, evil Satan. spirit head that actually kind of freaked me out when I was a kid. He's pretty yeah, powerful, insane. and with it's the help baiting. of another monster, they managed to weaken the rangers and send them to the Island of Illusion. Ooh. Which just looks like any backyard in California. <laughs> Seriously, this island's pretty much <laughs> like to be here. Oh my god, they're the right. Wow. Is pretty terrible. Whoa, it's that almost is, like this oh was filmed god. in LA. That's crazy. That's so wild. That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> Summoning past monsters to confront the rangers, only then to be shown that they're just illusions. Oh. This freaks out Zack, who runs away, but runs into a snake. This freaks oh. him out even more, but no one else snake. can see the snake. With Zack's confidence being almost completely obliterated, he slowly starts to dematerialize and huh? disappear. Oh, yeah. oh whoops. Leading into the what? island of illusion. <laughs> My bad. Two. The rangers run into a native little man named Quagmire. Quagmire. <laughs> a native crimes, little man. <laughs> does give them advice, essentially saying their lack of confidence will cause them to disappear on the island, and the only way to fight is to regain that lost confidence. Where Zach I do like remembers these. fighting the dark warrior and eventually I like that this as a clip show. This memory causes Zack to feel better I had fun about with it himself and turn back to normal. Aww. We then mm -hmm. get the same situation with everyone else. Kimberly loses confidence, remembers a past episode. Tommy loses confidence, remember. I would like to point out that. Remembers a past episode. I remember. Yep. I would like to point out everyone else is remembering times that they basically either soloed a monster or like mm. were, were the reason that they beat a monster. And Tommy mm. is remembering fighting putties. Just every day, you know, the foot soldiers. That, that mm -hmm. he <laughs> kind of struggles with. But anyway. Remembers a past episode. I love it didn't show about like everyone. him with it like kind Jason. Of acts as a yeah, no. Nope. show. All <laughs> yeah, of the Rangers for eventually some reason. overcome their insecurities, defeating the island, or they escape, take down the monster in Lokar, and thwart Rita's evil plan once again. I mean, she's getting Yay. such a headache. It's the dance contest. Although it probably wasn't that hard for him since his only competition oh. was apparently <laughs> I, I have to point this out, because the last time when Kane and I reacted to this the mm. first time, this guy right here, apparently one of my mm. chatters was like, Yeah, that was my teacher in high school or something. And he gave yeah. us his name and we like looked it up. And we were like, Huh? That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. So hey, That's small so world, funny. I guess. Yeah. Bulk. The rock star. The gang's going on a vacation. Oh everyone except Hold on. I'll pause it during Oh, it. it's the this episode! Star. Okay. So, the rock star. this is a flying car, Hazumi, that Billy made. Oh. In, in 1993. In 1993. Yeah, he just made it. Yeah, he just made, made it. it from scratch. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. The nerdy guy? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. With the buff arms. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> also, <laughs> almost thank you for buying a cup of coffee. I appreciate you. The gang's going Let's on go. a vacation. Let's go! Thank you. Except for Jason, who's spending time with his younger cousin. You like, you like anime who, dubs, right, Hazumi? I swear, is dubbed over like, by a different dubs? person entirely. Oh, is this the one that you guys were talking about? Yeah, this is so bad. I Listen to this. I definitely watch over by subs more than dubs, but okay. Well, mm -hmm. um, let me let me let's see if you can spot if this is dubbed or not. Go ahead, go ahead and take a listen. A different person entirely. Hey, Jace, teach me a cool move. Why? <laughs> well, <laughs> no, I don't think it's dubbed at all. Okay, you know what? I'm so glad we brought the dubbing expert on. Thank you. Appreciate you. Oh my You're, God. Welcome. You're appreciate welcome. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. That is definitely <laughs> real. Yeah. Fishing, practicing martial arts, and even <laughs> dealing with folk. Heck, the putties even attack oh, no, the pizza. and Jeremy is able to hold it. Yeah. Listen. Listen, if a it looked like a shitty pizza things, anyway. Maybe it's time to go back to the drawing board. This whole episode is kind of the Jeremy show. There's a rock monster that can only be defeated by some magic mirror where Jeremy finds the map and goes off to find it. Even mm. blowing up a putty. All right, well, that's... I feel like wow. this is what it was in the Sentai too. I don't remember entirely, but I think it was just a random kid that they were kind of like rescuing that I did all this. I think so too. Uh -huh. I don't yeah. quite remember either. I remember. Also, I'm so sorry. The I, eventually... My friend landed so early, so I have to go run to the airport now. Wow, Hazumi! Oh, oh, man, what do you she mean? was just here for the They were supposed to land in 20 minutes. Well, you know oh, what? We'll be here when you get back, okay? Yes. The Power mm -hmm. Rangers will be here. Yes. Yeah, uh, you'll definitely be here for the next seven hours. So. Yes, we will. Definitely. Not exaggerating, yes. we probably mm -hmm. will. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we will be. All right, Hazumi, bye, see you later. Bye, bye. 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 Bye.
<laughs> All right. Never well, heard from Hazumi ever again. Okay. Don't say that. We'll hear from Hazumi again <laughs> when she's ready to morph into action. <laughs> oh my gosh. Absolutely. To use that mirror mm -hmm, to mm -hmm. save the day, and Jeremy is excited to tell the gang about his awesome adventures and getting to meet the power. <sighs> Man, the suits. Yeah, mm, yeah. The, the, those, those. Oh, yeah. with his weirdly <sighs> dubbed voice. But the Power Rangers, they were the coolest. Calamity Kimberly. <laughs> Kimberly wakes up and is immediately having the worst day ever. She breaks a mirror, doesn't like her outfit, gets drenched in the rain when her umbrella breaks. It sounds like a normal Tuesday. Again, <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> from Skull. How could this True day get any worse? Well. Kimberly could get stuck in a magic jar. Gross. And yeah. the Rangers oh. could have to. Also, <laughs> Tommy gets his ass kicked. Again. What? Oh, yeah. This is the one that <laughs> Roy likes to talk about this episode very so, often. Not, this isn't the, speci the specific one. He just he tries okay. to fight that monster oh, that okay, captures okay. Kimberly and he gets knocked into a tree, but he got his ass kicked. So. The to save her. That's exactly what happens. And he's like injured. You also get to see a so. funny mm. restaurant, which yeah. is pretty funny. Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh. Is born. Yeah, that was it. That's the, the entire episode. The tryouts for a martial arts lead in a commercial. Tommy, of course, trying out, since anytime we see him, he's doing karate by himself instead That's of crazy. helping the Rangers. Whoa. He does karate by himself instead of helping the Rangers? No way. That's so oh my wild. god, he's having a he's having his like training arc right now. That's he's having no? a normal yeah. day. <laughs> That's... <laughs> but That's insane. is confident that he's gonna get the role. Even getting a tan and Getting covered in mayonnaise. What? I didn't need to see that. And this scene goes on for way too long. It is. It is like Scorpion multiple and minutes. A monster attack yeah. Andrew Grove, eventually capturing the ranger. <laughs> <laughs> way too long. Scorpina and a monster attack Angel Grove. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm. I. I don't apologize. Yeah. What's what's wrong? What what's wrong? Like. What's wrong, Zeus? Yeah. I know what? What, that what do you yeah. mean? Pillow. What? Yeah. yeah. What, what's, what's the problem? What's the problem, Zeus? No pillow looks like that. No, no pillow looks like that. I'm sorry. What do you mean? It's it's clearly a prison to trap the rangers in. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. It's it's, uh -huh. it's a prison that to trap too? them in. Oh wait, Kane, you know what? You know you know what I'm thinking. No, no, it looks like one of those. So you know when you go to souvenir shops and they have those little uh, little um tubes with the water and the glitter in them. Yes. Yeah, that's what that is. I, it's, you know what? You're so real for that. So true, Bristy. Yeah. So true. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Eventually uh -huh, capturing uh -huh. the rangers in See? some tube. Just this looks tube. like a job for the Green Ranger, who is currently busy doing spin kicks. Okay, doing yep. karate. He's busy. He's busy. He's got important things to do. Out of their mind. <laughs> <laughs> I also forgot to mention in the last episode. But the hey, Aris, thank you for being here. Welcome Titanus, in. Where the Megazord can combine with both the Dragon Zord and Titanus, creating the Ultra Zord. That's crazy. It's wow. super bulky, but essentially just acts as a toys. Look at that. it's Toy. literally the toys too. New toys. It's literally New the toys. toys. It's New literally toys, toys yeah. for the boys. <laughs> tank, shooting loads mm -hmm. of missiles at the monster. That's crazy. Tommy gets the role in the commercial. And we all have nice. new toys to buy. I love this yeah, toy. New, it, it looks exactly the same. I <laughs> love this so much because when we got like a redo of the toys back in like the, the mid 2010s. Mm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mid 2010s. So they remade yeah. everything with die cast, which is like a heavy plastic combined it's with metal. So heavy. It is very to... heavy. But Wait, it's, this is heavy? How heavy is this? It's like multiple pounds. Like it's oh, they're God. chunky. They're chunky. Wait, so, uh, kilograms, please. Um. Um. Uh, it's like three stones. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what it is in kilograms. Stones, yeah, they're big stones. Um, okay, okay, all right. So, okay. <laughs> to, to put it to put it into kind of perspective, uh, mm. when they. Uh, fixed everything and added diecast metal. It was so heavy okay. the thing couldn't stand up properly. Yep. Oh, so wow. when they, they designed it in such a way that it couldn't stand on its own. So when they released it with with uh with Titanus here specifically, they included these little plastic brackets to lock the knees in place. Oh. And I had those, and those snapped because it was st like still it's so heavy. heavy. Yeah. They like, still snap even having like, that safety precaution. That's yeah. this. You see how this is shiny up here? Yeah. That's just metal. Oh In fact, I wonder yeah. how long, how long, uh, Legacy Mighty Morphin 2014, Megazord? 2015, I think. Because mm. I think they were trying to do it during Megaforce to, like, amp mm -hmm. up the, the anniversary, I think. 
Yeah, die cast is very hevel heavy. It's metal and like heavy plastic, essentially. Okay. But yeah. Um. So the the base Megazord by itself, uh, without the Dragon Zord, is about three pounds. There you go. Mm -mm. Which um, I don't know how much that actually is in kilos, but I know the Dragon Zord is um, heavy. Okay. Okay. But anyway. I... Anyway, back to it. it. The yoke's on you. The youth center is love on a talent show where, you guessed it, Jason and Tommy are going to show off their martial arts. How oh, about gosh. you give someone else a chance? <laughs> I'm sure this guy can do something cool. The b plot's <laughs> kind of weird. That. Squat and Babu eat these eggs that turned out to be this monster's lunch. However, <laughs> it's clear from the Sentai footage that these eggs were his children. Yeah. He's upset by it. Power Rangers clearly didn't oh, apparently it's 1.3 kilos. Dark, so instead, it's just his lunch. But it's a weird fact, knowing what the Sentai was doing. Yeah. I mean, look, there's even a scene with the monster crying over his oh, eggs. Like, he wouldn't yeah. die. It's really yeah. sad. Those were his children. It, Tommy, it's pretty messed up. <sighs> this is the episode. Oh, I get to talk about this. Okay, hold on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause it. So what does the episode okay. mean? Like, he wouldn't do that over his lunch. I'm going to pause Those it. were his children. So you see how like Tommy's like coming down from something? He's like almost swinging. Yeah. So yeah. You you, wanna, you know how I've also been like ragging on Tommy a lot, where it's like, oh, he's like off doing his own thing again. He's doing martial arts. Mm -hmm. He's uh mm -hmm. doing a commercial. Yeah. He's you know fixing yeah. something. Not um, doing mm -hmm. Power Ranger things. <laughs> so uh, Tommy got captured by putties and put up in a net in the air, which is why he's swinging down from a tree. So, he, as he was mid-air, he got captured in a net and stuck to a tree. <laughs> yeah. Why? So um, that's, how that's did he get there in the first place? The, the putties captured him. With a net. With a net. That they threw up into the air. No, it, it happens on screen. But, like, oh, okay. it's, it's why he's not in the fight with the rest of the rangers. Because oh, he got okay. captured by putties. Okay. So... Yeah, his natural enemy, his his actual nemesis. <laughs> Gravity. It and... was the Red Ranger. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy eventually escapes after being kidnapped. Whoops the putties and helps the Rangers destroy the monster. Eventually escapes. Where, yes, they then show off at the talent show and everyone claps. Yay! The green candle part one. It's your favorite thing, Ooh, King. Of episodes. Now you might have noticed that Tommy isn't ever really involved with the main group. Well, so wild. Showing up late or being captured. Wild. Well, this was intentional. You see, in Zhu Ranger, the Green Ranger wasn't around that long. Spoilers, he ends up dying, <gasps> meaning there's not a it lot is, of Green Ranger Sentai footage. It yep. is giga sad. It it's is really sad. Yeah. Like, it's real bad. Yeah, it, it, this is a big like difference between Super Sentai and, and Power Rangers as well. Or Sentai, because Japanese uh, children audiences are, are typically considered more mature than American children audiences. Oh, oh, okay. So okay. they're able to deal with more, air quotes, adult storytelling. Yes. Um, like characters Sad dying. Stuff. Tragedy. And, it, mm -hmm. yes. and it's pretty bad. There are some Sentai stuff that's pretty messed up. Oh, God. <laughs> Funeral ghosts. Yeah. It's pretty bad, dude. He gets. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to tell. I don't want to say too much about it. But like in Die Ranger, for example, mother is worried about her her son's power because he's gonna get found by monsters if she doesn't seal it. So she takes a hot iron and burns a sigil onto him, and we see the scene of her burning like a hot iron onto yeah. him. A lot of Super Sentai is very very uh, graphic. Yeah. It's. Oh my. It's pretty messed she up. She pulled a <laughs> Yeah. Well, Basically. she. She did it and then immediately like pulled him close into like a she she had to do it kind of thing. Yeah. Like it, it oh wasn't like a god. she wanted to. It was like if I don't do this, he'll die type thing. Oh my god. Yeah. That so. is oh yeah. Anyway. Hence okay. why Tommy always shows up at the last second to just summon the dragon zord and then leave. Yeah. In the green candle, Rita creates a green candle that's Whoa. linked directly to the dragon coin and its power. Crazy. Because she, oh. the green Ranger's she has it because she was the original owner of the powers. Once the powers. candle is completely oh. burned out. It is a, it is a widely... Oh. Um, so, yeah, go ahead. Mm. No, no, no. Uh, the reason why Rita... I don't think Connor explained this. Uh, and if he did, I apologize. So, the reason why Rita had the candle... Or the, the coin in the first place. The Green Ranger coin. Is because mm. there's supposed to be a episode during Green with Evil. Where Zordon mentions uh, he had a contest with Rita. And whoever won or something like that um, got possession of this coin. Which is why Rita had it. And Zordon didn't at the beginning of the series. Yep. Um, mm. 
So that's why she has it. And I'm assuming it's never quite stated how she gets the link from the candle to the coin. But I'm assuming it's because she had it in her possession for so long. So oh, okay. I think the explanation was because she made it. But then like that doesn't make sense with later information. It's just something that they said here. And then the new candles don't make sense for that as well, which we'll get into later. Yes. Okay. okay. So there's you'll, you'll find a lot with Power Rangers, um, especially in the first season. There's a lot of stuff that they like they kind of throw out as like a this is an idea we had that we feel like makes sense now. And then like in a season or two or even way off in the future, they kind of retcon and change it to make more sense with other things that they've done so far. Yes. So mm, yeah. OK, OK. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, uh. The Green Ranger powers will be lost forever. <laughs> There's also a subplot with a dance happening and Tommy wanting to ask out Kimberly. That oh, I'm not sure about, Brandon. Buddy's attack, and we get this. You can check the the so Power Rangers main scenes. YouTube channel though, and find all of this uh, for free. Fast-paced and exciting fights. He does get captured though, when sent to the same dark dimension. Whoa! He got captured again. Where gold oh is my God. Crazy. Wow. Rita, he'll be able That's to keep insane. his powers. He naturally rejects this offer and tries to fight Goldar head on, even managing <laughs> to trick him, escaping the dark dimension, and helps the rest of the Rangers who are currently fighting a monster. Later, Gold Guy. They defeat it and return back to the <laughs> command center, where Zordon informs everyone about the green candle oh, and no. how it is something to worry about. Oh no! And the team needs to come Wait, up with I a plan. Wait, I want to ask because I yeah. suddenly. Yes, please do. Okay, like if 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 the, if the story is different from America to Japan, mm. uh, and somehow they managed to make the costume there, why couldn't they just? Get, like I would say, use use their own production money to have more of Tommy, which is the Green Ranger. So it's, I would, if I had to explain this, because we I don't think we ever get a real explanation. It's because they mm. don't know what to do yet. Oh. <laughs> this is their first season, and this is like twenty something episodes in, and they caught lightning in a bottle. And they, I mean, you, you saw how they were acting, just like in scenes where they weren't doing anything. How much more a fight scene, you know? Yeah. Um, mm, if that's I true. had to assume that's probably the reason. But they couldn't I don't hire like stunt that. actors. Not yet. So, so there's something that kind of happens around season two that, due mm. uh, to, uh, we'll, 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 we'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. But. Around this point, I don't think they quite knew what to do with the suit. And while what you're saying does make a lot of sense, I don't think it quite occurred to them at that point. It's also oh, ironic yes. that you said it because it does actually lead into something that happens. So yes. you're on the right track of thinking. Oh. You are. You you are. Oh. You're, you're thinking. You're thinking. Okay. Yes. I'm big braining. It's you just. Are you big braining? No. It's just because it was Yay. the '90s, and it was hard to like mm. gauge how successful this was going to be, or if. The lightning that they caught was going to sustain. Um, mm -hmm. They they didn't know that this was going to be the single most popular kids franchise in the nineties. Yes. Okay. Okay. It, it was a cultural phenomenon that broke up, broke everything. Streets uh, broke toy stores. Yeah. It, yeah. No. This this thing was what is everywhere. <laughs> so. Storm. She's slowly becoming one of us. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, because, like, it, it, it's because like it doesn't make sense to me as to why like I because like in that time Amer America's like slowly going back to having uh, their economy slowly getting a little bit a little bit better in yeah. a way and it doesn't make sense to me as to why they're not putting in production with having to do stunts with having to have any more like banger mm -hmm. episodes and all money. that stuff L yeah. literally they didn't have the money and they weren't sure if this was going to continue to be successful yeah well, i think no. i think that's the only thing that held them back was which, which is like they didn't risk it if they risked it uh let's just say they if this probably would have been the best season for like power rangers or something but i, mm. I know that like there's a lot more that probably ha became more of a banger than this but of course yeah. everybody likes this uh, this one specifically because this is the one that they grew up with. This is the, yeah, first. So, this is the one that mm -hmm. everyone references. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, it's just, yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm so born <laughs> didn't spend didn't build his media <laughs> empire by spending money. Nope, he got it by not paying his talent any money at all. And we'll get to this at some oh, point, no. Zeus. We'll get to this. That, but, that's a whole no. that's a whole bag of words. And we're we're oh, not exaggerating no. when we say this. We're not exaggerating when when we mm -hmm, say this. Mm -hmm. This is on the record. They in interviews confirmed by multiple people. They calculated mm -hmm. it. Fast food workers in one year made more money in a year than the actors for Power Rangers were getting paid. Yes. They were 
Who what the fuck? Yeah, so people working at McDonald's made yes. more in a year than fuck? a Power Rangers actor made in a year. Yes. What the fuck? Yep. Do they not get royalties from the from the toys they or the not. characters? No. That they they did it? No, because at, so Power Rangers, I don't know if you know how actor unions and whatever work I exactly. Don't. I know, okay. yeah. So typically a lot of this is filmed um, non-union. If this was a mm -hmm. union show, they would be getting royalties. Yeah. But that also means more money for Saban. Saban, who, as you can tell with the way this is made, works very cheaply. So in an attempt to avoid all those extra fees, filmed all of this non-union. Yeah. Um, so whereas someone would get hurt during filming or something, normally if it was filmed on a union production, there would be things in place to, uh, for healthcare or uh, no, to possibly no help them, yeah. but there wasn't anything. <laughs> they were going off of purely the popularity of the franchise and nothing more. Yep. Oh my God. That is an unsafe workspace. <laughs> exactly. It's pretty bad. Oh, no. It's, it's bad. Uh, there are a lot of, and it's still like that to this day, with the only exception really being the 2017 movie. Okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's yeah. an there's a interview, I believe, Christina Masterson, who was the Pink Ranger and Power Rangers Megaforce. Mm -hmm. I believe they were a union actor prior to being cast. And uh, Saban had her uh, go non-union just to be in the show otherwise they they wouldn't cast her it's wild it's yeah that is we we um, will talk more about stuff that be, that is like apparent cool but just just yeah. know the the actors for the rangers are being paid dog shit and are being uh expected to work like 18 hour days and no one cares if they get injured yes oh my god so yeah what a what Otherwise, a life to live in. <laughs> Honestly, will be no true. More. <laughs> turn turn real. Yeah. We didn't know that at the time. Part two picks up right but you know, left off. Zordon yeah. says another ranger needs to go to the dark dimension to retrieve the candle. Tommy right. can't do oh, it. This is like the, the candle to seventh or eighth so plot Jason episode we've had. Tears and heads in. Where we Revenge. Get round yeah. Two versus Goldar. Let's go. He puts up a better fight this time around, although still clearly being overpowered. <laughs> by Meanwhile, the monster is sent down to destroy. Why are you? Why are you laughing? Because he tossed back like a ragdoll. Get over here! Look at that! Get he over just just woke. Powered by Goldar. Just throwing. He's dragging his body. Yeah. And with the Megazord needing all of the Rangers to control it. Tommy offers to risk using whatever power is left in the green candle to fight it himself. Oh, the monster no. is incredibly strong, however, yeah. and does require all five rangers to help. Yeah. So Zack is sent Self in to sacrifice Jason is to the fight way. the monster. But in doing so, they'll be leaving the green candle behind. But with the safety of the world taking priority, Jason leaves to join the team. And with all of their combined powers, destroy the monster and save Angel Grove. Oh no. Unfortunately though, oh, that no. last battle oh, no. burned up the rest of the candle, stripping Tommy of the Green Ranger powers, but not before transferring his shield and dragon dagger to Jason. Oh. And yeah, just like that, the Green Ranger is no more. That's it. This was a pretty big That's deal, it. especially since even at the time, Tommy and the Green Ranger was the most popular Ranger. I yep. love how they still, uh, sorry, honest, but they still didn't got, course, got it shipped. Be, yeah. <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I, I can tell you, <laughs> they never did. They never did. You'll never see it. <laughs> oh my God. You will never see it. Yeah, the yeah, U.S. No, filming Dragon no. Shield. Yep. Oh my gosh. It's so funny. It's so bad. It's so, so, oh my god. It, it so is. this is a very interesting thing right here. Everyone constantly says that the Green Ranger is their favorite ranger because they, they put in a lot of work and they, they're, they are built different, if you will. Mm-hmm. They seem to forget that after he got the powers, he did nothing. <laughs> he lit. So he, he got did, he yeah. got captured by putties, missed fights, did a, a you know karate filming commercial thing instead of helping the Rangers fight, and then lost his powers. And that's that's it. But everyone, if you, anyone that you ask in the modern day, if you look at their nostalgia or what their favorite Power Ranger was, it was always the Green Ranger. But the mm -hmm. Green Ranger did nothing. <laughs> you know what? You know what? They're I, you know, it's it's a good thing. Green <laughs> Ranger Tommy claim, is claim worse to Tommy. Was, yeah. They are winning by doing nothing. It's okay. Punching out everyone. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> they are winning by doing nothing. Cut those slides. Yeah. <laughs> it just sucks because... I, 
We'll get to it later. But yes. to- Tommy does cooler stuff later in the franchise. Later, yes. Mm. And better stuff. And for longer than what he is doing currently. We are, th- This okay. is a spoiler for you because you don't okay. know what happened. We'll get there. But... Yeah, he he comes back like Hazumi <laughs> kind of spoiled. Hazumi slowly coming back. He to has Hazumi a Crayola everybody. box of colors that he just uh, goes into the mantle of. And okay, man. Yeah, he just eats crayons. You know, it's yeah. just what okay. it is. They're tasty. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway, friends and Tommy will help however he can. We do get a happy ending though, with Kimberly meeting Tommy, saying that she misses him and that he misses Aww. her too. Where he asks her to the dance, and the two even share a kiss. The first oh. and only kiss on the lips Power Rangers will ever show. It's yep. a nice ending, but does Wait, feel- really? Like yep. Like they're the only Power Rangers that are a couple, canonically? No, no, no. no, no. no. There are oh. m- lots of Rangers that are couples. However, there are a lot of, like, things in place that are like, nope, you can only kiss on the cheek. That is the extent of the kissing that you can do. There is a later season, which I will oh, not it's specify. It's because it's like, oh, it's for kids. They, yeah. they can't learn to, okay. Yep. All right. Yeah. It makes there, sense. Okay. There was mm-hmm. a season later, which I will not specify what, but it is a whole season of these two characters discovering that they are in love with each other. And then yeah. finally you get to the finale and it's a real ter- tearjerker that they can't be together and they confess their love for each other. And instead of kissing, they just hug. And it's really awkward. Oh, you God. can tell that they want to kiss. Yeah. Oh, no. Yep. Yeah, kids can't know about love. That's crazy. Kids can't know about love. Yeah, That's they can't wild. know about that. That's like, sad. How much time has passed? <laughs> oh, my God. Clearly, the dance hasn't happened yet. And it was literally six seconds from when Tommy was in the command center to being at the park. Ah, it's fine. Well, I won't hate on it. Still a nice ending. Yeah. Having no more Green Ranger was definitely a bold choice. But with the lack <laughs> yeah, bo- of Sentai bold. footage, yeah. what else yeah. could you do? Well, we'll find out later. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that's the other thing is and we we touched on it before when when there isn't sentai footage to use meaning footage from Zhu ranger it is hard mm-hmm. for them to do things because it becomes too expensive yes mm-hmm. so okay uh, to explain uh using another franchise saban at the time owned another uh sentai like franchise known as b fighter which is i don't know if you're familiar with the beetleborgs does nope. that ring any bells to you? I think no? those are stuck okay. in the 90s. If someone yes. wasn't born in the 90s, they don't know what no, Beetleborgs are. It's totally mm. fine. So, well, I mean, that also speaks to it why you don't know it, because yeah. it didn't progress past a certain point. Uh, oh. Essentially, essentially, the Beetleborgs were uh, three kid superheroes that got their powers from a comic book. Cool. Whatever. Uh, unimportant. Mm. So... The thing was, this was a very popular uh, show, almost rivaling Power Rangers. Yeah. They got to a point, big. though, where the footage, they just ran out of Japanese footage. Yep. And oh. so they just ended the show. There's no re- resolution, nothing. They just ended the show because there was no more footage to go off of. Yep. And they decided it was too expensive to film their own. Yeah. Okay. So mm-hmm. if there's no if, footage to use, generally it just, it's, 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 it's gone. canceled. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, the Power gosh. Rangers was the exception to that because they were making so much additional revenue. Yep. Saban mm-hmm. owned uh like two other shows. So Beetleborgs and there was another show called VR Troopers, which Wait, followed the same Japanese um format of like bringing over this footage, hiring American actors. And they were working for a little bit until they ran out of footage. But because they weren't making as much as Power Rangers, they just canceled them. Is Beetleborgs on Netflix or, or did they, they remove should, it? I think they removed it. <sighs> they um did. Yeah. Is it on maybe. YouTube? I maybe is through it? other me- <laughs> other ways. Other ways, you know, yeah. like um, very, I wasn't, very I wasn't sure if Hasbro like uploaded it to their thing too. I immediately <laughs> found a full playlist that has apparently every episode, but it's like Oh damn. It wouldn't surprise me if this is just a fan made. I think uh, it is playlist. too. Oh, that's such a shame. Mm. That means it's nowhere though, officially, because it was yeah. on Netflix, as was VR Troopers. Yeah, after, uh, after the Hasbro Oh, it's on Prime Video, apparently. A lot of it just up in limbo. Um, a, there's a lot of franchises that Saban owned, and after, like, acquisition from other companies, just no longer are accessible. It's really okay. wild. That is wild. Oh. I, I'm sorry. I'm, I have a joke, but I feel like I don't... I can't say the joke. No, it say might, it. 
Okay. Uh, I love how I love how technically uh, the Americans are basically getting some something and having to morph it into theirs, but like they're not willing to make something from from their side. They're just waiting. Wow. For Japan. No, that's crazy. <laughs> Funny you say that. Oh, <laughs> the, God, the, the, oh, no, no. no, that's what a lot of uh, more recent Power Rangers is. Um, but also, Saban also did another thing. I saw someone in your chat mention it. Uh, they mm. had an attempt of making their own. Tokusatsu. This is what the genre is called uh, mm. of um, everything. Tokusatsu show called Mystic Knights of Tiranog, which was oh. filmed in Ireland. Um, and each, there was Mystic four of them and then a fifth Knights. one later on where they all had Mystic elemental Knights. abilities and transformed Mystic into these cool Knights. knight-like things. So it was Mystic all original Knights. footage. Um, but that's one of the first instances that they did this. And then spawning that, there was a very unique Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle series, and then uh, a luchador series that had a sports car and a talking chihuahua. It's a it's a whole thing. Yeah. But, uh, every time Saban at this time period attempted to do something on their own, it just never took off like Power Rangers did. So they just like oh. stopped doing it. Yep. Ah. Uh, there you yeah. go. And after that, well, it just became sad. anime dubs like Digimon and. Uh, Flint, the Time Detective, oh, and a X-Men. whole bunch of other things. Oh, and X Men. Yeah, yeah, they did X Men from 1997. That was yeah, the Bond. Every time they attempted a live action thing and it just didn't Let's capture the Power Ranger, Bob. whatever, mm-hmm. stop it. Canceled. Yep. Gone. That's sad, though. Mm-hmm. Man. It yeah. do be like that. It do be like that. It do be like that. But anyway. Well. Oh, yeah. Birds of a feather. <laughs> Zach has a student competing in a tournament who lacks confidence. Meanwhile, Bro and Skull have also lacks found confidence. some bully kid to be their protege to take on Zach's in the competition. It's a little karate kid <laughs> Wait, why is why is Zach the rest okay, of having the to teach people karate? Basic. Well, he to... also teaches martial arts sometimes. Yeah, it's ah. again this whole like dynamic at the juice bar of just teaching classes is the wildest thing. <laughs> it is the wildest thing. Like it's yeah, a, it's know. also a high school, but it's yeah. also this. Okay. They never quite specify who's actually in charge of these classes or why they're teaching these classes, but they are. <laughs> it's good to help out in your there, community. Why not? Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. yeah. Monster gets sent Why down. Not? The Rangers gotta fight it. This is, however, our first glance with Jason getting to use the power of the dragon shield and the dragon dagger. It looks awesome. He's fighting some sentient heart, which is very creepy. Good yeah, really creepy in the Sentai too. Protege winning the competition because. Yeah. Of course he does. Yeah. The club really goes back to basics with Power Rangers. The yep. guys had to make video Ugh. projects, and Trini makes one on pollution and the negative oh, effects it's having on the yeah. world. Yeah. It's kind yeah. of a bummer video. Everyone's sad. Inspired by it, though, Trini creates the cleanup club that only the other Rangers join. Oh, <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> That is so sad. No, like, everyone is sad about watching it, and then they're just like, yeah, we're not helping. I don't know if you've quite realized it yet, but Power Rangers is notorious for, like, let's go hug trees. Yeah. It was about those positive messages, you know, yeah. trying to yeah, trying to make sure that everyone's... Messages. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Gotta grow up with good moralities. And yeah. you mm-hmm. finally get to see the Rangers mop the floor with the putties. It's a nice change of pace from the earlier episodes where they barely escaped. They learned! Lives. Yeah! yeah. Have grown and have become more also, skilled. Billy with the Tims! Look at oh these God. Tims! Oh. He got the Tims! Let's go! <laughs> oh, also, random small point. Uh, Walter Emanuel Jones, who plays Zach, uh, is yeah. actually missing a finger. Really? Mm-hmm. They never show a close-up of his hands, but yeah, he's missing a finger. On the morpher they oh, do. Damn. During the morphing sequence, it's it's that hand that's on top. Mm. Mm. So they started. Okay. If we ever see it again, I'll show you. That's trying to pollute mm. the earth, you know, but just old, just a small stuff. like, hey, like, they did you know, kind of fact. And possibly mm-hmm. create more pollution with that explosion. Definitely. You gotta think oh, about God. this stuff, guys. Mm. Come on. 100%. A bad reflection <laughs> on you is a fun episode. Rita creates evil Power Rangers from her putties. Also, we get to see David Yost's arms. Form and cause Damn. Look, look at his arms! Look at his arms! Look at his arms! Look at it! Look at the muscles! See the way he grabbed him? Listen, nerd! Real Rangers show up to help, they get detention. 
Which, of course, the only other kids in there are oh Bulk and gosh. Skull. We get a lot of, of shenanigans with are. them that's loads of fun. Bulk packing a massive lunch and a TV for detention. I love it. It's so, Thank you, Elite it's Man. It's so Looney Tunes. He pulls out, like, this, this lunchbox right here, pulls out a TV, pulls out, like... Uh, yeah. Like a 36 inch sub, like it's it's ridiculous. Chemistry, and they should totally maybe he secretly, <laughs> he secretly, and <laughs> in, in, in like you know, in partner with Rita. Yeah. <laughs> like, there's no way you're gonna oh. get a, a 30 foot long sub in there. S small <laughs> bit that Connor says here. Two have such good chemistry, okay. and they should totally have their own show. More on that later. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that now, but. May maybe remember that for like down the line. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, you can mm -hmm. see he's missing a finger here. I can't oh, yeah. wait, wait. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Mm. The Rangers need to find a way to sneak out of Again, just a, fight them it doesn't off. really mean anything. They it's do just a magic mm -hmm. trick after you know. telling Bulk and Skull to close their eyes and cover their ears. They teleport and morph out and have a battle with the evil rangers. <laughs> that always makes me laugh, it's a fun though. Fight, but they that, don't do. That they're like, they're like, we gotta be like really quiet. We're in detention, and like you can see everyone else is kind of like smiling or trying to hold back from laughing, because they're like, all yeah. right, all right, Bulk and Skull, close your eyes and like plug your ears, like we're like we're gonna disappear. And then Jason yeah. goes, <laughs> and everyone's just like. <laughs> Yeah, they definitely don't know where the Power Rangers now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Morph out and have a battle with the evil rangers. It's a fun fight, but they don't do too much with it. Uh, hopefully, we could see some more interesting stuff with evil rangers in the future. Hopefully. <laughs> Doomsday. Maybe. Part one. We'll find out. Doomsday. Is this the Doomsday. What kind of name is Doomsday. It's Power Rangers Appreciation Day, and everyone is excited. Apart from yeah. This is like episode 40 something, right? I think so. Yeah. The Incredible Bulkster and Super Skull. I love them. They don't do much. Burgersaurus. See them Hot Dogosaurus. Again. Yeah. <laughs> Rita uses this time to unleash one of her most dangerous plans. She traps all the citizens of Angel Grove in a dark dimension, while at the same time landing her moon base on Earth and releasing Cyclopsis on the world. Oh, wow. What Cyclopsis the fuck? being her own yeah. Megazord that's incredibly powerful. Wait, that looks, that looks like a good injury. Megazord, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's gonna look cool. <laughs> Satan's oh, back, cool. too! We jump straight into the yeah, Satan, Satan just comes back. With Cyclops is yeah. absolutely destroying the Rangers with the help of Lokar's magic power. Even summoning the Dragon Zord doesn't help. Cyclopsis is just too strong. So they summon Titanus. I mean, Titanus has been able to decimate any monster toys. that's been in the Rangers' way. Toys! Toys! They create the Ultra Zord. Toys, 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 toys. It's not enough. Rita even managing to not only I've... disassemble. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed there, right in that instance, end. but that's the toy. That's a toy. It is a Rita toy. I know. <laughs> the toy being stuck into the sand. No, Titanus! <laughs> oh no! The Ultra Sword, but but, but, Titanus? but this is an addition. Titanus. The, this is actually kind of sad though, because like this scene is like. Titanus go like ah, ah, like it's screaming as it's falling into the oh earth. Oh my yeah. god. Oh my gosh. Him in the this earth. poor dude. What? Look at that face. Yeah. Look at that desperation. Yeah, it's a toy, but I can feel Oh, uh, he's pain. going back to Satan. Draining all of it. <laughs> yeah. First of all, <laughs> Satan is here on Earth again. Thank you very much, Zeus. Um actually <laughs> The team retreats to figure out their next move. Because if they can't stop Cyclopsis then everyone will be trapped in the dark dimension forever. Doomsday da, da, Part da. 2. Yeah. Zordon managed to actually save the Zords at the last second, even Titanus. But they're unfortunately yeah. Yeah. to regain their power. It'll take 12 hours? That kind of seems like a design flaw. Why does it take 12 <laughs> hours? Rita should recharge. attack during charging hours. Gotta recharge. The Zords are only at 50%, but with the fate of the world literally resting on this battle, the Rangers decide they have no choice but to bust them out anyway and take on Cyclopsis again. Yep, it's Through time. pure willpower and determination, I guess, the Rangers eventually do get the Yeah! Mm. Destroying him with the power of the Ultra Zord. Mm. Sending Let's go. Rita back to the moon and saving the world where Angel Grove can now properly celebrate Power Rangers Day. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Which is a real day, actually. Yeah, Power Ranger Day is Ranger August is real 28th. It, it really is? Yeah, yeah, it is It is an actual thing. It is thing. a national holiday. Yeah. Oh no, my god. Kidding. They they turned it into an actual holiday. Yep. Power Rangers Day. August 28th. That is crazy. It's oh that, it, it's because it had that much of an impact. It's that, it's that well-loved. Yeah. Loved yeah. Act, yeah. So... 
So if if any of you ever need to call out of work or something, say, sorry, I'm celebrating National Power Rangers Day. Don't actually do that, but... (laughs) um, (laughs) Anyway. Whoa, who's this? This pops up. Oh my god. All great. Yeah, Tommy's back. I missed him. And seeing him greet the Power Rangers in Ranger form is so beautiful. He should be up there with them. He should be. After the celebration, we head back to the command center. Where Zordon says Even though he wasn't there for most of the fights, but you know. Call of yeah. Duty. And if they'd like to return back <laughs> to their normal lives and relieve themselves of ranger duty, they're more than welcome to. Of course, the Power Rangers being goody two-shoes, they all decline and choose to stay Power Rangers to defend the Earth whenever it needs them. <laughs> Hands in the middle, shout. So, something... I, I know Kate and I were kind of laughing because of a comment uh, from chat, but... Sorry. <laughs> Oh, no, God, I was too. It? So Gennaro is one of my funniest. I'm <laughs> so the, the the thing I was gonna say about this is Zordon is like, hey, you guys did great. Like you guys have done way way more than I expected. You've done amazingly, and I think Rita's gonna be gone for a long while uh, because of mm. how well you did. I didn't mean to keep you for this long because I didn't realize how negatively it was going to impact your lives. Mm-hmm. If you want to go back to just being normal teenagers, you can. And mm. everyone is like, no, like we're here until like it's we're here to defend the earth. We're here until we die. Yeah. <laughs> ba- basically. But that's a or it's a until we leave the show. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Looks into camera lens. <laughs> oh yeah. But that that is always something that I've loved about the show, Zeus, is like you'll you'll constantly see a a common theme of Power Rangers. And we saw it uh, earlier where um, even when things seem the most hopeless, the biggest thing Mm -hmm. is that Power Rangers never give up. Um, They'll always Mm -hmm. find a way. They'll always think of something. They'll always keep fighting, even if it is literally like pointless and they're losing constantly. Yeah, they have to keep going. Um, And that's that's a it's a big common theme. Do you remember when mm-hmm. I told you, Zeus, that Power Rangers ruined me because of the way I am? That's the reason <laughs> why. <laughs> I, I, no matter what I do, I always go back to that mindset. And that's, mm-hmm. it's Power Rangers' fault because of that. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, it's a very noble, a noble, like, principle. Yeah, mm-hmm. absolutely. A very, very noble one. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. End scene. End scene. And scene. Doomsday really, really, really feels like a finale. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad the series didn't end here, but mm. it felt like potentially this is where the series was going to end. Whoa, you know, it that's had crazy. Massive fight with Cyclopsis. Insane. The Rangers literally almost mm. dying. Wacky. The Power Rangers Appreciation Day, and Zordon saying that Rita was pretty much defeated and they didn't have to be Power Rangers anymore. After doing some research, aka Google searching, Google, yeah, <laughs> Google Good, Doomsday was apparently <laughs> supposed to be the series finale. Yes, you it see, was. When Fox first ordered the first season of Power Rangers, it came with 40 episodes, and Doomsday Part Two was the 40th episode, meaning they did wrap up the story nicely. If the show were to fail and not continue, mm-hmm. but However, Mighty Morphin yeah. Power Rangers was a massive success, and Fox even ordered 20 more episodes to add on to season one. Which is awesome. Oh, gosh. Yeah. One problem, though. Saban ran out of Zhu Ranger footage. That's so wild. Oh. The show was- Remember when we talked about what happens when you run out of footage? It'll be canceled. <laughs> oh, <However>. no. <laughs> however. Let's oh, talk is about. Is however here? Yeah. Yes, there is. Let's, let's, let's oh. see what else they could do. It was done and over with. But when half of your show is the Japanese show, what are you supposed to do? In Japan, they've already moved on from Zhu Ranger and were working on Kaku Ranger and Dai Ranger. Well, what Saban ended up doing was pretty interesting. Instead so, of filming here's the, the thing. Of- so, oh gosh, no way. <laughs> like, like we said, every single <laughs> uh, season of Super Sentai is kind of like its own thing. Yep. And mm-hmm. Mighty Morphin, the first season, it is taken from uh, Kyoryu Sentai Zhu Ranger. Every single year, we have a cast change, we have new ca- uh, suits, new powers, everything. Everything is completely revamped. And so now, we're, by this point, uh, two Japanese seasons later. So after this is uh, Gosei Sentai Dairinja. And then after mm. that is uh, Ninja, Ninja Sentai, Sentai. Kakurinja. E- mm-hmm. So keep that in mind. Okay, okay. Yeah, so it's, it is not common to keep the same cast or the same suits. They change everything every season in Japan. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. However, themselves, Saban partnered with Toei, the company behind Super Sentai in Japan, to produce brand new battle scenes, both Ranger footage and Megazord footage for the remainder of season one and a bit of season two. Mm -hmm. So from this point on, all the Power Ranger and Megazord footage is from Japan, but it was never a part of Zhu Ranger. It's it exclusive to America. Yeah. Oh. So this is the answer that I was going to give you when you asked about why couldn't they just find more footage? They did, but Japan had to produce it exclusively for they America. They yeah. Japan for it. Yep. So instead of they making got that their much own... money for oh my So God. they yeah. were able to commission more footage from Japan that never showed up in Japan for an American show. So, do you remember how we said Power Rangers, the making of it is very unique and will never yeah. be done ever again? It's because yeah. it's a combination of like four different shows all at the same time. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh my God. Now, actually, now it kind of like makes sense as to like when I watch, I think, I, it, does it still continue even with Power Ranger Samurai? Because there were like cuts there even yes. when I was a yeah. kid. I was Ooh. like, that yep. was a weird cut. Yep. <laughs> by, by Power Ranger Samurai, they have an American stunt team so they can do uh, original footage and whatnot. Mm -hmm. But yeah, they, they still take the Japanese footage and we, they bring it over and then mm -hmm. they just add in the American actors and they redub it. Yep. And so that's mm -hmm. how a lot of that works. But in okay, Mighty okay. Morphin specifically, is a combination of not only the four, like five question mark different shows on top mm. of IRL circumstances creating additional plot lines yep. and yep. unintentional lore. So we'll get to that, but. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. To fit with the Mighty Morphin stories. To my knowledge, this is the only time Saban did anything like this. And the fact that yeah, that's all that I've heard too. to just commission <laughs> more Power Rangers yeah. is insane. <laughs> Yeah, and they had that much Power money. Rangers I love that gift. Fans as <laughs> That's it. Still, I'm. So can you go back that, a bit? It's still Rangers this one. <laughs> well, though, this is the rubber shield. This is the the right is it one. The rubber? Yeah, because this oh is because this is Japanese footage. This is the Japanese okay, footage. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> this, I saw the I saw the little tint and I was like, okay, that doesn't look like the this rubber one. Or maybe it's like. Lot. Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so anytime we talk about like this footage, uh, it is commonly referred to as Zhu 2, like Zhu Ranger, mm -hmm. because it's mm -hmm. more of it, even though Zhu Ranger ended, but they commissioned okay, them okay. to make more. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> so I wonder how the Japanese actor felt felt like getting that commission. They're like, hey, um, we got to. I got to make a film this, but it's not going to air. So they like, what? from what I understand, they charged Saban out the ass like this yeah. was. Giga this is not cheap. expensive because yeah, this by this cheap. point, a lot of this, uh, the props and the suits deteriorate over the course of like the year, especially mm -hmm. with how much they put it through. So yeah. the fact that they had to touch the suits back up and make sure that everything looks pristine. The actors are also back or stunt actors. Yes, yeah, yeah, they're yeah. stunt team back again. So. While yeah. also yeah. while they're trying to film their own things, which don't while, use these yeah, suits. while they're trying to film their own season of Super Sentai that is completely unrelated to this one. Yeah. <laughs> yep. So. Also, someone in my chat said they got paid more than the American actors. More oh, than a hundred percent. A hundred percent. Oh my god. Yep. <laughs> my fans as you too. So with all of that, let's continue on with season one. Yeah, because we're still in season one. Rita yeah. okay, seeded okay. evil. The school is tasked with planting trees, where Rita makes one of the trees evil. Wow. She sends down That's... the police as a distraction, <laughs> wow. and once again, Man, what a, what a, a concept. really fun and solid unmorphed fight. Seriously, I'd still be doing karate kicks in my bedroom alone like this. Squat goes down Damn to plant right. the evil seed, but the rangers mm -hmm. don't know what he's up to. So Jason goes to check it out, where he's attacked by a tentacle. Uh oh, that's oh not Oh my god, friendly. what the fuck? <laughs> the <Rangers laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, what's Again, wrong with that? It sounds worse than it really came is. out of nowhere. They ah, I'm sure it's you don't like when it oh, just so <laughs> Don't say that. Okay, don't say that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> Mr. Beast would probably be proud. <laughs> oh, big wow. surprise. Oh, God. Angel Grove is doing a big I'm going to let my cat out. Where Hold this on. old lady begs Aww. the rangers, apart from Zach, who's not there, to find a nice home for her pet pig. He's so Norman, cute. Oh, it's so cute. Uh, like, he's a chunky. Fat, he's a this chunker. On level, oh, my Zach God. Zach is going on a jog and spots the old woman, who turns into a putty. 
where he needs okay. to whoop those putties. Again, I'm so glad we're getting a lot more on. Oh, that fight spin scenes. was so clean. Wait, nice. let's go back and see it. Again, They're I'm alerting. So yes. So by by this point, the Rangers have like the actors for the Rangers have been there enough. Yeah. That they're they're starting mm -hmm. to like, kind Get kind it. of pl play around with it a little bit more. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're they're understanding the show now. Yeah. So hi Tora. Okay, okay. Tora. Tora. Hello. People adopt the pig. And the pig is seem so to love it and cute. Take care of it, He's really so cute. Aww, he's so cute. Pieces together of the mysterious old woman. The pig and some device. To we should make a show out of teaching people about Power Rangers. I feel like we would just keep rewatching this, though, is the problem. Yes. Like, <laughs> which which is great, you know, and I'm happy to do it for Zeus and I was happy to do it for Poseidon. But, like, at some point, I feel like Kane and I are just going to need to make like a slideshow and we just. Need to make our, we have our own PowerPoint at this point. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. You, could, you could do it like. Um... Uh, it's from Watcher, I think. It's like puppet history. If you guys would want to do that, something like that. I, mm -hmm. I, yeah. I'd, I'd, I'd love to. Hades next. The problem is that like Kane and I stream at this time, and yeah. Hades yeah. cannot. Does not. So <laughs> yeah, they're yeah. asleep yeah. right now. Same with Apollo, because we we Apollo we were is also asleep right now. Yeah, we were we were trying. So I yeah, they, uh, you. what time is it currently for you? Actually, uh, twelve thirty a.m. It is late. Okay, Apollo wakes up at like three hours after. Yeah. So yeah, so like that. yeah. So either you guys want to wake up at three a.m. and then stream early, or no, no, know. thank you. <laughs> I mean, I can, but that's besides the point. Like, no that's besides you. the point. Exactly. Not again. I already did that this week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> with Zach, they come to the conclusion that the pig is part of Rita's plan. I mean, duh. Yeah, the pig turns into the pudgy pig again. Again, Rita really what the loves fuck? that monster. Although I, I love don't blame this her. Monster. It is pretty cute. <laughs> It's, it's yeah. really ugly, mind you, but I, 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 I unironically really love this monster. <laughs> though, is that the it grows on you. Is still Norman underneath the monster, meaning the Rangers don't want to destroy or even hurt it, yeah. as they say. Aww. So they immediately yeah. morph and attack Norman. What are you doing? <laughs> this episode is also a sign of Saban running out of We don't want to hurt him anyway. Because the fight is literally the same brings out from guns. the <laughs> yeah. episode. Yeah. Yeah. And it's literally the, the same footage. The the weapons. Yeah. It's one thing for Power Rangers to recycle Super Sentai footage. It's another for Power Rangers. Oh, to... oh my oh. god. Oh, it's no. so oh. ugly. Yeah. Oh no. Why are they oh, all no. crouched like that? Oh no. Also, again, with like Tr Trini being taller. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my oh. god. At least get the proportions right. Come on. Gosh. Oof. Uh, oh, uh, hey, Professor Roy and trying. Kane. I know this might be much of a question, but what type of martial right. arts has everyone learned over the years? I have. I've. Uh, I did Taekwondo uh, back in the day, but the list is growing in my head as I, as I think about it. Oh, God. Uh, Taekwondo. I've practiced MMA, a lot of combative um, weapons, as well as XMA, uh, Muay Thai. Uh, I dabble in boxing, but I'm awful at boxing because I like kicking. Um, uh, karate, Shotokan karate. Uh, pff, I'm blanking on the rest, but I, I've done a lot of martial arts. Oh, you mean in Power Rangers? This day. Like, what do the Rangers know? That's a good question. Uh, I don't think they ever like specify, except for like air quotes, the made up stuff. The so like, I mean, they always like to talk about karate yeah as, as like the main big thing but a lot of that is because of tommy because tommy irl owns a or owned <laughs> uh a uh martial arts school mm -hmm. uh rising sun karate academy i believe oh. um so yeah starting and i believe texas and i could be wrong um but he branched out uh to other states and that he is own he owns that karate academy yeah mm. um but yeah yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hope that helped. Recycled nice. Power Rangers footage. Norman eventually runs away to some farm and is preoccupied with a lady pig. Yeah, Gold of course. Orange, as one does. Angel Grove. And well, I, I mean, God, he got his priority no straight. Joke, probably the 10th time to use this footage. Whoa. Anyway, That's crazy. Really Them the fighting Goldar? Reused? And the farmer adopts Norman for his farm. But wait, Aww. he was already Balkan Skull's pet. What the heck is up with that? <laughs> Something... I feel bad for them. Well, 
Yeah. Nah. Oh. Well, Fishy. well. Jason, Zach, and Trini are going scuba diving. Billy doesn't want to go, though, because we learn he's afraid of the water due to a traumatic event he had with a fish as a kid. Afraid of going in the water, but not beat. Fish attack. <laughs> oh, but man. Oh, okay. Vicious. Look how he whoops these putties. Vicious. The fish wouldn't stand a chance in round two. Billy then gets put under a spell that amplifies his fear of fishes, making him completely useless in battle, where he needs to overcome his fear in order to save his friends. Mm. Whoa, that's crazy. Does. See, just like I said, the fish didn't stand Let's a chance. Go! Yeah! So when the Rangers land the final blow with the Megazord, the fish monster says, No, you cheated! Okay, then. What? <laughs> what? Megazord, no, we'll fight again, we'll fight again. Says, no, you cheated! Okay, then. So... There's a lot of conjecture. I'm not a green light. What? So there's a lot of conjecture about what this actually is being said. I, obviously, ob yeah, ob obviously, you cheated or something. Oh. But, but <laughs> yeah, because their diction wasn't great. It comes out as, "Hey, you shithead." Oh, <laughs> yeah, nice. it's it's a little, says, you know. Okay, then. <laughs> I, I hear, I hear shithead rather than you cheated. I'm yep. sorry. <laughs> I, we do too. Trust us. So. Oh, no. There you go. You know? Blizzards. Okay. The school is having some kind of field day full of games. Oh my God, they're stuff. outside. You know, we all have to Whoa, do that's this crazy. It's not the sensor point. anymore. Whoa, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah. The games, but Bulk and Skull steal the trophy. During their search, the gang gets attacked by putties. But this fight feels different, mainly because it was the debut of Ron Yes. Lester. Yes! Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. So Ron Wasserman, who is the the you know the the artist here or the the musician here, um, is yeah. the person that did the music for Power Rangers. The mastermind behind oh. the Power Rangers, uh, early Saban era music. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um. So he he's the one that did the intro, and we'd heard some of the fight. Uh, music beforehand uh, but okay. obviously since Power Rangers continued past the 40 episodes they initially thought they were like hey Ron could you do like more music for us and make it like original and mm. it goes way harder than it has any right to and still to this day I know Kane doesn't necessarily agree with me I still think it's the I, best I music to an extent it I, it's very situational I but... think it's the best music the franchise has ever had in my opinion yes. R anything that Ron Wasserman has done essentially so, the, will, it, common, will it be played here or is it copyright? They, they will think, play a clip, which does not get copyright because yes. we have done this before. Okay. I, I wanted sure to play though. I wanted to play a small like extra bit just so yeah. you could hear more because it sounds really okay. good. The uh the common term that the fandom I believe uses is butt rock, which yeah. I don't quite agree with. Um, but <laughs> it is it is very, very good. You know, funny you say that because my chat played a played a fart reverb. <laughs> oh my goodness. Trust me, this is going to get you shit in your pants. Get ready. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Okay. I don't want to do that right now. Oh shit your pants god. right now. Piss and cut them, oh boy. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Yeah, the Wasserman factor. There we go. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Wasserman's music. If you don't know Ron Wasserman, oh. Chad, he's can you the stop guy farting? who created and sang oh the Power Rangers theme song. Yeah. Yeah, go, go, Power Rangers. Power Rangers. That's him. That's him. He created so many more tracks like Fight, Combat, yes. 541, We Need a Hero, amongst others. I can't play them for you, sadly, but they're on the same level as the theme song in terms of energy, metal, guitar, and vocals. It's great. My personal favorite being Fight, which is used here. Yes, It adds Fight an extra so level good. of hype to so the fight good. scenes. Seriously, it makes me want to work out and punch a punching bag or something. Okay, he's like three seconds really of his channels. Really anyway, the Rangers don't yeah. find Vulcan Skull. Okay. <laughs> well, that, that was pretty short, but you okay. know what? It works. Okay. Yeah, dude. I, I'm going to play just a little bit of it. We'll Fight. take okay. them! We'll okay. take them! So, and then in 2012, Ron Wasserman was like, I'm going to re-release an album and retouch up all of these songs. Yeah. And it's oh my god. For no reason it's amazing. Let me let me find something with the lyrics. Thank you, Rablet. Okay, here we go. Just a, just a little bit, okay? We'll do like we'll do okay. like we'll do like 10 seconds. And the the songs and the fight music are all like that. From this yeah. point mm. going forward, and they yeah. are okay, okay. Yeah. amazing. 
There, there's a song in here. It's like, call the five four one. Anytime you the say the you Gizzy, need us. The Gizzy us. persona yeah. vibes, which is like, the music oh, is always what? banger. Yeah, kind <laughs> of. I can totally see that. Did you just say Gizzy yeah. persona vibes? Hmm? I can to I can see it. It's not quite there, but I see it. It's not it. quite there, but like, it's more so like every time that you fight, there's always like, -na 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 -na. <laughs> it has a vocal <laughs> track, right? <laughs> It has um, a vocal track while you're fighting, so it gives me that persona vibe of like cool music while you're yeah. fighting. So yeah, how many RPGs have you played? Hmm? <laughs> never mind, never mind. I'm glad that you're able to relate to somebody else. Welcome like, in, Raiders! RPGs. Hey, welcome in, everybody! I hope like, you're having a fantastic time. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you're having a fantastic evening. My name's Roy. Welcome to the stream. I'm joined tonight by Kane and Zeus. We're teaching Zeus all about Power Rangers. And if anybody comes into the call, uh, when we're in, uh, well, if Hazami comes back, we'll, we'll, we'll teach them too. That's crazy. I, I don't, anyway. That's crazy. Into this half lion, half goat monster. <laughs> pretty badass a chimera? Meanwhile, Angela shows up to the Oh my Angela gosh, she's pretty. So much. She's gorgeous. She's she's pretty. Hi, Lazgar. Hi, how you? Zach. He has a crush on her and constantly tries to flirt with True. Noah Vale. However, during the games, he lent her a hand and was just genuinely nice. So she asks him out to see a movie. Aww. The Shamara monster, as they put it, attacked the Rangers. Yeah, the Shamara. Powerful, needing to pull Zach mm -hmm. away from his Yeah, the Shamara. Which Aww. she's not happy about. Morphing oh, that's out and awesome, Lasgar. I hope you've been enjoying it. Jesus out of the monster. <laughs> he's motivated, you know? Power. He's yeah. motivated he now. The monster and Zack returns to his date. Where Angela isn't too happy and dumps popcorn on Zack. <gasps> she's kind of terrible. Why do you like her? Yeah, she is terrible. Yeah. Crystal of Nightmares. Well, maybe he's into that. Maybe he's into that. No, don't say powers. that. I don't know. He might be. Are you I'm saying people are more attracted to those that have red flags? I'm not about to kick you. I mean, Zach. <laughs> Zach especially does. I'll say that much. Oh, gosh. Okay. Yeah. The gang need to study for a big science test, and Billy recommends going to his uncle's cabin for a fresh change of Yeah, theory. of course. Hulk and Skull overhear this, and since their grades are poo poo, follow them up. I not personally a bad idea. never had a group study session with my friends. It doesn't look like fun, and we probably would have been too distracted the whole time. Yeah, it kind of works like that. So, Meanwhile, Goldar and Rita are creating an evil orb. Orb. The of nightmares. Orb. The skull no. show up as maids, but when they hear the rangers coming, they hide <laughs> under the bed. Where the boys can have I love them a, so a much. Pillow fights. Let huh? the boys have pillow fights, okay? No. You're like, you're like, what? Huh? What? Huh? Let the boys no. have pillow uh, fights, okay? No, wait. So they heard the rangers. They went under the bed. And then rather than the rangers coming into the room, it was the... <laughs> No, they heard someone coming and it, it oh, was okay. it was them. So they were like, oh, yeah. we better hide. And then okay. it was them and now they're having a pillow fight. Okay, that's that's nice then. Okay. Yeah. Again, yeah. I never did that, especially not in high it's school, a... but I won't judge. <laughs> That night, when the rangers fall asleep, Rita activates the crystal, which gives oh, the wait, rangers Kane, you saw that message. <laughs> essentially giving so them PTSD, that I could which picture. is a pretty brutal tactic. <laughs> What's interesting, though, is that Bulk and Skull also get affected, where we get a look into Burgersaurus! And what they're Hot dog about is being Aww. superheroes, just like the Power Rangers. They're not dreaming of bullying or being mean, but summoning the Megazord they to want do good. Hero. Yeah! Really yeah, it's them. really endearing. Uh, it should be noted also in the comics, the current day comics, like that are, um, they get a lot of focus. In fact, have ranger forms that are canonical to the comics. Um, I think uh, bulk is orange or purple. Yeah, it's orange and, and skull is uh, purple. Yeah. Um. So in the comics which have their own continuity. They are rangers. Yeah. Um, which is nice. You know, it's it makes me feel good knowing that in some continuity, they are power rangers. But um, here, no, they always want to be heroes, but are so misunderstood and don't know how to express themselves. Exactly. Uh, so they're bullies, um, which, you know, will pay off much, much later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Much, much later. Much, much later. Yeah, how much, is yeah. much, much later? So how many of these streams do you want to do, Zeus? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> how many streams? So oh my gosh. There's this one, and we can cut this one in half too if you want, because we're almost 
four hours into this and we're not even halfway mm. done the, the, the video yeah. yet. So I mean, that depends on you guys. If I'm, you guys are tired, I can and stuff. go for as long as you want. Um, it's literally just nearly 3 p.m. for me. I can I can keep going until 8 p.m. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I I might dip out depending on how we're feeling at like the end of season one, season two mark. But okay, I I will wait to decide when we get to that point. Okay. Okay. Uh, just be, I'll, I'll see what time it is and how I'm feeling because if it's like if we're at the halfway point and it's an hour and a half from now, I'm gonna be like we're not gonna finish this until like four or five a.m. and I do have to okay, open the okay. cafe tomorrow. So I'm like. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I still have to do some stuff tomorrow. <laughs> Understandable. You gotta but do. You gotta do bunny stuff tomorrow. Do your bunny thing. barista we, stuff. We will get there when we get there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But for now, having no confidence and being afraid of their own shadow, they still try to do good though, needing to find the crystal of nightmares and yeah. destroy it. They get ambushed by putties and don't put up much of a fight. Because yeah, they're so scared. Fear. Jason mm -hmm. eventually builds up enough courage to run inside the cave and confront Goldar, where he finds the crystal and smashes it with a kick, which is just Boom. so badass. It's so cool with looking. Oh my still gosh. Destroyed, Zordon tells the rangers they've regained their confidence. It's such a nice curve on this kick, too. Yeah. These putties. Bing, They're bang, learning. We yeah. And oh my like god. That fight scene again. There you go, Zeus. There it is. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> They the same the enemy. Yeah. <laughs> oh gosh. I like this so much. I guess I enjoy seeing the Rangers all scared and timid, Bulk and Skull's dream, and the climactic unmorphed fight afterwards. Really fun episode. To flee or not to flee. Bernie's <laughs> juice bar is shutting down, and everyone's sad. Well, oh, maybe he shouldn't episode. have been getting oh, stuff no. away. Yeah, the show, Ernie's <laughs> always like, hey, that's great. Free sodas for everyone. Yeah. yeah. Jason finds a stray dog and takes Doggo! care of it. Marie I know. It's evil so cute. That get onto Jason. Evil Where fleas. The fleas turn into an evil giant flea monster. And the Don't Rangers hurt the dog. How dare you? The Honestly true. Nice ending, though, with Ernie taking care of the stray dog and the owner coming back to reclaim him. She's happy by this and she gives Ernie a big check. Like what? a really big one, apparently, since it's enough to save the juice bar. Yeah. Which is, yeah very Damn. generous. But he celebrates by giving everyone free drinks. Again. <laughs> you learn, Ernie, that your actions have consequences. What will you learn? I mean, he wants to celebrate a win. Uh, listen. Why not? This I is guess. literally why he's going out of business. Yeah. I know, but like, at least he has a good heart, you know? I have to be generous. I mean, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Like, let, let's be joke. honest. You wouldn't say you wouldn't say no to a free drink, would you? No. Yeah, see? <laughs> no. With Bulk and Skull wanting uh, to put their ultimate sandwich What a milkshake. In. They get made fun uh -huh. of for it, but, like, Jason put in his karate trophy, and that's pretty lame and stupid, too. <laughs> the rest of the episode is yeah, fuck standard. you, Jason. Rita sent down a monster, and the Rangers got to defeat it. A pretty by-the-numbers episode. Yeah. Hmm. Plague of the Mantis. Hey, Trini's take care, small. More kung fu, more specifically mm. the mantis, mantis style. style. She gets taught all kinds of wisdom about the mantis and kung fu, stuff about fair fights, calm heads, etc. Rita then turns Trini's praying mantis into an actual praying mantis monster. Funny thing about this too, the mantis style kung fu that Trini mm. learns in this is what it, it is what in Power Rangers canon at least. It is what it is considered that she then uses exclusively from this point forward. Yes. And, oh, and, damn. And even to the point when they have the 30-year anniversary uh, special mm. on Netflix, which is uh, Power Rangers Once and Always, they even mm. talk about it there. Yes. Oh. So it is, it, even though it's a one-episode thing, it becomes a big thing in the grand scheme of the Power Rangers universe. The grand scheme okay, of the okay. multiverse. The grand <laughs> calculus of the multiverse. Sorry, Thin. My bad. My bad, Thin. I got it, okay? Who yeah, plays yeah, yeah. mind games with Trini, saying that she's dishonorable for not having a fair fight. True. This, for some reason, gets to Trini, where she feels like she needs to fight the monster one-on-one, -on -one, which I might be able to buy this, if we haven't already seen the Rangers consistently not have fair fights with <laughs> yeah. yeah. She tries to have a fair fight until the Mantis sends out the putties. What a shocker. The monster wasn't honorable. Well, that's crazy. So now it's all okay for the Rangers to show up. Who would have expected that? Bad guy. Mm -hmm. I like how strong they make Trini in this episode. Mm, Everyone yeah. admires her Kung Fu and feels like they need to join to keep up with her. Very nice. Yeah, right, they, they constantly tell Trini as the, the tomboy. Return uh, empowerment, uh, you know, the strong female, yeah. whereas mm -hmm. Kimberly is always the, the girly girl yeah. of uh, mm -hmm. the valley girl, you know. The valley uh, girl. 
They don't give mm-hmm. Trini enough. I don't think they give Trini enough solo time, though. I I yeah. think she gets kind of. That's what they try to do, and it comes across very surface level. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Absolutely. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. Anyway, Return of an Old Friend Part One. Return of an mm. Old Friend Part One. That's crazy. Tommy. 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 Why would you think that? I, I'm just he's not he's not here anymore. <laughs> what do you mean? You saw him on Power Rangers Day. <laughs> Zeus, I did. You're learning but I so other... quickly, and it's making me so happy. That's, that's crazy, what? Zeus. Why would you think that? Oh man. Oh no. We haven't seen him after the Power Rangers Why would you day, do that? and I was like, "Why? Or where's Tommy? Why would you do that? That he's still friends and like in their so school or something? Fast. Is he just doing karate? No, does it? Some... Didn't he go to Stone <laughs> Canyon? I, I, I don't fucking know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> didn't did he go to Stone Canyon for like a, a while? Yeah. I don't, know. I, I don't know. Oh, so Angel Grove's like rival high school, Angel Grove being where they are, uh, is mm-hmm. Stone. Their rival is Stone Canyon. Yes. Mm-hmm. We never see Stone Canyon, but we hear Stone Canyon a lot. So just yes. if okay. you hear Stone Canyon, okay. that's what it is. It is Angel Grove's like okay, rival. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hey, what's parents? They're all pretty basic and standard. Jason's dad is a muscle head. Billy's dad is a nerd. You know, it's what you expect. Yeah. The most interesting are Bulk and Skull's parents. Skull's mom being this outrageous punk girl and Bulk's parents being the nicest and most normal looking people ever. Rita sends down the putties and hatches a pretty... And it's so ironic because, like, this kind of gets quasi-retconned later. Okay. Mm. Um, We get a Skull backstory episode in Power yes. Rangers Zeo, which is three okay. seasons from now, where they talk about his parents and things that they made him do during his childhood, which do not match up with how they act in this episode. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, so gosh. they it's very funny. Just go with it for now. Pretty genius okay. plan. To capture everyone's parents and force the rangers to give up their powers in exchange for their parents' lives. Also, I have to play this again. Parents and force the rangers to give up their powers Go. in exchange. Look how far away that kick was. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know. You know. Actually, you should, shouldn't hurt other cast members, man. <laughs> 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 They're probably gonna pay more than what they are getting paid. So. Oh my god! It's really god. funny you kind of say that. While it's never explicitly said, um, <laughs> Austin St. John, as far as I'm aware, never really mm. hit any of the other stuntmen or cast members. Mm-hmm. Jason David Frank Tommy had a history of just hitting everyone oh because my god. he was very classically trained in martial arts. So instead of training in stunt fighting would constantly hit everyone yep. to the point where he's like, hey, calm down, dude. <laughs> yeah, you're going to oh stop God. hitting us. And well, I'm just going to let it For play. I'm lives. trying to like think of things to but say without spoiling things. So. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> oh, no, no evil Billy. Dagger to once again be under Rita's control. That's crazy. Which both of these plans are executed perfectly. With the Rangers once again needing to do battle with the Dragon Zord. Yeah. It becomes too much, and Goldar says that this can all come to an end, and if they want to see their parents alive again, they need to surrender their is power. That a PNG of, a, the... of an hourglass? I think, yes. Is it? Either... Oh my gosh. It's either really... a PNG or a 3D model. Yeah. But like a really crudely drawn one. Yeah. It's so funny. It's... <laughs> You'll see this a lot. Low production. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Need to surrender their power coins. Just like the freaking dragon dagger. It's like so chunky. It's so chunky. Yeah. As like a prop for some reason. It's just so fat. I think that's the American one. It's very fat. Yeah. Let the Rangers make their own decisions since it's their parents' lives that are at stake. They hesitantly surrender the coins to Goldar. It's pretty sad to see, actually, and all the actors do a great job showing their desperation and defeat at making this difficult choice. The one thing I'm sad about this that Connor does not talk about, since Billy was mind-controlled to make this happen, when Billy gives up his coin, he's really like, I'm sorry, guys, like, it was all my fault. Like, and he's like, oh. especially, yeah. <laughs> oh no. He's, he is especially like, David Yost, I think, sells it especially, he's like, like it's all my fault. Like what? Do, like I'm so sorry, but like yeah. he was mind controlled. Like it's not his fault. Mm-hmm. It's not Goldar, his fault. of course, double crosses yeah. on the deal and doesn't free the parents. With Goldar now in possession of all the power coins, well, 
except for one. Wow, it's so, it's so wild if maybe there was return. someone else. Let's go! <gasps> you see how he looks a little different? Part two has the gang calling Tommy into the command. <laughs> yeah, it looks a little different. Him on the situation. It is a little different. It looks a little different. Yeah, actually. Mm. So, funny thing, when when Jason David Frank first joined the show, this is closer to what his hair length was and where he wore his hair. Mm. Because the showrunners were like, men having ponytails, not cool. Yeah. Not cool in the 90s. There's no way that would sell. Which, mm -hmm. like, six months later was completely incorrect. Yes. And men having ponytails became super cool. So they made him go to a mullet for, for when he first came. And then they're like, you know what? Uh -huh. You can grow your hair out now. And now we have good Tommy <laughs> hair. Oh, my yeah. gosh. And he looks so much better and so different. Mm -hmm. But just so much better, in my opinion. Just so mm -hmm. much better. <laughs> Where Zordon says he'll connect his own energy and life force to the green power coin, temporarily giving it power and letting Tommy become the Green Ranger once again. It's He's so back. fun seeing him back in action. He takes on the putties and even goes one-on-one -on -one with Goldar. The coin is struggling to keep up its power though, since Zordon is using so much of his own life to keep it alive. Ah, he to like yeah. screams of that part. Totally wiping yeah. the floor with them. The Green Ranger's on a roll. Zordon, however, ends up disappearing due to the power sharing, and Tommy loses consciousness. We probably never oh, talked no. about this. So, Zordon is a space wizard. An interdimensional space an wizard. An interdimensional space okay. wizard. Who comes is, from the planet Eltar. Yep. And he is stuck okay. in a time loop that if he is broken out of the tube, he will... Um, age rapidly, rapidly age. until yes. he dies. And that was done to him by Rita, right? Okay. And this is a kind of a direct result of the fight for the Green Ranger coin. Yeah. But it's it's never explicitly said, but based on everything that they, we are given, that's what we're led to believe. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it, so ba basically... Uh, Zordon being able to supercharge Tommy's coin or do any of these other fantastical things... He's literally that powerful, but because he's stuck in this time warp, doing it can be dangerous. Yes. Oh, so no. that's that's kind of like the trade off is very, very powerful, very, very dangerous. But you're stuck. Yeah. <laughs> you're stuck in another, a cage. Another quick thing. I We never talked about this either. Jason and Frank, because of his mastery in martial arts, a lot of times when he's in the suit, uh, he is the one doing the stunts in the suit, yep. and the, which oh. brings me back to. Hey, stop hitting us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, oh, he, no. why a lot of the moves that he does are very in line with his real life counterpart because it, it is him. Yeah. Um, okay, okay. Yeah. Um mm. we'll, we'll get to it eventually, but yeah. there is actually eventually. there's actually a scene later that is filmed where he dives off of like what is it? It's like a 50 foot high like cliff yeah. in, into water. And he what? did it himself. And they were yeah. like, you can't do this yourself. We need but to, he did to get it a stunt anyway. person. And he's <laughs> like, I'll do it anyway. He, he literally was like, if you don't let me do it, I'm walking. <laughs> what the fuck? Like he held up production to make him let make them let him do it. And we'll yeah. show you the scene eventually. But it's insane. Yes. A fuck he literally However, anyway. <laughs> before managing to defeat Goldar and retrieve the power coins. The Rangers oh, no. use the coins together to zap Zordon's tube with the power in hopes to bring him back. Wow. Which actually works. Crazy. The Rangers are sent to deal with a Wait, what about Tommy? In the meantime, he's in a coma. Oh, oh. Seems to be surrounded by a power surge. Oh. I'm not too sure what's really happening here. I think when Tommy saved the power coins, all of their combined energy mixed with Zordon's electrically charged Tommy's body and give him a surge of power. What does that mean exactly? Well, to put it simply, the Green Ranger has power once again. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Friends, where the six of them destroy the monster and save their parents. We learn that this electrical surge is temporary, yeah. and that the Green Ranger's powers will run out again eventually. But what for the now, fuck? <laughs> listen, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Zeus. Okay. Stay continuing Whoa, Just celebrate. What is this like? Food fight yeah. They really love the food fight. <laughs> Return of an old friend is awesome. 
getting to see Tommy save the day from a literally pretty gives dire him a chance to go back. Great. Also yeah. says like, oh yeah, it's like a little tiny bit. Here's a free like, trial. Yeah, yeah. It's just a free yeah, trial. That's not permanent. You gotta gotta buy that upgrade sooner or later. Tommy. Always be going on in the background. Tommy's powers are temporary. Will they find a way for him to keep them, or will he lose them once again? Find out next mm. week on Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Yep. Or find out now as we continue on with the video. Hell yeah. Oh, you're so funny. Connie. That's crazy. Rumblebee is the most <laughs> Power Rangers episode to ever exist. The Billy most gets Power Rangers. on a test, which absolutely traumatizes oh. him. Bulk even they says B is for bad. Rita overhears this and is like, oh, Billy hates bees, does he? Well, I'll send down a giant bee monster to take him out. I don't think out. that's how it works, so Rita. The Rangers take out <laughs> Listen, she's got heart, okay? She's got heart. She's trying, okay? She's trying her best. It's, it's, the, it's the effort that counts. Absolutely. It's the effort that counts. Absolutely. Oh, monster. Billy even gets a cool new gun to use. That is such an old grandma moment. Episode. It really <laughs> is. A lot of time seeing how yeah. sad Billy is, but like, am I supposed to feel bad? It's one B. When I was in high school, I'd be lucky to get a B. Two heads are better than one. Whoa. Tommy and Jason are teaching this women's self-defense class full of hot 90s moms. True. And they just work together so greatly. Like, wow, teamwork is great. It's another whatever episode. Rita sends mm. down a monster with two heads, and the only Whoa. way to defeat two it heads. is to feed it its favorite fruit so it gets distracted. Tommy is sent out to find it, but no luck. Ernie, however, bought all a of pomangos. the exotic fruits, one of which being the pomango, the fruit the, the monster likes. Tommy then just asks if he can have it, and Ernie, yeah. being the nicest guy in the world, just gives him Aww. the last one. It's so funny, too, because I feel like this is the point where Tommy really starts going the... Wow, I, I really think I could use that. Thanks. And he yeah. just speaks like that. Like that's the cadence he speaks in. He, yeah, no, he mm. he has this very breathy um delivery. It's like, hey, uh, Ernie, do you think I could borrow that? Thanks. I really appreciate it. It and it's just how he talks. That's just how he talks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But it didn't really start, I think, until like until this. This more like less. his return. Mm -hmm. So Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, he, I'm trying to think of like some other lines where he he really does this delivery where it's like I don't know. Guys. Remember what we were taught? Yeah. As long as we believe in the great power, anything is possible. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> that is to so, those that, that possess so the great power, vibes, man. anything is possible. <laughs> so main protagonist Again, vibes. I'd just be like that. Great for business. They beat the monster, and Balkan Skull show up to the women's defense class to meet quote unquote babes. hot babes. But when they oh show up, man. they're like disgusted saying like ew it's just full of moms and he literally says this while uh, we no respectfully have the most <laughs> <laughs> i'm so what uh-huh the 90s were a wild time man Take yeah the woman on set unbelievable uh, foul play zach's performing magic in front not of an kids international women <laughs> not an international oh my God. wait it's oh not my anymore God. it's not anymore I'm impressed with how well zach is with kids. 1 a.m Rita then sends down a chicken monster, <laughs> just for fun, I guess. A chicken and Zach monster. Has to yeah, absolutely. Disappear to fight it. The fight scenes go on for a lot longer than they used to, since the Bond commissioned Toei to make these fight scenes to match the Power Ranger storyline. Yeah. They don't have to edit out anything that might not fit or make sense. I sure. Also mm. clearly a lot it's kind of ironic because like, there's a lot of Jutsu that I really don't like, mm -hmm. but the fight scenes are usually completely fine. But it's like the plots are usually like a lot not very, fun. Very American. <laughs> yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. A lot more goofy. With we the make Rangers do. doing these over the we top do make hand do. gestures for dialogue and using a lot yeah. more slapstick solutions. Balloons. Like these balloons. The episode. Don't worry about it. Zach thinking he's going on a date with Angela, but it turns out to be another field trip with the kids. Where Angela says they're going to watch a five hour retrospective on Woody Woodpecker, which sounded oh ridiculous my. at the time. <laughs> but I did a four hour and 45 minute retrospective on the Powerpuff Girls, so go watch that instead. True. <laughs> and this is the third time I'm watching this same video that's two and yes. a half or two, almost three you're, hours you're long. You're giving them so much views. Yep. So much content. So much content. So much Trick content. Or treat. 
Kimberly gets to be a contestant oh, on America's this is pumpkin? Game Show. This is Pumpkin Head, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Pumpkin Head. The biggest thing oh, wait, maybe? I'll put, I put yes, the, yes. Yeah, I'll put Sweden the gift. Sweden is summoning the Pumpkin Rapper, which Zordon tells the Ranger is a monster that uses yeah, his raps and rhyming to pumpkin. distract you before he attacks. There we go. That is so stupid. I love it. We get <laughs> random interludes of Skull Got and it. Kimberly doing the game show. That's honestly pretty stupid. Anyway, yeah. Kimberly fake faints to leave the show and fight the monster. <laughs> where, yes, he raps. Well, you think that's something you can oh Mass my god. To the monster, it's bad. It's real bad. On their heads, which only seems like it would make it harder for them to fight, but whatever. Second chance. They... Yeah. Anyways, uh, I guess coaching okay, a soft it's the most god. 90s thing I've ever seen. True. true. That uh, is. Torn real, torn also, real. give me a moment. I, I would actually like to go to the bathroom real quick. Yes, yeah, for sure. Yeah, give me a moment. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. If anyone else needs to use the restroom right now, now is the time to do so. Good time. Um, Good time. But also, break. if you uh, want to help support uh, Roy anymore, uh, now is a perfect time to I do have so. To, I have to come up with a different sub goal now. I'm like... <laughs> Okay, fine. While Roy is figuring that out, uh, hey, if any of you want to support Zeus, that would be lovely. <laughs> oh, whoops. That is subscribers only mode, not goals. Where are my goal? Manage goals. Why is that a heart? I don't know. Uh. Okay. Subscription goal six hundred. I guess. Mm -hmm. All right, bring oh, the What we got? Uh, that's a good question. What do you guys want to see? What do you want to see from Roy Keato? Hmm. Get Iron Mouse to come on. We'll rank all the Power Ranger seasons. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be amazing. Mm -hmm. This is it's tough, you know. Like I, I don't specifically know what I want to do. Watch mm. party. Of what? What do you guys want to watch? Yeah, that's a good. Smash or pass every Power Ranger? Can't do that because a lot of them are depicted as teenagers. And while yeah. we might, like, you know, go goo goo gaga over, like, the actors, because the actors are adults, they're yes. depicting teenagers. So it's it's a little awkward sometimes. It's a little weird. Uh, it's it, it, <laughs> There's a lot of hoops to jump through there. <laughs> yeah. More ASMR. That's already going to happen regardless. I've, I've got more stuff. Your listening season with Mousey would be amazing, but that'd be a task to set up. Yeah, I've hmm. I've, I've I've not talked to Mouse that aside from at like wild. conventions. Um, I don't know. We could could do a Power Rangers movie marathon in Discord. Hmm. Considering there's only three movies, yeah, it's like it'd be like five Hi. hours. Welcome back. Welcome back. Hello. We'll figure it out. Hello. hello. We'll do some brainstorming hello. off stream. Hey, welcome back. Team for kids. Thank you. Yeah. This one kid doesn't make the team and is sad. Aww. Ernie's all like, Aww. man, I wish it were up to me. I'd give all these kids a second chance. And Zach Aww. says, isn't it up to you? And Ernie's like, oh, oh yeah. yeah. And <laughs> gives everyone a second chance. <laughs> I love Ernie. Chance. What the oh, hell? my God. So I love Zach him so much. Try and help this kid one get last trash report, but thank you for the 200 bits. <laughs> like, he really shouldn't be on the team. He's thank terrible. you for the trash bags before you go to bed. Weird, I appreciate that. <laughs> he gets in trouble with his communicator going off in class and gets it taken away. That's crazy. It explains why oh, he won't gosh. show up until later. But this is the exact time Jason and Zach are training this kid in soccer. Yeah. So, like... Why are those two not in school? Heck, even Billy, Kimberly, and Trini are all at the juice bar. What is this school schedule? I seriously Great cannot question. stop thinking about this the entire time. Yeah. Anyway, Tommy shows up to summon the dragon it's door bad. and saves the day. Mm -mm. On fins and needles. This is a really fun episode. So Jason and Tommy are once again teaching a karate class. Where yeah. they're shown how great of friends they are. They would never argue with each other. Never. So never. Never. Never, not never ever, ever. Magic fin that mm -hmm. when Jason and Tommy touches it, will put a spell on them to make them bitter rivals. Whoa. That's so oh. wild. see Jason and Tommy mean mugging each other and on the brink of fighting. The actors do a really good job of acting like they hate each other. <laughs> Maybe because behind the scenes, this is how they really felt. I'll go more into that later, though. Yeah. yeah the angry faces. Oh, Zordon God. Sends Jason and yeah. Tommy to fight the monster all alone so they can work together. They struggle at first, but eventually break through the spell and do some teamwork. Well, the transition from American the to Japanese yeah, footage there. Yeah. Enter the Lizinator. 
Kimberly's cousin is trying out for the middle school cheerleading team. She's all right. Is this but the feels like she'll never be as good as Kimberly? Is this the Kimberly one with the golden apple? Her up, but the putties attack. I... Again, it's another fun really? unmorphed fight. Tommy really goes hard. Oh, on these, putting some I was gonna say like kicks. You can't. You can, oh oh he's talking about it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, damn. <laughs> Guess who's here, guys? Guess who's here? Apparently, Jason <laughs> David Frank would actually kick the actors in the putties oh, there we go. early oh, on no. in the show. Where they needed to tell him, hey, you don't actually have to hit that. But Look at that. On in the show, where Look at that face. Him, no, he there. just, that's just straight up contact. Yeah, he, he just, just kicked that dude yeah, in the chest. He just jumped on that, yeah. Yeah. Hey, How you were going you like, oh, look at that face, because he snapped at the face. It's a fun episode <laughs> once again, since the Zhu 2 footage allows for longer fights in the suits. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and Kimberly's cousin joins the team. But Bulk Yay. and Skull show up to mock her. Like, dang, they really are bullies. Just being a jerk to this little girl for no reason. So mean. Football season. I hate oh, this football. episode the so much. Join the football team. Tommy, though, doesn't feel confident <sighs> that he has what it takes. Ernie overhears this and takes him under his wing, apparently being a big football star in college. Mm. I, for some reason, oh. totally believe that. He <laughs> then sends down a monster that Zordon himself says is challenging the Rangers to a football game. Wow. Which they <laughs> end up taking part That's... in, which is so stupid. Like, why That's crazy. Are just busting up the power what? Sword and fighting the them? Japanese actors are going to be like, huh? Yeah, because yeah, it's American they, they football, the too. And it's like, what? <laughs> when people American talk about football. like how cheesy Power Rangers is, a lot of these like cheesy conversations are usually talking about things like this. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just so, know. it's just so bad. Like, yeah. it just don't make sense. No, it really don't. Like, why aren't you? They probably had fun. Yes. Power sword and but them. like. They somehow uh, get captured and need Tommy's uh, help to save them. Yeah. I forgot to mention, but in every single episode since Tommy got his powers back, whenever he gets ready to morph, someone will always mention that his powers are temporary and he shouldn't risk it. Mm. Which he ignores every time. I don't care. I'm morphing out of here. In this case, really <laughs> needed Tommy. I gotta How help my friends. A Literally. A bunch of putties. After they blow up the monster, they all somehow make the football team. Including Billy? Yeah! Like, is he still a nerd Eddie at this Yoko. point? He's a total yeah. jock. Mighty Mo so, the reason I hate that episode is why in the hell do they think they have enough time to yep. play football while the Rangers and doing everything else? And that is never mm. mentioned again. They teach That's martial true, arts. Yeah. Yeah. They, they constantly do environmental, you know. Help. Yep. Yeah. Health things. Uh, yeah. Now they're part of the football team on top of their responsibilities of being a Power Ranger. Homework, yep. not in, not including homework. Yep. Um, and then school, <laughs> the classes. Yeah, I'm like, what? Yeah. Is, yeah. What, what so, is happening? Yeah. Um, football's never mentioned again. Yeah. So well, it's, that's okay. not true. They play football, but the football team is yeah. never the football team is never again. mentioned again. Yeah. And they have unlimited time to do everything. Maybe. 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 They have the dark hour. <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> Morph in every, every time they fight, yeah. they Rita just go into dark hour. Rangers, yeah. Fun putty training montage. <laughs> these ones, though, actually seem to be a bit more of a threat. They attack Kimberly and Tommy these. and fight them unmorphed. There's also this whole side plot with Tommy being forgetful and needing to try and remember things like his homework, chores, etc. None of this really matters. I want to see the Rangers fight the evil Rangers. Yeah. It's a bit more mm -hmm. interesting than the last time, mainly because these Rangers talk and even get evil versions of. So cool, no. small thing about this. It's, it's hard to see because it's an action shot, but the mm -hmm. weapons that the evil Rangers use are the Zhu Rangers weapons from Zhu Rangers that mm. turn into the power weapons. Oh, so like they're the actual same props and everything, and it, and even though it's just reusing props, I really liked it as a as just a nod. Yeah, as know? a nice touch. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. The weapons. I especially like the evil Green Ranger using the dark sword as opposed to the dragon dagger, which That's is also a cool, cool. Detail. Even when Rita makes the monster grow, the evil Rangers join it, which is kind of a weird visual oh, wow. to see. Whoa. Yeah, we also yeah. see that's a bomb. That is weird. New Titanus footage. Yeah, new Titanus <laughs> footage. Like new Titanus footage. Yeah. Episode sixty. Look at how gorgeous that toy is. Yeah. Find <laughs> <season laughs> <laughs> 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 a toy. Find a toy. Find a toy. Oyster stew. Yeah. So it's, it's Angela's birthday. It's so funny. This is the last episode of the season. Yes. Oh. And it is not a finale. But okay. it has one of the coolest things in, in all of season one, in my opinion. Okay. Dude, oh, God, her again. 
Zack wants to do something real special and nice. He has this whole fancy dinner date planned out where he really wants to get Aww. her pearl earrings. Yeah. Zack tries to ask Angela out, but she's hesitant. Like, on bro, top of the fact that they can make man. money. He's literally yeah. on the verge of tears begging her to go out. Oh it's my so god. Sad. You can oh my do better, goodness, Zach. Gracious, man. You, you could do better. Maybe red is his favorite color, Connor. No! Putty. Tommy and Kimberly join like Zach and Angela could for be. this cute little double date. And, and it's actually that? not cute at all. It's super cringy and everything goes wrong. The earrings oh, will no. reveal to be a trap that freezes everyone in sight. Leaving only Zach and Tommy to stop the monster. Oh no. During the fight, we get a really cool visual with Zack being hurt and Tommy lending his dragon shield to him. It's so good looking. Really cool -looking this is something that never quite happens ever again, but there's a toy that came out not too long ago that references it. this. Yeah, and I have it. It is one of my favorite because it's just black and gold is such a good color combination. It's a sexy color. <laughs> yeah. It looks so good. Good. Along with the white accents, yeah. yes, yes, please. Oh yes. my gosh, it's so good, mm -hmm. yeah. They eventually free the others and destroy the clam monster. That's it. Where Zach apologizes to Angela through song. It's kind of weird and out of place, but hey, it's cute enough. And Angela <laughs> I was gonna say, oh, they get a kiss too, but oh, uh, Walter Emanuel Jones actually used to work at Disney, so he's like trained theatrically so he can sing oh, and dance and all that kinds of stuff mm. so. angela snags him a kiss oh my goodness i forgot this happened there are I did literally too. I always forgot. couples in future power ranger seasons that never kiss it's true. <laughs> andros and ashley oh <laughs> wes and jen anyway with that <laughs> yeah mighty Morphin power rangers comes to an yeah. end yeah Oh, how many figures do you have of the Power Rangers? How many figures do you have of the Power Rangers? I have like the first four waves of the Lightning Collection figures, but like I had to stop collecting them because like it's just expensive to keep up. It's with. expensive. It is expensive. And yeah. There's too many. I. Lots yeah. of money. <laughs> it's like for that reason, I don't collect any of them. The only things that I collect, even and I throw this up in quotations, are the like. The role play uh, legacy weapons and yep. things like mm. that. Even the then, I, I haven't collected a lot of the newer ones. I've got mm -hmm, the mm -hmm. I've got all of the legacy weapons. And oh, I got Fifi. Hi, Hi Fifi. Hi, Fifi. How Hello. are you? Wait, how are you awake? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a great question. That's, that's how is everyone awake? awake? <laughs> that's a good question. I mean, we're night owls. It happens. Hmm. But yeah, I'm still waiting for them to true. make the ball in the axe. right now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh uh, gosh! Let us continue. Thank you for the shout out for Fifi. Thanks, guys. Definitely not a grandiose finale or anything. But again, with the massive success of Mighty Morphin, they knew they'd be around for a while. Yeah. And we'll plan mm -hmm. some more massive stories in the near future. <laughs> but, it do be yeah, like that. Season one of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers comes to a close. If I haven't wow. made it obvious, it's a it's wild no wonder this conclusion. show took off the way it did in the '90s. All of the actors did a great job portraying these characters. David Yost did a perfect and likable nerd. Amy true. Jo Johnson was a it's popular true. pretty girl. True and real. It's annoying. Tui Trang always felt like the most mature and level-headed. Also Walter true. Walter Jones was so cool and charismatic. I love him. Jason David Frank easily inspired kids all around the world to want to learn spin kicks. And nobody has a voice and commanding presence like Austin St. John. I, listen, I don't know about that. <laughs> listen, sometimes you just got to bring on the power sword. You know what I'm saying? Just gotta, oh my god. It's got to bring on the power sword. Sometimes you, know? you can bring on the power sword. Thank you. God, that's oh all I'm saying. God. Character mm -hmm. development, there really wasn't much. Billy was probably the only one going from helpless nerd to competent hero. Yeah. There was a pilot episode that was. We didn't talk about this at all. Oh, yeah. What? There was a pilot episode that was supposed to start. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was, yeah. Like, it was like a month oh. or two before the actual season started. And Twee Trang, Trini is not Trini. And yes. the cast looks super different. So yeah, like, uh, take, it, we didn't learn about this until halfway through the seventh season of Power Rangers. They kept uh, us okay. buried for a while. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Why did they but, show it like that late? Or is it for like a collection I think it just, thing? No, I think it just leaked. It, oh no, damn! No, 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 they didn't leak it. They they actively showed it like during Lost Galaxy. Oh. Did you not know about that? Yeah. yeah. So they not. had a they had a whole thing. Is like, hey. Thank you guys for watching Power Rangers for the last something something years. Um, 
I want to show you guys what Power Rangers used to was going to be. And it was a presentation between uh, oh. Zach and Jason. It, it aired like in the middle of Lost Galaxy. That's so um, weird. Yeah. No, you can still find that whole presentation on YouTube. That's so um, weird. But yeah, um, so Trini was originally played by someone named Audrey Dubois, um, who uh, I don't know. I think they're Hispanic. I could be wrong. Mm. Um, but a lot of things are different. Um, yeah. In the original episode, the very first episode of Power Rangers that, that aired, um, Zordon has a line that says, once you hold your power morphers up to the sky, you can morph. But in every time you've seen the morphing sequence, right, they hold it out in front of them. That's, mm -hmm. That line is a reference to the original footage yep. because they didn't know what they were oh. going to do yet. Yeah. So in the pilot episode, they hold their morphers up into the sky. And it's very funny. I know we've been talking about how funny Jason's voice is, but everyone says they're dinosaur <sighs> relatively normally. Mastodon, mm -hmm. Pterodactyl, Triceratops, Sabertooth Tiger. And then Jason goes, Tyrannosaurus. Oh. <laughs> it's no energy, nothing behind it whatsoever, which is super wow. different than what we're used wow. to with this, Jason. It's very funny. Oh, my yeah. God. But even more so, check out how violent this is. This is, mess this is actually giga God. violent. In 1999, huh? long after Mighty Morphin was over. It's oh, also Animorphs. What the fuck? Yeah, talk about it. Talk about it. Talk about it. What the fuck? Amateur, I think talk about it. Fitting word. <laughs> the acting and cinematography. Talk about feels it. A lot like a high school film project. Yes. The Rangers yeah. were also a lot more violent. Yeah. Like, there's they these were. bullies in a bowling alley. Oh, there's Bulk. Alley, including a weird, cracked-out version of Bulk. <laughs> the thing immediately just jumps to violence and beats the butt Jesus out of them. Yeah. That's like, a regular yeah, training. Think about it. In Mighty Morphin, no one ever punched Bulk in the face. They let him be his own downfall. Yeah. But here, Jason spin kicks him in the face like three times. Oh my yeah. god! Yeah, it is yeah. actually it's crazy. Audrey Dubois. I'm not sure why she didn't play Trini in the final product. Probably some generic Hollywood recasting BS. There was definitely something here that just needed some reworking. Yeah. It's definitely worth a watch for curiosity's sake. Apart from Tommy, two of the show's other runaway stars were Bulk and Skull. Yeah! They also didn't have much character development yet. Not so yet. Being dumb bullies. <laughs> yet! However, they were loved enough to potentially have their own show. Unfortunately, Jason Narvi, who played Skull, said that nobody was interested in buying it. I guess people don't enjoy happiness and fun. Yeah! Oh, nope. dang, what else came with Power Rangers? <laughs> oh my so gosh. So much toys to buy. Most famously the being Power the Rangers, Rangers with the flippy heads that I still have today. <laughs> video mind. games, VHS I'm tapes. Screaming. I mean, look, I'll probably need to do a separate video. Back, so back in the day, a lot of these commercials, like Ken and I are mimicking the voice, but it was literally like I, an announcer would be like, the Power Rangers use the Power their mighty Rangers morphin use their swords. Mighty swords to defeat the evil space aliens. Yep. <laughs> and those would be the toy commercials. I had a reverb. <laughs> I, was, I was saying, that was nice. My oh, gosh. Just on the merchandise this show released. Yep. This video is already going to be long enough without it. So if really? you're interested in that. Oh, that's know. crazy. I think I've already made my opinions no on the arcs and storylines pretty clear as we've gone through them. So with all of that. I guess let's move on to Mighty Morphin Power Rangers season two. Okay, I can what? definitely last for season two. Okay, but Sounds season good. season three is my might where I need to to duck out. And then okay. we will continue another season time. Two yeah, because we can combine because we can combine season three and Zio, which yes, we can. I feel like is a good. I like, think it's actually better that way. Yeah, honestly, because Zio <laughs> is only an hour and 20 minutes or so and season three of mighty morphin is only like 45 minutes so it, it'll give us a nice like combination of time yeah yeah, yeah. okay mm -hmm. the yeah Mutiny part one we see the rangers plus balkan skull taking and this part is in season two remember ATV now race for season, season two okay. Jutu Jutu footage sports stuff yep we're still in you two really matters is what happens next frida is planning her next <sighs> attack when all welcome of a sudden, back scorpina <laughs> yeah i was gonna say <laughs> she's been mia star is fully aware of what's going on the true emperor of evil has returned to claim Here his he is. I love him so Lord much. Here comes the boy. Lord Zed is one of, if not the single most intimidating and I love him so much. Like so a couple of things real quick and Connor might mention it in the video. I never remember. But like mm -hmm. his brain is exposed. This is all like muscle. Skin, it's like right? yeah, it's, it's literally has no skin. It's all muscle. Um, and you can see veins and stuff running. He's got these tubes going in and out that are actually carrying fluid. His and visor lights up. 
the visor lights up. He's got these metallic claws. He's got this giant staff. He's got like this this metallic armor all around him. And, and you haven't even heard his voice yet. Y- you'll hear his voice. It is so good. It is okay. Arguably, I, I still think he's the most iconic Power Rangers villain of all time. Yes. Mm. Badass villain in Power Rangers, the series has ever to this seen. Shit. Just look at this design. Oh, it's so He's cool a walking, looking. skinless brute. It's so All of his organs are out looking. on display, including his brain, which I'm really surprised was allowed to air on a children's show. It almost wasn't. It almost Unlike wasn't. Rita, who had a screechy voice and was generally pretty oh, yeah. silly. Here we go. Here we go. Lord Play it. Zed is all business, mocking and threatening oh, anyone in his presence, not. Not including Goldar and Rita herself. All with his super cool voice. Oh, here we go. This is probably the best vocal embodiment of the word evil I've ever heard. Those Power Rangers are nothing but mere infants. You were defeated by children. Lord Zed then creates his new brand of buddies. <laughs> is that great, Zeus? That yeah. is uh, that is that is actually really really good. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually like that that you know that villain is serious. Oh, absolutely. So for, uh, for context, if you want to like go look this up, the voice actor for Lord Zed, his name is Robert Axelrod. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> passed away by this point. But mm. if you wanted to compare it to some of his other roles, Armadillomon from Digimon. Oh, <laughs> or- Armadillomon, Digivolve to Digmon, the drill of power. Yeah, or that that is- <laughs> Or even in this show, he's also Finster, who is the guy that makes the monsters. Yeah. And oh and Finster's God. voice is it's a lot more up here while he's making these monsters. The range. Yeah. It, it is the actually fuck? insane. But of course, yeah, when in Lord said, Those power rages! It's just very visceral. Yeah. Yeah. It's so good. Mm-hmm. Which are just regular putties and, and a he's got Z putties. Z on their chest. It's so <laughs> crazy seeing Rita beg and grovel to Zed. He then traps Rita back into her space dumpster and sends her flying into the abyss. <laughs> also, interesting well, point. Goodbye, Rita. This is one of the first and only times we have American footage of Rita. Mm-hmm. Um, and a lot of the scenes with her are shot from the back. Uh-huh. So, yeah. uh, because they didn't know who they wanted to use for the, the actress yet. Yeah, for so, American mm-hmm. Rita. American Rita. Because every time you would ever seen Rita, it was always the Japanese footage. Yep. Okay, okay pretty hardcore these totally new and improved putties get sent down to attack bulk and skull oh man so the rangers morph on out to save them where we get our oh, first no. look at i believe the first real bits of american battle footage yeah we see these <gasps> new z putties as they're known oh. an american creation they were never oh. Zhu ranger or a part of Zhu too so whenever they're on screen they had to be filmed by saban and the u.s team the battles are okay they're choreographed well enough but I don't know. I feel like they're kind of lacking in something that the Japanese. But this is their first real better. instance of good fight scenes. Yeah. Um, oh. Cool American uh, footage. And okay. I, I would put good in quotations. Yeah. But we'll point out. It's good enough. Good it's better. Good right enough. Now. Yes. It got better, but we'll, we'll get there. But on more fight scenes this season are way better. I'm actually mm-hmm. not sure if this is the Japanese or American stunt team. I think it might I be think the it's, American stunt team. I think it's still American at this point. I think it's a yeah. few episodes in that they switched to the Japanese stunt team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So. The putties are pretty indestructible, but the Rangers learn they can defeat the putties by hitting the big Z on their chest. Yeah, it's hard to see them as an upgrade when you have a big Z-shaped target a, on a your self, chest. A self-destruct <laughs> button. That's crazy. What, okay. what are you talking about? It's not just... Nah, okay. nah, that's... Yeah, they have a giant uh, that, is, that is an oversight from Lord Z yeah. right there. Yeah, that's, okay. that's... I don't know what you're talking about. That's crazy. Okay. This is where the two bullies finally got some character development. Where throughout oh. season two, they're not just mindless bullies, but instead have a new mission. To find out the identity of the Power Rangers. And there we go. Oh Zed God! And that's our mission. From a piranha, and it's pretty powerful. Sounds like a design flaw. Being yeah. Able to freeze the Zords mid transformation, rendering oh. them completely useless. All oh, poor pterodactyl. It's frozen them. in the air forever. It's frozen in the air. Yeah. <laughs> All of the Zords are frozen. He's not. gonna look up and see like why is there a frozen pterodactyl up there? Don't worry <laughs> about it. It's fine. Once again, weakening and need to recharge from Zordon. After attempting to summon the Dragon Zord to fight the evil T-Rex, Zed then puts Wait, did the he just say that he has to just recharge the, the core? Yeah, so it's like... He's every, getting to that point. Every once in a while, uh, Zordon basically has to, like, recharge, but, like, 
remember the threat is still there of like, hey, every time Zordon does this, he's basically draining his own life force. Yeah, essentially what's happening is like the free trial of, hey, your free trial is about to end. What do you want to do? And then you just kind of click the X button. Oh my God, away. it's a subscription. It basically. <laughs> it's basically the all it is. The meanwhile, ends with a life. Oh God. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess you want to keep using it for a little bit longer. We can let you keep using it for a little bit. Yeah. For a little bit. <laughs> Just a little I, bit. I may be losing 10 years of my life, but you know, you yep. gotta help out. It's win wrong. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. They retreat to the command center. Also, first time we see the Rangers without their helmets on in the command center. Yes. Oh, true. Yeah. Where once again, their spirits are completely shattered. Losing all hope. And you can kind of see how big these things are, too. Oh, no, these are the hero Yeah, necks. They, those are thick. <sighs> it's just this big chunk of foam around their oh, neck. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah. Goodness. It's bad. What to do. Luckily, Zordon has a surprise for them. Brand new Megazords. That's <gasps> right. Zordon's been keeping these things tucked away for an emergency. Where Jason will command the Red Dragon. Yeah! Zane the Lion, Billy the Unicorn, Trini the Griffin, Kimberly the Firebird, and Tommy the Nothing. Zordon says that his powers are too weak to control a new Zord. This was honestly pretty sad to see. Poor Tommy. <laughs> However, oh, poor I mean, Tommy. He is, he's fine. He, listen, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. This oh, is yeah. probably okay. a good time to say that well, that's awesome, Zordon Brandon. is that's a fantastic. character in the show that has an answer for everything. Mm -hmm. um, if, it, if he doesn't have an answer now, he will later. Um, yep. And that is something that gets explained and touched upon later on. So having these Zords kind of tucked away in an emergency is very in line with his um what's the word i want to use his character uh, his character yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. but yeah yeah okay zordon says the rangers can't use the new zords until the old ones are back in their control due to uh, some reason Billy and Trini no reason. I, I I think he basically says it's like we need like the pe like a piece of the we soul need the of pieces the of them. Yeah, yeah, to to like make the oh. new ones kind of thing. They're the, okay. they're the base of the Zords, yeah. and you see it when they like okay. summon them. Yeah, it it okay. makes more sense in the show than than he's saying right here. This, this is one of the things I'm like I don't think I agree with that. Like they, yeah. I, I feel like he does make it like. We need them back so we can make the new Zords kind of thing. So yeah. I, I thought he was petty and is like, hey, you know, you kind of <laughs> lost my Megazords. Can you kind of, can you like give them back so I'll trade you yeah. guys these new you gotta, ones? You got to <laughs> trade in the old ones to get the new ones, yeah, man. You know, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Their control. Meanwhile, more Z putties are sent out to cause havoc. So it's up to the rest of the Rangers to get back to action. Back to action. Yeah, like back that. Back to action. Back yeah. To action. The fight goes on for a really <laughs> long time. Not relying on any Sentai footage and being in control of the choreography clearly has its advantage. They literally go through like three entire songs through this fight. Yeah. It's like a kid oh my god. An FMV. The Rangers are then sent to deal with the fish monster and the evil Zords, where Billy and Trini still aren't done working on the device. How will the Rangers survive? I wonder. Well, let's find part out. Part three. Need part three. Yeah. Me and Billy finish the machine just in the nick of time. One problem though, it's not working. Oh no. The Rangers then get sick what? of nothing going oh, right no. and summon the power blaster to take out the frustrations on the fish monster. <laughs> After this, Billy realizes, "Oops, I put in the batteries backwards." Yeah, <laughs> very silly. Millions have died that's, during this. That's crazy. They to take that's crazy. Off the Look how Ty just hit his head like that? you dumbass. Yeah, literally. <laughs> to open up the earth and trap the Zords. Whoa. <laughs> Oh my god! Do you remember this same shot? Footage. What? Oh I've no. never seen this before. I've what are you never seen this shot before? What are you guys? talking about? That's oh. crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, no. oh my god. Oh no. Oh, That's no. a new oh, footage no. right there. <laughs> Definitely well, new, right? <laughs> so Zed opened up a, a literally like an earthquake and is putting them into this and then crushing okay, the earth closed. Uh -huh. To the center of it. Just like Rita did during Doomsday. Yeah. Only here, it's actually permanent. Tommy <gasps> sends the dragon sword yeah. back to the sea where it can't be hurt. And just like that, and never seen again. Bye bye dinosaur. Never not yet. Seen not again. Not yet, but because Zordon well, yeah. somehow managed yeah. to save some of the dinosaur's power. I don't know what that uh, means. What? I will say that's a, that to yeah, that's a, a whatever. Improved Thunder Megazords. The Rangers summon their Zords using their these. new callouts, and I still get chills every time I Zach says, Mastodon Lion Thunder Zord Power. <laughs> the Thunder Zord is really cool. I love its yes. samurai design, its cool sword. I'll go more into the Thunder. 
So cool thing. So now now we're in completely new season footage territory. Oh. So yeah. where Power Rangers initially took footage from uh, Kyoryu Sentai Juranja and mm. then made Ju two footage because they ran out of footage, they realized that. Continuing to do that would be incredibly expensive because probably commissioning them for Ju 2 footage probably cost them about as much as the whole first season, I would imagine. Right. Okay. These so now, ones, Go ahead. <laughs> so now, like we were saying, Power Rangers is a combination of a bunch of different shows. Yep. And now mm-hmm. we are in Gosei Sentai Die Ranger footage. Yep. Mm. Uh, Die Ranger is, I think, super underrated, in my opinion. Uh, mm. It mm. is Chinese mythology themed. With a lot Ooh. of really, really good martial arts and really, really good unmore fight scenes, really, really good personal arcs. It's got mm. it it was so popular back in the nineties when it came mm-hmm. out. They ended it on a cliffhanger because they thought Just that they they thought that they could come back for another season. You know? Okay. So okay. and then they were told, unfortunately, not. So Roy, do you <laughs> happen to know its original name? Um no. I don't think so. I thought you were acting the <laughs> I'm just curious. Yeah, do, you, do you know so, Juice? Yeah, do you know about this thing that you've never heard of until right now? Do you know this no, this no, niche wait. fact about it? No. Oh, did I say no. Zeus? I meant Roy. My fault. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Roy, do you happen to remember its original name? Sorry. I do not. Okay, so it, this was revealed in an episode of Akiba Ranger. Oh. Akiba Ranger is a uh, spin-off Sentai that was targeted specifically at adults. Um, so there's a lot of like tongue in cheek adult jokes in this show. Um, but the original name of Die Ranger was Chikyu Sentai Chinaman. Oh, right, right. I'm so happy this didn't go through. Yeah, <laughs> that's very that is, um, questionable title. Yeah, yeah. it is, it is yeah. Chinese mythology themed. Like, that's that's not uh-huh. wrong, but. They could have just said it in a different way. Yeah. So Listen, we can't go know? back to we can't Sentai go back to Battle Fever. Man. We got uh-huh. Die Ranger. Yeah. All right. Anyway. I'm just yeah. in a second. Everyone's pretty stoked. Everyone except for Tommy. Because yeah, he didn't happy, get a new Zord. Clearly disappointed. He can't help his new team and power <laughs> his own Zord. Yeah. Aww. They use the Thunder Zord to take down the fish monster, and the day is saved. We even get some fun banter with Bulk and Skull talking to the Rangers. Yeah. Saying that they're awesome and they're gonna find out who they are. The Rangers I mean, get a hey, guess it worked. from Zordon, mm-hmm. saying that Lord Zed is I just noticed Billy's not having glasses much. Yeah, that's because they were fake. <laughs> <laughs> D- David oh, Yost can... does not wear glasses. They put them on him to make him look more nerdy. And now yeah, like, they've decided to let to him not free. Do... Okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> I think I think he still has them from time to time, but like mm. not all the time now. We okay, assume gonna... he just wears contacts or something. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. It's yeah, going to be my head cannon at this point. Okay, he just changed the contacts. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> the mutiny three-parter is such an awesome. This way is the fighting game, by the way. Lord Zed that came out uh, a couple years ago. This is the, the only fighting, fighting game that I actively play. There was I like watching it. Silly about him. But Even that's mocking it. Rita with her. The graphics are nice. Like the pudgy pig and ruining Kimberly's floats. Lord Zed showed up on the scene and not only kicked Rita I'm out, this. but froze the Zords with his basic fish monster. <laughs> Kicking the and shit out of him. Said it's Zords so funny. Oh my and god. And weakened Tommy's powers even more. The three parter was also awesome because it once again felt like an action drama. Yeah. Sure, there were silly bulk and skull moments, but for the most part, we were following the Rangers needing to learn to adapt and deal with this bigger and badder threat. There's a lot of really cool the stuff Thunder like that Zords now. Oh, here we go. Really cool addition. They this is from Die Ranger. Gose yep. Sentai yeah. Die Ranger. Yeah, Saban was going to eventually run out of Zhu 2 footage, but he wasn't ready to adapt a whole new set of costumes since the Mighty Morphin ones were so iconic. So to buy some time, they just adapted the Zord from that Sentai. Yep. Moving on. Yeah. The, um, the Rangers, Rangers, you will Zord never see the in the cockpit of this Zord because obviously it didn't belong to them. So every mm. time they, it switches the Zord footage, they immediately just stop showing the Rangers. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, yeah. It's, so, it's, when do they actually change, uh, have a costume change? Not until. <sighs> not in this video. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, we, we get three seasons of Mighty Morphin, essentially. And mm-hmm. then Zeo, which is the next season mm-hmm. after this, uh, is mm-hmm. when we have okay. our first costume change. Okay. Okay. Yeah. But the season, a- the Mighty Morphin season three. We do get mm. cockpit shots that get 
shown because they finally were like, oh my God, we made money. Mm. We can, we, we can spend money and improve the quality money. of the show. Production, and it'll finally. make us money. And, <laughs> oh my and God. It's yeah. so, it's so <laughs> funny too, because season oh. three of Mighty Morphin is easily the best season of Mighty Morphin. Yes. And it because, shows because the amount of production. <laughs> yes, the amount of production. They finally oh know how God. Power Rangers works. Yep, uh, they're comfortable with the source material at this point. Um, mm. Like sixty there, percent of, of the reason. show is not filler. Yeah. Like sixty mm -hmm. percent of it is actually like multi-parters and like good storytelling Story, and fun. Yeah. Mm, okay. So, okay. Yeah. Uh, someone in my chat said there are, there are the alien rangers though. We don't talk about so, this. So we. <laughs> Okay. We'll talk about that. Uh, okay. We're not, we we're will not. talk about them. Okay. Uh, we will however, talk about those, but not tonight. However, uh, okay. if, if we stop at season two, uh, at the end of season two, we will get to them in this video. Yeah. Okay. We will get to them eventually, but just not. Yes. Not tonight. He's temporarily going to disappear due to an alignment with the stars and planets for a few hours. Again, time warp. Kind of a design flaw on his part. Time warp stuff. With Zordon gone, yep. Alpha is yeah. not in charge to alert the Rangers if anything happens. He sees a lost child and decides to jump into oh, no. action for himself. And what could possibly go on? <gasps> oh no. Everything. No. Zed then sends down a monkey monster that's able to shape shift. It turns into Billy who reprimands Alpha. Evil but Billy again, by the way. Yeah. Evil Her Billy Alpha again. Then has no choice but to activate his self-destruct. <laughs> oh my god, it's a huh? very simple but genius plan. Well, listen, yeah. if his technology fell into Zed's hands, then Zed might be able to get into the command center. He might be able oh. to get the Zords. He yeah. might be able to get into the command center. There's a whole thing. <laughs> yeah, it'd be bad. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Deception. It'd be bad. It then transforms into Zack, telling Trini and Kimberly to go to the park and help Tommy, where it's an obvious trap where they get ambushed by the putties. After defeating them, they confront Zack. Did it's she like just kick that guy in the well nuts? Yes. Going. Well, chat, yeah. but yeah. <laughs> the baboon and fight it. Where more confusing shenanigans ensue. You too! It's a really fun episode on Yeah, two let's give! Who's who. They yeah! Monster, <laughs> save Alpha from self-destruction, and Alpha gets grounded. Yeah. I think. Well, I, so, you know. Re really quickly, Zed because I know, I know Connor doesn't talk about this, because I remember this. Sure. How Alpha leaves the command center, right? That doesn't happen really again until a Christmas special that he doesn't talk about. Um, yeah. <laughs> Alpha leaves the command center and inadvertently kidnaps children because he's lonely for Christmas. Y yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's it's very endearing almost, but and the the intentions are good. I promise. That's not endearing. That's not. Endearing. But yeah. but he kidnapped a bunch of children so he can spend Christmas with them. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> are we talking about the true goddess of all time, Rita Repulsa? Absolutely, Michaela. We have. We talked about oh, how amazing. We, have, we talked about how amazing uh, Barbara Goodson is. We talked about how uh, a lot uh, of voice actors got their start in Power Rangers. We you talked know, we, about Robert Axelrod. Just talked now. about Robert Axelrod. We talked about Barbara Goodson, Richard Horvitz, Johnny Bosch, like tons and tons of people. So let's go. It's been it's been amazing, guys. Can we get a shout out for Michaela as well? Uh, if you guys don't know Michaela, they are mm -hmm. my script writer uh, and uh, and friend of mine. We uh, we get to work on the the voice acting role play projects. Which, in case you didn't know, hey, I had a new uh, voice acting uh, project come out today. I saw. You had a what? Yeah. yeah, it's it's the follow up to my most popular uh, one Wait. yet. Wait, I, I, I'm surprised you didn't know about this. I saw no, it. No, no. I mean, I, I had no idea. Whoa, but, but Kane, wait, wait. If, if I were to see it, where would I possibly look for it? You would go to youtube.com slash at cup of dusk voices, which you can get to by going to my chat and typing an exclamation point VA in chat. No way. I mean, if I didn't hear about it, there has to be a whole bunch of people in chat that have never heard about it. Wait, actually, let me pull up the link and I'll just link people to it. Hold on. Yeah, no worries. I, I got you. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> let me go find it. Go, go, go ahead. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Okay. No, I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait. Mm, mm, mm. <clears throat> oh, damn. It's a, it's a one out of 10. Pog. Cool. That's yeah, cool. yeah. We love that. We love that. Yeah, we love that. Yeah. <laughs> we love that. We, we love. Mm. Guy, guys, go check it out. Go check oh, it out, wow. guys. Woo. There's the wow. link right there. Oh, my goodness. And it goes straight to YouTube? It goes right to the video. Roy that's Piano. incredible. Oh, that's, my, that's my demo. I don't listen to that. My bad. <laughs> 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 
this some incredible immersion. I know, right? <laughs> uh, listen, it, it just be like that, you know. It just, it just, <laughs> it just, do, it just do be like it that. just be like that. I don't have to tell it you. Just do be like that, guys. You know what's actually hilarious is the the voice acting channel is actually almost monetized purely on like four videos. <gasps> it's it's Yo. it's like been that crazy, yeah. I like that villains, but crazy. obviously don't watch it now. Listen to the Power Rangers. We are, we are, we are. <laughs> Save that link for later. The Power Rangers first. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. All right, back to action. Curse on these sunglasses that Zack and Billy put on. Where after wearing them, they see their friends as putties. Well, wow, it's crazy. They jump the two out Sorry. and they try to attack <laughs> the putties. Now, nothing's wrong with their hearing, so it is a bit silly that they hear Tommy and Kimberly's voices. Baru, hello, Besitos. However, you can also view it as a form of PTSD, Ooh. where whenever the Rangers see putties, it triggers like a fight or flight, since they're always appearing out of nowhere. I was going to say, yeah, Walter looks pretty, uh... by Lord Oof. It's simple, but clearly effective. We then probably get one oh, of the big agree, best Michaela. Unmorphed fights in Power Rangers history, just in terms of choreography yes. and how oh, everyone so gets good. It's oh, so good. It's so good. Clean kick. The Rangers oh my gosh. Morph, though, Billy and Zack won't see the putties. So oh, perfect. They all morph, take out the monster that was also there. Yeah, that was a monster. Destroy it and reverse yeah. the Kind of. Happy ending for everyone. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> all, we still haven't found out the Rangers' identities. Bloom of Doom. All the Rangers are Bloom starting after Doom. school clubs, Bloom and Kimberly's Doom. flower Bloom. club doesn't have any sign-ups, which makes her sad. Even Bone oh. Skull's bullying almost bring her to tears. Oh. Now, I feel like oh. we've been here before. Lord Zed so far has had some pretty intense and evil plans. Oh. Is he really just going to make a flower monster to inconvenience Kimberly and no one else? Well, no, actually. Oh. He puts a spell on her flowers that turns Kim into a jealous biatch against <laughs> Trini. Oh. Yeah, the rift true. Between her and the Rangers. Yeah. It's interesting because Kimberly I love just this. isn't being evil to everyone. Zordon calls her, and she puts on this extra cutesy and obviously <laughs> fake tone to make it happen. Look at that Even smile! Oh my god! Time, like, I love it! I, wait, we gotta play that back. Flower, Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Saying it's morphin time, like... Morphin time. <laughs> <laughs> it's morphin time. It's morphin time. Oh my god, I so love it so much. Oh my I gosh. love it. It's so good. Then fight the evil flower oh monster gosh. to try and break Kimberly's curse. There's also more mention of Tommy's powers getting weaker and weaker. Oh no. Something I never really oh noticed no. until His now. His free trial is, is ending. More footage with the Rangers with their helmets off. <laughs> yes. Really yeah, well, it's because it almost American up. and Japanese <laughs> footage blend more cleanly together. Yeah, it helps the a lot. Green dream. Tommy mentions that he's been having nightmares about the losing monster that is symbolic in a. Wait, what? Michaela, what? No. Huh? huh? Hold on. What? Hold huh? On. I, I got this. What? I got this. Huh? Well, that flower monster? Where's that flower monster? Michaela. What, 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 what about that? Mik what, what, it? what about that? Mika what? What? Mika what? What about that? What? Anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> he mentions that he's been having nightmares about losing his powers. Lord That's Zed crazy. Hatches a plan to who would think again, that? Mind controlled the That's... Green Ranger into summoning Don't the Sword the of Orc Power. Oh my God! This is himself. this is like Kingdom Hearts with Riku all over again. All right, listen. <laughs> Something that was just made up for this. <laughs> <sighs> All right, Zeus, you're learning too fast. I'm gonna need you to calm down. Yeah, okay. No, seriously, so I'm just, I'm just, I'm just I saying. am so impressed with how fast Zeus is catching on. I, I need you to calm down, Zeus. Okay. You just gotta, <laughs> you, you you gotta, you gotta calm down and just you gotta roll with the ranger punches. Okay. I I, I know, but like I I get the fact that like I I just feel bad for Tommy with being like the punching bag of like <laughs> you're always gonna be controlled for some wow. reason. For Whoa! Lines. You yeah. know what? It's great that you picked that up because don't forget that. Don't forget that. Okay. Don't ever forget Very that. Important. Very important for the okay. next decade. Oh my god! Not exaggerating. Yeah. No. Oh my. Yeah, remember that for the next okay. decade. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I will. Seriously, oh under Zed's spell, Tommy says, Hey, Zordon, how about we summon the Sword of Power to recharge my own power? And Zordon's like, yeah, that's a good idea. Did he not, did he not question of like, wait, how, would, how, how would you think that? Why would you know that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, why would you know that? Yeah, out of, out of it, nowhere. It is literally an item that has never once been mentioned before. Yeah. And I was like, where did you hear that? Just, <laughs> yeah, Jordan's just like, oh, wow, yeah, that's a great idea. Oh, yeah, how yeah, you know? Yeah, that was a great idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. didn't question why. Nope. <laughs> Tommy steals the sword of power and Zed creates a robo goat. 
Okay. Huh? Tommy tries to it's find himself, goat. but is ultimately yes. beaten. Sure. Having such the little goat fighting the goat. Even move. Quite literally. Wow. Damn, the he got bodied. Up, they try to fight the goat, but he traps them underground. Oh no. Leaving Jason to be the one to save his friends. <laughs> The plot lines feel more mature, and we get a lot more fight scenes to tell the stories. Yeah! It's nice not having episodes anymore really focus on the power of sharing or studying or Grenade. whatever. <laughs> Zed is that a is really true. Threat, and we don't have time to play. Oh, yeah. So this. instead of a magic wand being thrown, Zed grows his monsters by throwing grenades at them. That is, oh, yeah. That's a grenade. Huh? A genuine grenade. Yeah. He pulls the huh? top off and then throws it at it. So the grenade, I'm assuming, has some sort of magical properties once it explodes and it makes the monsters why grow. A, why a grenade? Uh, because it matches Die Ranger, because that's how they grew the monsters in Die Ranger. Also, oh. it's dead. He's just that guy. He's also, yeah, he's, okay. he okay, is okay, that sure. guy. He okay. is him. Why okay. does he only have, like, a banana hammock made of metal for his clothes? Yeah. Don't ask questions. My man's him. He is him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He is him. He is him. He, he's him. They will be him. Whatever. Yep. Zed is a real threat, and we don't have time to play around. Even when the Rangers defeat the monster and return the Sword of Power to its rightful place, the episode ends on a sad note. Yeah. With the dreams Tommy was having of losing his powers actually being a sign. Lord Zed has been specifically yeah, the powers are targeting draining. Tommy to drain as much of his power as possible. And he's getting closer and closer to achieving that goal. Which is oh no, power oh, no. It, it is oh, no. his green power ranger. His subscription <laughs> oh, no. is running out. Oh no! <laughs> it it is a it is a fun thing though that I, I will say is is a strong point of season two. Yes. Um, that mm. carried over from season one in that hey Tommy's powers aren't here forever it's and they really are nice running out. Plot. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And it's it's nice because that. We, we basically learn from this episode that even though some of Zed's monsters aren't great and some of his plots and schemes aren't the most amazing, what they do mm -hmm. always go back to is that Tommy has to get involved and he has yeah. to fight mm -hmm. and he has every single time, which drains more of his power. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So also we finally get Zack's new hair, which I think looks amazing. Uh oh, Lord Zed sends down an Octorok. To specifically Let's capture the about it. Ranger don't worry about it. Powers don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah. The plot for this yeah. episode okay, also has okay. Baldi Skull wanting to kill the Rangers and find their identities. <laughs> Running on a limited battery sounds like a fun hero concept. I battle, know. Yeah. Do more in front There's of a character the like that in Dino. <laughs> 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 Actually, symbolic of the planet dying because Zed is sucking power from the Green Ranger. Mm. Michaela, I swear to God, I'm gonna suplex you. All right. Look oh out. my God. <laughs> Look out. You can't say. You can't say so. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm gonna scream geometrically. That's so. Funny. It's another save, Tommy, so he doesn't A lose. Two ten. I want to see you try. Which is. I've been hitting the, I've been hitting the gym. Wow. Once once I can finally unbend my arms again because I pulled muscles in my arms, I will huh? definitely take you. Don't worry. Roy how how, did, you, how did you do that? <laughs> Michaela, don't say that. Why do you know the exact pounds? <laughs> oh well, my I God. actually, you know what? It's your body. What what do I know? <laughs> that's true. That yeah, is I'm, true. Listen, the only the only tit weight I'm trying to find out is Kane's. All right. <laughs> listen. Oh my God. Uh, anyway, <clears throat> make that a new sub goal. Mm. What to suplex Michaela? Ayo. Pardon? I mean, huh? There you go. There you go. Mm. Huh? No, true. See. True. True. Mm. Huh. true. Mm. Honestly, really mm. nice mm -hmm. to see Mighty Morphin now. True. Long running episodic plot lines. After the Rangers oh, defeat Mighty small, Morphin. Oh, small thing. Long running episodic. Do you mm. see how bright and vibrant Billy is here? Yeah. yeah. And how gray and washed it out is, yeah they're doing that in purpose because obviously like his power is being he's drained. losing his powers yeah, yeah. His subscription no no I'm the subscription so he's picking this up true the the subscription. So michaela i would never suplex you unless you know how about 50k on the new like, video uh how do i call it in, <laughs> in any shows i mean it's out. i want to see that <laughs> so bad. all right so in, guys, no. in my defense, Michaela, the new villain video is it's about four times more successful than the last time I talked to you about it. It's at 1.4K okay. views. Yeah. Which is good. Um, Let's eight, get even higher. 8.4% impressions. Higher, yes. And yeah, yeah, yeah. seven minute average view duration, which is half of the video, which is insane. Mm -hmm. um, 
Yeah, and I don't even think it's hit the 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 big like VA algo yet. So you never know; it could happen. The previous ones at, at yeah. the previous ones at thirty k. So you know what could happen? Could happen. <laughs> could happen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Chaotic plot lines. Mm, mm, mm. After the Rangers defeat the monster, Bulk and Skull show up to the juice bar to play oh, the no. video for everyone. Where the Rangers then trick Bulk and Skull and swap out the tape for some cartoon. Hey, or Zach's something, new hair. Which I don't know who I'm more <laughs> upset at here. The Rangers for being negligent and morphing in public without looking yeah. at the Yeah. Or Bulk and yeah. Skull for I'm not a high five. The tape themselves yeah. beforehand. Everyone makes me upset <laughs> in this situation. They don't. I don't know why. I, actually, that kind of bugged with... me with the entire like series going on. Like they just morphed in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Where anyone can have a camera, <laughs> where anyone can just walk and hike anywhere, and they just like, oh, let's go transform. What? Yeah. <laughs> don't worry. About it. They can't. And can't they go to a bush behind the rock inside, inside the bathroom? Rule. Yeah, no, they, they take Zordon's first rule very seriously. <laughs> yeah, I, I can see that. I oh can see gosh. that. Oh my gosh, very, very mm -hmm, true. Mm -hmm. Also, Michaela, you are 100% true. Bulk and Skull do deserve love. Yes, they do. And we, luckily, Kane and I have already gotten to that point because we're we're big Power Ranger heads. So we, mm -hmm. we did the review of the, 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 the In Space one where they, you know, they, they, they get to be amazing. Um, Fantastic. But everyone will need to see that at some point. Yes, absolutely. Eventually. Someone in my chat said at least Ben 10 tried to hide his transformation. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And he's that 10. Kind of true. He's 10 years old. And, he's 10. and no one was telling him shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. They got yeah. beat by a 10 year old. Imagine oh that. <laughs> Having to hide their secret identity. <laughs> Can you oh imagine if it was three 10 year olds? <laughs> Oh my god! That's so Beetleborgs! Wild. That's Hit crazy! <laughs> Beetleborgs, I'm sorry. Ernie needs a team for. Yeah, unfortunately, oh, we don't get to talk about it. He didn't, he didn't talk just, about it. It was just a joke. Anyway, they were all the kids. Yeah. <laughs> well, what is this? Why not just make them play real hockey? Whatever. It's the B plot. We also yeah. been introduced to another side character. Richie! Richie! He's just there to be Trini's love interest. Richie! Look at I mean, that chin, though, damn. I, listen, mm. he is a very attractive man. But writing that mm -hmm. down. goes anywhere, much. and you'll see why in the future. Yeah. Lord Zed sends down another monster, and once again, uses it to drain the Green Ranger's powers. I mean, hey, the oh my God. what can I True. say? It's True. colors. Power of yeah, the colors. And, you know, yeah. the big gun they have. <laughs> yeah. The power of friendship and the big gun they have. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Oh, take care, Michaela. Have a good night. And I would definitely be the Pink Ranger, but if I can't be the Pink Ranger, I'd be the Black Ranger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which he has been. I have been. I think oh. I was right. I did cosplay him. Kane, I know you would be blue. Mm -hmm. What about you, Zeus? Or what would white. you be? I'd be blue Probably or white. Probably either yellow or white. Okay. Okay. We've got mm -hmm. some color varieties here. Good to know. Yeah. Good to know. I think Poseidon said she would be blue. So mm -mm. we've got, we can have Kane the White Ranger. I'll be pink. Uh, Zeus can, can be, be gold. You could be gold. You could mm. be gold. And then we can have Poseidon as blue. Yeah. There we go. We're forming our so team. Future Power Ranger seasons, like having one separate color and then having like additional random colors attached to them. So like there's a white ranger that has like this navy blue attached to like the suit, but he's still a white ranger. Yeah. And then there's another gold ranger, two of them actually, that have mm -hmm. a lot of like blue accents on them. So yep. mm -hmm. not unreasonable. Absolutely. I, I always thought that like the White Ranger, the Gold Ranger, I thought they were always like special rangers that just appear every now and again. Because I there that, are that's some what of I saw well, from Samurai. There are some of those. <laughs> that's what I saw. Yeah. yeah. Mm -mm. We'll get there. Are they all are they always supposed to be that special? Because like different color varieties we'll get there. appear later yeah. on the show. We'll get okay. there. Uh, <laughs> specific, specifically in Power Ranger Samurai, he just shows up a little bit later, but then becomes a main part of the team. Yeah. Mm, um, okay. Oh, I yeah. honestly I feel like they should bench Tommy at this point. He's, he's losing his <laughs> subscription, man. <laughs> wow, it's so wild. I feel like, oh no, man. there's no way that they would do that. There's no way that could happen. Yeah. There's, there's no, no way. way there's no way that they would do that, right? Oh, no. Again, the poor. <laughs> <laughs> no, they have to play floor <laughs> hockey, okay? Or broom uh -huh. hockey. Venus Island. All right. I love yeah. this episode. I love this funny. episode. Bulk and Skull dress up as putties to try and lure Yeah. Oh, so I, I forgot to say, but like their casual outfits always represent their actual colors. Yeah. Oh, you're just and now noticing that? No, no, I no, I forgot to say it because I er, I noticed I noticed when we got to around I think like ten minutes and I was like, why are they always wearing the same colors yeah. every single? Is that is wow. that their entire closet? 
Yeah. For their uh, Power Ranger colors. Yes. So that's actually referenced in a future Power Ranger season by a character okay. that I will not name. But okay. uh, they were a mentor to the Rangers yep. and then become mm. a Power Ranger. And then mm. uh, says after the morph is like, oh, you know what? I got to go shopping. I actually have a lack of black in my uh, uh, closet. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. So they are aware of it. Yeah. And it is yeah. it has now become like kind of a joke. But, yes, it does continue. Okay. I, 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 I'm just saying, yeah. like, please have different color drips other than pink, black, <laughs> blue. I like. There's other color combinations that it, would match your entire, you know. At least with thing. black, it's kind of like you get to kind of play around with it. Like, yeah. true. Yeah. Air mm. mock the putties. So he sends down Goldar to steal Trini's cousin or whoever this is and abducts her to Venus. Is this? Is this the point that Toy Trang had broken her leg as well? I believe so. Okay. Oh, no, it's a little bit later. No, no, at, I think that's it. So at some point during filming, Toy Trang broke her leg. And on. remember, they don't get, they don't get uh, healthcare or anything like that. Yeah. Oh, my. And, I'm, and when I say broke her leg, I mean, like, broke, broke her leg. Like uh, a fracture? Yeah, like, it was a break. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. So. And I believe it happened on set. It did. Oh nope. no! And but because she, it's not a union show, nothing could do me happen. And she had to keep right. filming. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Silent. Don't, don't tell you me she still had to do stunts, right? Uh, uh, to some degree. Uh, so why did you laugh? Island, yeah, to, again, to some degree. Anywhere in California, <laughs> except now they got Venus flytraps oh, all around. Fuck? Everywhere. So checks out. They need to fight a Venus flytrap monster, which is actually kind of creepy it's in its very design. Creepy. Even yeah. managing to capture the rest of the Rangers, minus Tommy and Trini. Wow, well, we've never had a bad episode. Man Center, where Tommy gets told once again that his powers are failing. I'm sure he's Luckily, fine. He doesn't need to do that though. Without I am, I am very sad though that we don't get a, a Yellow Ranger with Dragon Shield. I am very sad. Yeah. I'm very mm. sad about that. Alpha finding its weak spot, which turns out to be heat. Okay, well the power okay. blaster's got some heat behind it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Yep, well, that's heat. That's heat. Yep. Yep. That works. Been yep. The Tommy Oliver show. <laughs> oh my god. Really building the bond the other Rangers have with Tommy and not wanting him to lose his powers. The song of Guitardo. That sounds like uh -huh. a slur. Kimberly's trying to. <sighs> okay. So <laughs> here it is. I have okay. to. I have to mention that. Well, that, he'll mention this. The different story. So that is that is a musical phrase, and there's another one that's called uh, retardo. And that oh, no. that is a musical phrase, and I, this is such a fucking stupid story. But I I love saying it because I I, I like dunking on them sometimes when they do stupid stuff like this. Mm -hmm. IGN had an article that came out about Persona Five that was right. like, man, this lyric is so inappropriate in Persona Five, and it's the singer says like they're they're singing the song and they say retardo because they're they're talking about singing and playing music. Right, and they say that, and they're like, "This is kind of inappropriate and offensive," and they got destroyed. Uh, like the <laughs> person that wrote the IGN article, they're like, "Are you oh stupid?" Oh my god! They're like, "Are you stupid?" Like, do you it's even a know musical term? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my god! No, because some musical terms are kind of like either from Latin or something else so some are from europe yeah. so like some words can just mean what you think they mean yeah some aren't and it's just weird that way I don't yeah know. yeah good times mm -hmm. good times good times and, oh yeah. no this is the episode with the sad clip okay, this is I'll sad explain in a second this is sad thing. Yeah. So okay. this is his first rita level plan by turning kimberly's guitar into a monster yep it's a oh pretty my standard God. episode the ranger's mm. gonna fight the monster and tommy can't maintain his powers in battle but despite everyone telling him not to help and reserve his powers, he shows up anyway. Yep. The episode ends with Tommy still reflecting on the fact he knows his powers don't have much time left. So to cheer him up, Kimberly sings her new song. It's called Down the Road, and it was used in the tribute montage in the new Power Rangers Once and Always Netflix special. I don't know, man. It really gets the tears going all these years Aww. later. Yeah. Yeah. So at the very end of Once and Always, um, after everything is said and done, um, I don't know. Yeah, I'll say it anyway. So the Once and Always covers what happened to uh, Tui Trang, Trini. Because she dies in real life, they had to come up with a reason IRL why she's no longer around. Mm. And this is covering the the journey of her daughter, who now has the mantle of the Yellow Ranger. Um, yeah. So 
at this point, uh, during filming, I believe, um, this is when Jason David Frank had actually uh, died. And so it was an awful day on set, apparently. Well, uh, obviously, you know, um, a good friend just passes away. And, you know, now they had to throw a tribute for these two in the same episode. Um, and this clip was used for that. And it, I, I gotta tell you, I... I got really emotional when I when yeah. I heard the song start because I immediately recognized mm. where it was from and then this came on and I was like, I yeah. I need a minute. I, I, need, I, need, I need some time. <laughs> I'm gonna head out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> literally me. <laughs> uh, anyway. The lyrics just hit differently. I totally recommend looking it up and having a good feel trip. But dang, man. Is it, is it it's copyrighted? A anxiety. I don't think so. Uh, I can't imagine it is. I could try and find it if you want me to. What is it, Down the Road, right? Down the road, Down Power the road, Rangers. Yep. There we go. Down the road, we never know what life may have in store. Winds of change will rearrange our lives more. Oh, yeah. It's a... And that's that's how the episode ends. I also, as I was listening, I couldn't help but notice <sighs> Amy Joe's singing voice is very close to yours, Zeus. <laughs> is it? Yeah, I I kind of feel like it is. <laughs> there you go. There's your next I, cover, I Zeus. My... Zeus, cover. <laughs> let's go. There you go. There's your next cover. Thanks, guys. Thank you for giving me material for our next cover. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, no I got you. Easy Thank peasy. You. Let's go. <laughs> every episode, Tommy keeps being told he's going to lose his powers. When will this green be no more? Next episode is green no more part. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wow. Oh. Tommy and Kimberly get you, a message I mean, you asked, they delivered. The future, saying the words battle and communicator. Meanwhile, back at school, we meet Zach's cousin. He's literally just Zach. I'll explain my That's theories crazy. on to why he was even introduced later. Zeus sings? I mean, <clears throat> you know, if you check out twitter.com slash uh, uh, Zeus Mythos VT. Zeus Mythos VT, yeah. Yeah, you might, you might find a couple things. You uh, might find, yeah, them. a lot of really good clips of Zeus singing. Yeah, or, no, or no, if you come I to know. any of the Mario Kart streams that we do, where we get a little bit tipsy, uh, oh, yeah. you, you'll probably hear Zeus and I break out into random songs and then Zeus take off because she is amazing. <laughs> or if you just tune into one of Zeus's uh, streams where she just sings, you know, very wonderful, I mean, wonderful I can, I, can, I can give them a sample if they would yeah. like. Hit, hit us. Yeah, hit us. <clears throat> hit us with the goods. Hit us with okay. the goods. All right. Uh, I'll just okay. do everything goes on. Don't try to make yourself remember, darling. Don't look for me. I'm just a story you've been told. So let's pretend a little longer. Because when we're gone, everything goes on. There we go. Hey! Oh my God. hey. Clap, 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 Hey. Hey. Let's go. Well, now let's let's follow that up with some goofiness, shall we? Yes. Now, yes. Though, we do meet some more new characters. The school's new, new group of bullies, which are just the oh Rangers, my God. but evil. <laughs> Surprise. Them them turn them new into Rangers, but evil. evil Times Rangers. two. <laughs> Surprise. I to see them, I said sarcastically. To buy himself some time, though, Zed sends down a monster to fight the Rangers. He's a pretty tough monster, with the Rangers not even being able to defeat it. Even mm. being able to teleport Tommy to the dark cornfield dimension for a one-on-one. <laughs> dark cornfield dimension! Listen, wow, corn... I see nothing but cornfields there. It's corn! Mm. And it's a cornfield! It's, it's got the juice! It's got the juice! Wow. It's got the <laughs> anyway. One fight. Zed, though, manages to capture the Rangers and introduces them to his super strong and evil... What is... I what can't the stand fuck it. are those? <laughs> I can't stand those. I love Power Rangers so much. 
so it upsets me that I don't this I I, I don't like these. So remember <laughs> when we talked about Haim Saban really not liking spending money? Oh no. Uh, okay, so it gets worse. I'm gonna wait for the close up. So you you see how terrible these are. I, I can tell already. Are you seeing this? Oh my god. So we got the close up too. You you can kind of see how terrible the face is. The eyes don't match. The mouth is uneven. They don't uh, they're not uniform. Wait, so it gets worse, uh, right, Aim? They were so cheap. Lord Zed's staff is so big and weighty. It actually broke. If you look right here, you see this discoloration? Oh, what yeah. Think, what do you think that is? What do you think that, do you is, think Zeus? that is? Don't tell me that's just tape. Whoa, that's... Why would you assume that that's duct tape? That's... What? Don't tell what? <laughs> no way. Oh, no, man. no, Zeus. Why would that be duct tape? Oh, my God. I'm, 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 losing, I'm losing faith in, like, production teams, man. So, th things like this, unfortunately, is why this season gets a lot of bad rap. Um, where yeah. where season one gets a, a big pass because it's the first season they did ever and we're experimenting with a lot of things. Season yeah. two is shown to be very cheap and very like, we're just going to do it this way because we, you know, yeah. whatever. And things like this, like this scene and the duct tape staff, season two is the worst season of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Oh yep. my God. Yeah. I, I just want to say that like back, back in like, I think a high school and like 12th grade, we we did like a we did like a from the scratch a Les Miserables like play from start to finish, and for mm. some reason we mm. still had better costumes just by having the lowest budget. Oh, absolutely, a hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. These look <laughs> terrifying. These yeah, look, these look like a fire paralysis They're demon. So like if you woke up in the middle of the night and this was at the foot of your bed. I I would I I would just I would just die. Yeah, yeah. absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. Oh my god! Tell me you see this? These are Zed's ah! evil rangers. Yeah, ah! this is the most jank bootleg costume job I've ever seen. <laughs> you can literally see how ah! messily they cut the eyes and mouth portions on the face. Oh, you literally could have just bought a Halloween <sighs> costume and customized that as opposed that is to true. True. Yeah. a onesie. Anyway, with that dramatic reveal, we move on to part two. Part two. Tommy's part now two. unmorphed. In the last episode, they also said that he had one last morph in him, so I guess that's it for his powers. The Rangers manage to teleport out of Zed's trap, but can't locate Tommy. Goldar also, Billy Tank to Top, let's go. Finish him off and toys with Tommy, yeah. throwing him around and mocking him for his once glorious Green Ranger powers. Meanwhile, the big clam monster starts attacking Angel Grove. <sighs> But the other rangers have also lost their powers. Oh, wait, I want to go back. Monster starts attacking Angel Grove. But look how big his arms are, man. Look at you. Yeah. They're so huge. I'm he finally gets to wear a tank is... top. I'm, I'm not kidding. Yep. <laughs> yeah, that is a, that's thick right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The other mm -hmm. rangers have also lost their powers, being sucked away and transferred into the evil onesie rangers. <laughs> After enough of Goldar's taunting, though, the Tommy then gets a second wind and absolutely. I'm not gonna play it because I, when I did play this clip, I did get in trouble for it for for copyright. Oh. So you see, oh. after enough see of Goldar's taunting, though, Tommy this where he punches him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So Goldar is is taunting him in this entire scene and everything like that, and right. he's mm -hmm. like, "Go ahead and tell me that I'm your better." Goldar is saying that to Tommy. So Tommy, okay. Tommy's like on the ground. He's like feeling sorry for himself. He's like, "Goldar, you are." you are and then it zooms in on his face and he goes out of your mind and he jumps up <laughs> into the air and the green okay. ranger theme plays and it's super hype and then he lands and he does this yeah. punch okay it is really bad looking <laughs> okay because okay. he's he's sitting on the ground gets up jumps into the air lands when he was already point blank yeah and then just punches him Okay. Yeah. I hear a kitty somewhere. Contraband. Oh, no, I'll take her. Contraband. <laughs> <sighs> oh, it's okay. I can't believe as long as, as long as they're meowing, they're okay. They're very vocal about it. Mm. Yeah, I, know. I can't believe Come Contraband here. is going crazy. <laughs> Come here. We love Contraband. I guess here. they just want cuddles. Either maybe. Come in or not. Okay. <laughs> Get in here or leave. 
Me to my dogs. You guys want to go into my room or not? Yeah. And you should. Uh, hey, everyone's excited to hear about contraband. Oh, I Yay! I got a room. Sayu. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hi, Sayu. Hi, Sayu. 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 Hello. Hi. Hello. Oh are my you? gosh. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Guys, could you please uh, shout out Zayu right now? Hello. Hey. Happy seven hello, days. Hello. Thank you. We're currently learning Power Rangers with Roy and Kane. Yes. And they're telling me to. To not watch this because of these are copyright reasons. Oh no no! I'm know. I'm not playing the full scene. We're not playing oh, the full okay. scene. The full, this uh, everything in this video is completely fine. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah yeah yeah. If anyone yeah, coming so in the from uh, yeah, if anyone coming in from the raid has any questions about Power Rangers or just wants to walk down memory lane, yeah, please mm. feel free to let us know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. I feel like Why have I not followed our... Sayu? What the heck? Oh my goodness! <laughs> heck yeah. That's crazy. Uh, I oh, like yeah, Power Roy Rangers, yeah. Are, uh, Power Ranger experts. So yes. if anyone has mm -hmm. any questions, we are more than happy to ask. Uh, My bottle. Well, we love Power Rangers, yeah. Absolutely. They're We're telling me about the Japanese one as well, mm -hmm. with, with the footage and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Not everything from Japan. And so. we are in the middle of season two. Yes. Mm -hmm, so. Mm -hmm. We're we're just but, before yeah. some some pretty cool moments. So have fun. Yeah, thank you. You can rest up as well if you need to rest up. Everyone as well yep. who needs to rest up, please do. All right, back to yeah. action. Tommy then gets a second wind and absolutely Super wolf are unmorphed. Both Tommy and Jason have attempted this in the past. Heck yeah! Here, it's a straight on Go domination. Yeah! Hey yo, he built different. <laughs> he then sneaks into Zed's hideout and smashes the crystal that was harnessing the Rangers' the powers. Rangers. Got him. Turning them yeah, back yeah, yeah. into the bullies. <laughs> so yeah, we never even get to see the evil onesie Rangers in action. I'm truly heartbroken. <laughs> they were so they were so <laughs> low on budget. They couldn't even like put them in action. Damn. For so long, Tommy Got him. says that he has one last fight in him. So one for the last, last time. It's morphin time. The Rangers morph and summon their Zords. Morphin time. Yeah. yeah. There you go. <laughs> now you're <laughs> feeling it. Blast at it. Whatever. I don't care. Let him have his moment. They defeat the monster. Befriend the bullies because why not? Green always and builds different. That is true. Time, yeah. The green. It is Ranger everyone's favorite. Is it's so funny. So, not. Mm. so they befriend the bullies, which okay. you might notice as like a theme for Power Rangers is they become yeah. friends with the problems. Yeah. Okay. Yes. This does not work forever, and in okay. Turbo specifically, mm. there's a really mm. really funny clip mm. of like it of people thinking it's going in that direction, then it does it at it. <laughs> when we get there. When we yes. got there, okay, I, okay. I will we is laughing about it. So Okay, it's fine. I'll trust you guys on this ride. You guys are driving. <laughs> Tommy fought his we gotta final love it. battle as the Green Ranger. Oh no, Tommy's and dead. It's pretty bittersweet, honestly. Oh no. After oh, spending uh, the entire season oh, feeling no. sorry for himself, oh, no. and he's oh, not no. as strong oh, no. as he once was, he learned the power of the strength within, or whatever. Whatever. Realizing yeah. that it wasn't the power that made the man. But the man that made the power. Wow. The pretty Aww. sad, but overall satisfying story arc for the Green Ranger. Yeah. They all say their yeah. goodbyes, but like, yes. yeah, he ain't going anywhere. You'll he's, see him in math class on Monday. He's still in school. Yeah. He's just there. Or, yeah. will, they? <laughs> or will they? Or Ms. will they? Green, Jason's training for another martial arts tournament, but is mm. having trouble focusing because he misses Tommy. Even referencing Aww. the guilt he still feels about not being able to retrieve the green candle all the way. Which I love personally. I love them mm. like having callbacks and Jason being like, "Well, Tommy wouldn't be gone like if I got the green candle." And like, yeah, yeah man, why didn't you just solo Goldar? Easy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Like Back still. in season one, yeah. saying that if he were successful in doing that, Tommy would still have his powers today. Zed overhears this yeah, and get gets comfy, a brilliant everybody. idea. Yeah, yeah. He's all Power Rangers. For all the Rangers. Sure, I guess anyone oh, can just do that. <laughs> yeah, just make a <laughs> colored <laughs> captured and it's up to <laughs> colored candles. Jason alone to Easy. rescue them. This is a really good episode, focusing on the guilt Jason has been carrying all this time. Now, mm. once now he again has to a, re a redemption arc. That's yeah. Burdening him for who knows how it's long. Time to go back. Zordon tells him that he's been an amazing leader, and being the leader means you'll be tasked with difficult decisions and actions to make. Wow, that's crazy. So, also that face. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's like a muscle. I'm sorry. It really does look a muscle head with that. It looks 
like he's trying to sell me like like a protein shake right now. Oh my god. <laughs> so I, tell tell me that's not what I'm seeing right now. It absolutely <laughs> is. Just as uh, a real quick shot, memory yes, thing. Remember yeah. that Zordon mm -hmm. just complimented him on how amazing of a leader he's been. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Great. Up and morphs on out, defeating the monster one on one and teleporting to Zed's dark dimension to fight Goldar and stop those candles from melting. This is also where a keen ear will notice the voiceover uh -oh. for Jason uh -oh. is not Austin St. John. Uh oh. Wait, what? Oh, guys. Quick, give me your power coins. That's someone doing an impression. Why is Austin St. John not voicing his own character? Hmm. Again, we'll talk about it soon. I promise all of these Interesting. things are connected and I'll That's talk so about wild. it in a second. That's wild. These will be relevant later. <laughs> and saves the also, you might you might notice a little bit and I'm going to talk about it in I'm going to pause it again. Yeah, of course. Mm. The next got better. They did. Yeah, it, they did. So, this There's is no about thick. This is about the point in the show where the quality of the suits improved too, because like you can see how much more form factor it is. You can see how much like mm -hmm. more cleaner they everything is. Like mm -hmm. Overly sized. Yep. Yeah. So this They're is slowly getting production. Ha however, <laughs> however, for reasons I won't explain yet, th mm -hmm. this will probably revert and then go back to being good and then revert to being bad a couple times oh over the next couple of episodes. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. Just defeats Goldar mm -hmm. and saves the Rangers. Even getting a letter from Tommy, wishing his friends Aww. well, and that he never blamed Jason for Whoa. losing his power. He doesn't have any green anymore. That's so wild. That's that's crazy. Wow, that's so wild. They lost their color. <laughs> they lost their subscription forever. Damn. <laughs> Poor man. They lost their he green subscription. Have it anymore. Forever. Yeah, he lost a green subscription. <laughs> <laughs> that's insane. That, it, that green subscription will come back anyways listen, to a different ranger. <laughs> you, you know what they say? You have to wear the color of the ranger that you are. You know? Mm -hmm. that, yeah. Yeah. For first, uh, I, I, lo I love the fact that he changed his wardrobe after, after yeah. something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can finally wear other colors. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yep, that's the last cameo Jason David Frank will make in Power Rangers. Aww. Yep. Orchestral <laughs> maneuvers in the park. What kind of name is that? Zach's I, listen, that I don't know. Don't worry about it. Do. So Zed curses the trumpet and puts a spell on the rangers where they'll see old monsters from the past. What? And shout outs to whoever this is for doing a Bro, right? No, for real. Yep, the rangers are honestly so real. Until they find the trumpet monster, defeat it, and all is well that ends well. That's it. Mm. Beauty and the Beast. Zed is looking for a new queen. I love this episode Kimberly. so much. Oh my She's God. canonically a high schooler. Uh-oh. There's not oh, in this God. episode. Yeah, but he's a monster. <laughs> What's interesting though is that Zed's wedding outfit for Kimberly is Rita's costume. I love costume. this so much. <laughs> and Joe Johnson does an amazing impression yeah, of listen Rita's to this. screechy yelling voice. You're giving me oh my god, that's so good. She's I, such a good a actress. Headache. Yeah, you're giving me a headache is one of Rita's iconic lines. Yeah. Um, and so hearing it come out of Kim, wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> so good. White chat, I light, hate you. Part one. I hate you, chat. Zordon and Alpha speak. <laughs> wait, 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 what did chat they, say? What does Zeus chat say? They, no, they played a realistic knocking sound, and I actually turned. Oh, my God. <laughs> I actually turned. I was like, huh? Keep it up, come the pins. Keep it up. God damn it. Go, go, nothings, go. To work on a secret no. mission. Meanwhile, something crash lands on Earth, and oh, my goodness, it's Rita's space dumpster. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Which bulk yeah, she's been wait, missing. Wait, 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 wait. Analyze. She's been missing was this whole time. Was she floating in? Yeah, was she floating in space, trying to yeah. find a trajectory back to Earth? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because yeah. uh, Zed sent her into space when he got up. So. Yeah, but I'm just like, how did you find a way to get back there? With like, I, do, do you have do you have a do you have a car wheel in there? I think or? it was just random that she just landed Magic, again. Maybe. Yeah. The, the chances of her going there versus to any other planet. Listen. Wow. Yeah. Um, it's Power I Rangers. I guess it was meant to be, I guess. It's yeah. Power Rangers. Don't think that and, too hard into it. And landed okay. in the same town <laughs> that they were. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Know, right? <laughs> After another really intense unmorphed fight with the putties, God. seriously, Austin St. John wanted to show off those muscles. They try Absolutely. to contact the command center, but with no luck. So the gang go into the command center themselves to see that it's almost completely shut down, with Alpha Ooh, and Zordon nowhere in sight. Ooh. Meanwhile, Zed sends down a monster, and we get one of the most intense and passionate It's Morphin' Times from Jason ever. It's Morphin' Time! He's <sighs> <sighs> uh, uh, 
Uh, what? Huh? Huh? What? Uh, he just stares into your soul. <laughs> he, he really does. He just. <laughs> I said it's morphin' time. It's because he, he, he looks so disappointed in you. I'm sorry. It's because he doesn't like li listen to it again. To listen. Tense and passionate. It's morphin' times from Jason ever. It's morphin' time. He's looking deep into my soul, and I don't think he likes what he sees. <laughs> the Rangers <laughs> have a monster, Billy, who eventually decides to do more oh, investigating no. on the command center, where he stumbles upon a blinding white shot. room and sees that Alpha and Zordon are creating a brand new Power Ranger. Billy, of course, tells the rest of his team what he saw, and they're pretty hesitant at the idea of having a new Ranger. After all, it's so soon since they lost Tommy. You can't just rebound mm. like that. You're they just replaced ready. immediately. Well, yeah. <laughs> to the command center for a meeting where they all know what's going on, where we then get the heavenly reveal of the new White Ranger. Oh, Seriously, man. he's like Jesus coming down from the like sky. Jesus. But Jesus. who exactly is this White Ranger? Well, it's none other than Ryan Steele of VR Troopers. That's uh, that's a reference. <laughs> I wish I wish we could explain this to make it funny. Okay. Like So I'm waiting. Okay. So mm -hmm. you know how we, we mentioned Saban has a lot of other series going on as well? Yeah. So mm -hmm. one of the other series that he had as a spin-off with also Japanese footage mm -hmm. um was from a series called Metal Heroes. Mm -hmm. um, right, that's the umbrella. Kind yeah, of like the umbrella. Super Sentai. Yeah. Okay. Um and the, the so, Beetleborgs that we were talking about are also metal heroes. Yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So Saban was like, oh, I'm going to try and bring uh, another Metal Heroes franchise over. And I'm going to cast like a couple other people. And I'm going to treat it like it's Power Rangers. Um, mm -hmm. It did not do super well. It, it had like. It had its cult audience, but it was mm -hmm. not. Yeah. <laughs> They Enough. tried pushing it as much as they, they get. Like, I even had, like, mm -hmm. it was either McDonald's or Burger King, like, Happy Meals, like, at the oh. top. Yeah. Like, they were, they were really pushing to make this, like, another Power Rangers. Yeah. But it didn't quite work. So, VR Troopers, another weird history lesson. VR Troopers is made up of two different shows. Yep. So, there's three characters. Uh, Ryan Steele. Ryan Steele. I, and I don't remember the other two. I genuinely, I don't because their names just are not as memorable as Ryan Steele. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> um, but Ryan Steele, his Japanese counterpart comes from one show, and then the other two are partners in another show. Yep. So it's never, never in the history of the shows do you see the three of them ever on screen at the same time. Yep. Oh. It's really awkward. It's really weird. So they had to always come up with places where. The main character, Ryan Steele, was fighting something else. And then the other two would be fighting something else elsewhere. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, yeah. And so this was their attempt at recreating Power Rangers again. But instead of adapting one show, they were adapting two different shows. Yep. And okay. originally, this, this actor, Brian Hawkins, who uh, you might recognize now as the voice of Goblin Slayer in Goblin mm -hmm. Slayer, uh, he, again, Power he also Rangers. owns a restaurant in. Yeah. Oh damn! Yes, a very good restaurant. I've heard. Oh, uh, uh, well, I have to find out what that one is. I didn't know about that. <laughs> but hey, uh, so originally they had him cast as the White Ranger, and mm -hmm. uh, from my understanding, was they decided to change that. Uh, mm -hmm. we'll, we'll we'll play this out because I think he might actually explain it, but that mm. it, it it leads to the the joke. Actually yeah. true and was supposed to be the case. Yeah, but no, it's of course none other than Tommy Oliver. Of hey, course it would be Tommy, and with Yay! the control of Saba, the Tommy Sword, and his new White Tiger Zord, Zordon says that the White Ranger is. Oh, the maybe he doesn't explain it. Okay, so VR Troopers, the show that we just described, is actually hmm. why Jason David Frank left Power Rangers. Originally, mm -hmm. it was supposed to be called Cybertron, like the Transformers planet. Oh! Yeah. Um, but eventually they went with VR Troopers. But anyway, mm -hmm. Jason David Frank was originally supposed to be Ryan Steele, the protagonist of that show. Yep. But after mm -hmm. it underperformed and everyone was mad that they wanted Tommy back, yep. they traded back. 
Oh, okay. Yeah. So, um, essentially, uh, Brian Hawkins instead, or is it Brad Hawkins? I think it's, it's Brad, Brad Hawkins. Brad Hawkins, sorry. Uh, Brad yeah. Hawkins essentially swapped places with him. So he was going to be the White Ranger and instead swapped places to be the lead on VR Troopers. Um, mm -mm. And this is not the last time we will hear of Brad Hawkins. Okay. The new leader of the power. Which is kind of funny. Wait, excuse me? Huh? Also, yeah, let me let me replay that. Oh, that yeah, that's, a, that's another thing. <laughs> the new huh? leader what? of the power, huh? Rachel. Wait, excuse huh? me? The huh? new leader? Three episodes ago, you yep. were praising Jason for his courage. Now Tommy gets a new suit and he's the leader? Yep. Well, I'll explain everything at the end of the episode. <laughs> <laughs> they, 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 they literally just, they literally played they, up Jason to just throw him to the They brought the back wolves. the evil guy that beat up everyone, kept losing his powers, kept losing his communicator, kept not showing up for fights, but brought him back as the leader of the Power Rangers. Yep. Anyway. So... So yeah, as the new leader, Tommy gets to say it's what? Morphin time. We see his new Zord, and it's pretty cool, I All guess. The tiger Zord. They defeat the monster. I love it. Send Rita back into space. Oh, that one I've seen and before, Skull actually. Gets some the Tiger Zord. Their face. Yeah, yeah. that yeah. Tiger Zord. Yeah. Yeah. The episode. Mm -hmm. At least that's how it should be, because now I'm going to explain everything. Oh my okay. god! I just realized okay. now that he's a White Ranger, his entire closet. Yeah. Video. <laughs> and that's why in that scene I paused on, I was he was already wearing white. So now he has to throw out all of the green in his closet. Okay. Or bleach it. So <laughs> Oh my god. This, this is about to get complicated. So Okay. Th this is gonna be into like behind the scenes stuff that's not good. So so like bear bear with it. This is like dark, gritty history of Power Rangers. Okay. Because it is not okay. all sunshines and rainbows. Okay. So well, we're gonna get to that now. I'm putting on. Mm -hmm. Remember when I said Jason was dubbed by some random person? Well, it wasn't just him. Zack and Trini were also dubbed by not their actors. <laughs> Why though? Well, simply because Austin St. John, Walter Jones, and Tui Trang were leaving the show. You see, Power Rangers is a non-union show, which pretty go. much means there's no rules or regulations yeah. in terms of actor pay and treatment. Austin, Walter, and Tui pretty much wanted more money. They apparently only made $600 a week for sometimes 17 hour long day shoots. Mm -hmm. Which oh roughly translates to $31,000 yep. a year. For context, that's about what an average fast food worker makes today. So for actors who were basically unknown at the time getting yeah. their first major role in a kid's show, sure, I, that's pretty good. But after season one was a massive success, Power Rangers was a multi-million dollar franchise. The toys, yep. VHS tapes, video games, they were all selling like crazy. Mm -hmm. So it's only fair that the actors should get paid more. After all, they sold the toys. Yep. However, Haim Saban didn't think so. That's not how you make money. <laughs> no, that's crazy. Uh, Saban told them that they were all replaceable. That yes. It's the oh that my sell God. Toys. So, Essentially hold saying on. That the pause really quickly. Yeah. This is something that gets told to future generations of Power Rangers as well. Yeah. Um, this was a common thing, and you can find interviews of future Power Rangers saying they were constantly told they were constantly told that they are replaceable. Yep. So it is. Um, yeah. It, it is. Listen, Kane and I, we love Power Rangers, but like loving it also means acknowledging that it is a very flawed and complicated franchise yeah. so the problem here is that while this is awful this is genuinely so bad a lot of these irl circumstances created a lot of really cool lore inadvertently to cover up holes so yeah in in, in universe oh okay that's why this character leaves the yeah. show oh though no, that's why that power up exists something you know Mm -hmm. But the IRL reason for why it happens is awful. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. It, uh, and I see somebody because, asking uh, in yeah. chat, why would anybody work for them for decades then? Um, why would anybody keep a job for decades? Because yeah. you're getting paid money. Is it shitty? Yeah, but you need money. Um, on top yep. of the fact that Power Rangers has its name, like, value alone. Yeah. You know, for a lot of people, that's, that's huge. Especially yeah. in the 90s when Power Rangers was in its peak. Yep. So, yep. um, yeah, it's it's uh it's pretty bad, but it that, gets worse. 
sucks. So we're yeah. gonna we're gonna keep yeah. getting worse for a little bit. But, Wait, uh, I want to ask. Sure. If, yeah. And like, is it still non-union to the till yes. till this day? Oh my yes. God. Um. Well. Uh. I don't know. The last. So that yeah. The, the once and always and Cosmic Fury were the most mm. recent seasons to have aired. And as of since then, we have no idea if Power Rangers is continuing. But we know that they're still kind of continuing the toy line, which I don't know. Yeah. It's up in the air if it's still continuing, continuing. That said, okay. we don't know if the show is going. So it might still be non-union. We don't actually know. Yeah. Um, we we haven't heard of like what's happening next. Like Kane and I have kind of like jokingly been like, yeah, Power Rangers is on hiatus, even though it's only been like a couple of months, but like the couple of Every, months is usually like, yeah. we, we know what's supposed to be coming next by now. Every mm. time uh, Hasbro, who currently owns Power Rangers, yeah. it has been asked about it. They have said more or less along the lines of, we have no plans currently for Power Rangers or it's on the back burner for now. And never explicitly saying, yeah, it's on hold. Yeah. It's, uh, we have other plans, something. You yeah, know? we're and in the dark. Avoiding everything. Yeah. Um, but really quickly, for anyone that is confused about the production schedule of this and why they're voiceovers, so they film everything first and then they do the voiceover yep. later. I'm assuming by the time they got to the voiceover for Jason, hey, Jason thank you had so already much for the, the, uh, the sub. Mm. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I'm I'm pretty sure they've they've uh, they've confirmed that, which is uh, we'll, we'll get to some inconsistencies later, um, yes. which I was kind of telling you about before Zeus, but we'll we'll let uh, Connor explain more. Yes, actors okay. don't matter, and as long as the suit is on screen, kids will only care about that. So Austin, Walter, and Tui were no longer a part of the show. I'm not sure if they just walked out or if they were pretty much forced off the show immediately, but yeah. Saban didn't want to pay them more than minimum wage, which yep. is ridiculous when, again, uh, half of your show is already done. The expensive part with the explosions and special effects, you don't have to pay for all this. You have six core people that you need to keep happy and chose not to do it. It's yep. ridiculous. Yeah. That's yeah. also why Tommy was written as the new leader. Originally, Jason was still supposed to be the leader, with Tommy doing his occasional appearance, like when he was the Green Ranger. Speaking of which, yeah, Tommy wasn't even supposed to be the White Ranger. Okay, cool. He does talk about that this. That role was supposed to go to Brad Hawkins, who played Ryan in VR Troopers. Jason David Frank even filming for another Power Rangers Dad. show. Yeah. Cybertron. That's crazy. <laughs> they were literally just okay with writing off Jason David Frank and never bringing him back. However, VR, after VR. Green No More, Saban received millions of letters from fans asking to bring back Tommy. Yep. So, here we are. And with the exit of the red, black, and yellow rangers, it's clear whatever story arcs they wanted to tell had to be put on hold. And as we continue on with these yeah. episodes, you'll start to notice some obvious absences and terrible edits that I'll point out for you. Mm -hmm. The white ranger suit and Megazord is from Die Ranger, Kiba Ranger to be exact. Which is the same season that the, the Thunderzords are from. So like they were at least able to keep that. So they can no, have the, the visual cohesion of Kiba Ranger was just close enough to keep it in show with the rest of the other Mighty Morphin suits. Um, the biggest uh, thing that's different is the belt buckle. Yep. It's no longer the morpher. It, it's like a bunch of like squiggles. <laughs> oh, okay. I think they actually change it later. They change it in the toy. On the toy, it's for sure the morpher. But. In the show, I think it's still just the, the the swirlies. I thought by like season three they changed it, but I could be wrong. It might be just be like a Mandela effect. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> also, they He's said that they called it the Kiba Ranger, right? Yeah. Yeah. Is that a reference from Kiba, the like the movie? Oh, Kiba simply just means like Fang. Or, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. I thought so, it was a reference from a movie, but. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, no, Kiba mm -hmm. in Japanese is simply just fang. Yeah. So, I mean, mm -hmm. you can even see little tiny fangs on, like, the sword and then the tiger motifs and blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. Yep. You know. Yeah, because tiger. Your suit and Megazord mm -hmm. is from Die Ranger. Kiba Ranger, to be exact. Yep. He's literally a child. I guess the bond was pretty lucky. Yeah, Ko, so, Ko is a complicated character. And Ko is okay. very funny. Uh, upon, there's an episode that you can find on YouTube where uh, Ko... Uh, the Die Ranger uh, counterpart was abusing his powers to look up girls' sk skirts. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's a very interesting <laughs> thing. Um, yeah. But uh, 
So in a lot of sequences, when they do use the Japanese footage, mm-hmm. you can see Tommy jumping around, acting like a child, and that's because mm-hmm. of the original Japanese footage. Because it is a child. Oh goodness. Yeah. Oh god. It, it's oh, not like no. that forever, but there okay. are a couple shots of it where it's yeah. very jarring. So. Okay. Yeah. Lucky that the sixth Die Ranger looks so similar to the Zhu Rangers. Just one more little step to making the adaption for Die Ranger easier on the riders. Yep. Mm-hmm. But for now. Let's move on. We'll get Two back into one. bad stuff Tommy soon. Tommy and Kimberly are on a date. How adorable. Look how cute and sweet Aww. they are. I hope they never Aww. break up. Lord said that... <laughs> yeah, that would, <laughs> that would be oh, terrible man. if they ever broke up. Oh mm. my god, that's foreshadowing right there. Oh, no. That's crazy. I don't know what you're talking oh, about. No. Stupid oh no. He turns oh, Kimberly's no. purse and lipstick into monsters. Oh my god, lip sinker. literally just doing this to ruin their And the purse monster. No what? That is a weird looking... Here. Okay. Let me get some bitches that's and you'll be okay, Zed. It's kind of a slow episode, honestly. <laughs> some the first monster manages to freeze Kimberly and Tommy. Well, great. I'm really impressed with this new White Ranger. Yeah. He needs saving. Yeah. So Zach morphs out to help and literally immediately also gets frozen. We also get some love terrible it. Jason W. Yeah, Just listen why. to these two clips for comparison. All right, Lip Sinker. Time for the power of thunder. Let's show him the power of thunder. Tyrannosaurus Red Dragon Thunderzord power. Tyrannosaurus Red Dragon Anyways, Why don't they just treat- keep the original clip? Yeah, like, that, that, yeah. If they needed to, like, yeah. I never they understood have some that. Lines there. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, you can hear how how not him it is. Yep. Find a it's way to so freeze funny. everyone. Yeah. Tommy fights the first monster one on one and beats it. And once again, everyone lives happily ever after. <laughs> wow. Opposites attract. Billy creates a polarizer to learn about electromagnetic disturbances. I wish cool. they keep Jason. Okay. Well, I think that's the Meanwhile, problem. Kimberly's Money. Money. Yeah. <laughs> money. Money. They gotta survive, man. Money. <laughs> money. Yeah. yeah. You gotta survive. Yay. Hey, welcome in, Elroy. Yeah, we love Super Sentai here. Doing some mm, Girl mm, Scout mm. stuff with some friend who obviously has a crush on Billy. Hey, you player. What about that other girl we never heard from? Remember her? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, oh, that's crazy. <laughs> Fine. Anyway, Zed turns the wild. polarizer Wacky. into Magnet Head. Great name. And wow. they fight. <laughs> They do the Die they Ranger fight. thing. Yeah, they do the thing. Uh, they, hate so okay. This is the posing for Die Ranger, but it's a mm. cheeky tongue and like tongue and cheek thing because they never adapt it. Mm. It's really bad. Like I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna play the clip again so you can see how bad this looks. Anyway, Zed turns oh, the polarizer gosh. into Magnet Head. Great name, and they fight. Tommy wants to. <laughs> it's not even remotely close to what the Die Rangers do. It's like. That's the roll call. Um, yeah. Af- right after they morph, they do the the their Tingy roll call. Their co- it's yeah. a bus. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh! Uh, it's really bad. As someone that absolutely loves Die Ranger, uh, mm. that that scene is just a slap in the face because there's no reason they needed to do it, and they fucked it up. <laughs> yeah, that is yeah, yeah. I hated it, dude. Yeah. Uh, well. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Again, Tommy flying. To spotlight to fight Goldar mm-hmm. all by himself. And the girls <laughs> are like, ooh, look at the White Ranger. He's so cool. Please buy the toy. Yeah. I remember watching yeah. this episode a ton on VHS <laughs> when I was a kid. So I got a soft spot for it. They defeat Magnet Head and Billy once again gets another girl. I also remember girl. that. Also, you like this he, shot? He wins by doing nothing. <laughs> yep. Yeah, isn't this a really nice shot of everyone together? Yeah. Shot of everyone yeah. smiling? I hope so. Because this is the last episode to feature Jason, Zach, and Trini on screen. At least oh, in gosh. terms of new footage. You'll see what I mean by that. <laughs> yeah. Zed's Monster Mash. Oh, Billy, actually, Kimberly, like this and one. Tommy are chaperoning kids for trick-or-treating. Meanwhile, Jason, Zach, and Trini are busy, you know, doing whatever. Yeah. So to mm. trap the White Ranger, the buddies transform into kids. I love and this. even these costumes are better than Zed's <laughs> evil Rangers. <laughs> that, 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 you are, yeah, Tommy yeah. In. Also, look at this growth, right? So if this was Green Ranger Tommy, he loses. He loses yeah. this fight. Mm. Easy. But beats them up. I He's wish a they white ranger. Kid yeah. Could you imagine grown ass? Yeah. Oh my god, look child. at him. Those oh my kicks. god. Look at this. You Why couldn't you do that before? <laughs> to a child? You are not lost right now. Oh, man. Terry where he needs to fight off the monsters from their past, including Pumpkin Rapper. My favorite. Oh god. Yeah. Rangers I love Pumpkin Rapper. And they win the fight. Saving Halloween Reduce from footage. bad rhymes. Yeah. The Ninja Encounter Part 1. Okay. This is where things simultaneously get serious 
and awful at the same time. Yeah. So we get oh, this no. establishing shot of all the rangers at a picnic with footage from Trini that's clearly from another episode. And hmm, <laughs> what's what's weird about this shot, Zeus? I thought you threw out all the green in your. Uh... Yeah, the green. <laughs> also, like, yeah, yeah. Damn. Mommy's wearing yeah. green. Already, things are confusing. These three hmm. punks end up harassing a guy. That, and this is the reason why I think they should have they should have different color wardrobes so they can easily <laughs> just reuse the footage. Exactly. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> nobody tries why did, to why did they it? leave the child? And the only people he who bumped into it by accident is Bulk and Oh my Skull. gosh. Yeah. See, so they're the good people. They actively have tried to do something good oh for no reward. Oh my god. The baby ends up being saved by Tommy, Kimberly, and Billy, as well as these three mysterious teenagers, Rocky, Adam, and Aisha. They're visiting from Stone Canyon High School, and they're just such good kids who happen to wear red, black, and yellow, but I'm sure it's nothing. Oh my god. Also, where are they? <laughs> see Zach and Trini. You showed them at the picnic. How come they didn't try and Yeah, that, that's... Also no, funny, because yeah, Zach's they hair is said, not like, oh, dreads. hey, they, they choose yeah. to not be Power braids. Rangers anymore and decide to, like, actually live a life, you know? Yeah. <laughs> they were given that choice, like, the last the last season right, ago Zeus. or something. Yeah. There's, there's, one, there's, Whoa, a simple, there's a simple explanation <laughs> for that, Zeus. Uh-huh. The baby. Anyway, the three <laughs> Rangers show up to watch a ninja competition, and it goes on for way too long. But, hey, look at that. The winners are Rocky, Adam, and Aisha. Who could have seen That's that wild. coming? Uh, whoa! So he's impressed and wants to turn them into his minions. So they get abducted and get taken to his evil cave. Crazy. Along with this baby's dad from earlier, for some reason. What's important okay. to note here, though, is that Bulk and Skull witness this and once again decide to leap into action and take care of the baby. A fun Aww. fact is that apparently this baby was Jason David Frank's real-life son. Yep. We also mm -hmm. see oh. like Tommy's which wearing. which is confirmed now. We 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 looked it up at the we time. We do know that, yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. So, also, yeah, isn't it great that Tommy's wearing green again and Zach's hair is oh wrong? Oh God, man, yeah, this is totally man, not really wow, footage. it's so not obvious that this is a rehash of the old one, right? Whoa, Power Rangers <laughs> using their it, own right? footage? That's crazy. Yeah, that's that crazy. Would never happen. They wouldn't do man, that. that yeah. would, there's no way. Nah, nah, there is no way they would it's do that. Because Yvonne needed to reuse oh, command center footage that had Jason, Zack, and Trini in it. And since Tommy was the Green Ranger for most of his run so far, they had to blend that in. It's so sad seeing these characters give incorrect reactions to information. Ninja Encounter Part 1 is pretty bad, honestly. We get four minutes of baby chasing, four minutes of ninja fighting, four minutes of bulk and skull shenanigans, and nothing else. Yeah. Part 2 is... Much of the same. Yeah. The Rangers need to save Rocky, yeah, Adam, and Aisha still. before they get brainwashed. But Zed sends down a monster, and the entire episode is the Rangers dealing with that. And they're the flying. The interesting thing that happens here is that Aisha picks the lock <laughs> and frees her friends, where they have a little fight with the putties and hold their own pretty well. But almost Let's immediately, go. Goldar That's just locks them back That's up. crazy. Imagine beating Great. No, putties I'm unmorphed. <laughs> the Ninja Encounter finale is pretty lackluster too it's once again the yeah. rangers fighting a completely different monster is that a soccer tree yes it is that's crazy <gasps> Tim and the rangers fighting a completely different monster unrelated to the situation yes Tim Tim all right me, <laughs> let, 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 let Roy do his thing. So I okay, love Di uh -huh. I, I love Die Ranger a lot, which is obviously the source mm -hmm. material never for the White Ranger. I never would have known. Listen, honestly. never, never. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> because the the mecha in Die Ranger are actual living like deities, uh, you need an incredible amount of energy or chi to keep them under control and to work mm -hmm. with them, kind of thing. In the show, there are these sacred treasures called the Tenpai no Dai Dai balls, or or heavenly mm -hmm. heavenly chi balls, heavenly something balls. Um, yes. I forgot what it translates to, but they had to Dragon use balls. them, ba basically. They had to use them <laughs> yeah. to keep the mecha under control, and so they wouldn't drain their own life force using them. Mm -hmm. There are so many shots of them just with the balls for some reason, and they just didn't cut this out. So this is actually yeah. in it where he's just holding his ten pino dada ball, and just... Mm -hmm. It's always just really funny to see shots like that. So yeah. Let's go. of the episode. Yeah. They eventually do free Rocky, Adam, and Aisha. <gasps> oh, is it time? Together, they fight the yeah! And stop Zed's plan. Yeah. When they return to the I cave to save Billy, though, he removes his helmet, where the three teens learn the identity <gasps> of the Power Rangers. 
Well, it's crazy. Go to the command center and take a vow to never reveal the identity of the Rangers. Oh my god, they, they could have just sure made them like, is, like, get like out of like, excuse. <laughs> like back to high school or like they're moving and they can't do Power Ranger stuff anymore. That would have been like way easier. Well, it's so funny you things. say that. Yeah. That's crazy. I, that I don't know where so you got that. Wild. Yeah, I don't know where you got that idea <laughs> from. Tell someone, do the Rangers show up to I'm my just saying that it's a very obvious choice to do. But they did not. New friends being made. I'm sure they're not important, though. Just no, another not Richie and Curtis on our hands. Curious, I a swear to God. Of global proportions. <laughs> There's a World Peace Conference happening. Whoa. Where three teenagers from Angel Grove will be chosen to travel the world and promote peace. Whoa. Mm. Mm. Meanwhile, Rocky, Adam, and Aisha join in the festivities and showing these world ambassadors a fun time in Angel Grove. That is until the buddies attack That's crazy. and they all leap into action. Man, these guys are really good at fighting the putties. Hmm. Yeah, so Billy flirts That's with wild. this one girl. Like, there's no way he's the nerd anymore. He's got that triceratops. Oh my god, face. he's, a, <laughs> he's, he's like the fucking heartthrob of yeah. the <laughs> Bro, he's got that triceratops riz. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. Which is, it is something about it, you know? Yeah. yeah. There's maybe some glasses, who knows? Absolutely. With the help of this turtle zord. <gasps> yeah, they just get a tour. Uh, the turtle has never died, by the way, so I don't know why we need the turtle. A turtle. Yeah, listen. A don't worry anyways. about it. Its name is Tor. It's so cute. Yeah, Tor the turtle. Frequency into mindless zombie slaves. I had this There's episode again, another on tape. Attack that Rocky, Adam, and well, I all right. To. I just need to. Sh I just play oh, this God. again. So this God. is this is around the time that they actually had like fight choreography, like mm. on point. Yes. And you can mm. see it with Johnny Young Bosch and Steve, Card uh, Steve Cardenas fighting here. So, Which okay. is Rock Rocky and Adam. Yep. Mm -hmm. There's once again another putty attack that Rocky, Adam, and Aisha show up to. They look so good in red, black, and yellow. But again, I'm sure. Yeah, you see like how great the, like those shots look? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're there's amazing. Also, wow. Yeah. It would have foreshadowed anything later, reason. right? <laughs> 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 there wouldn't be anything correlating that with anything later on, right? That's guys? wild. I don't no, know why you would assume that'd be that. Wild. That'd be crazy. No, no there's way. also another reason for why they're so good on screen, too. Mm -hmm. Like, at this point, there's another reason. But uh, okay. beyond the fact that they are all, they're uh, red and black are both martial artists array. Johnny yeah. Young, and Steve Kearney mm -hmm. are martial artists. But there's another reason why their choreography on screen is already good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Do, do we want to talk about it now, Billy's or do we want to... Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> they talked about it earlier. We're not going to get to it tonight. So that's why I'm like... Mm. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. You were so right. Yeah. So, uh, the very first Power Rangers movie uh, features these three mystery people. Um, but that movie was filmed at the beginning of season two. Yep. Okay. So, they, they had already filmed MMPR movie at this point. However, because of, obviously, they had to edit things. They had to, you know, cut things, get special effects in. The TV show was still airing at this point as well. And mm -hmm. so even though, you know, Rocky, Enem, and Aisha hadn't shown up in the show yet, they'd already started working with people in, in the show. In the so movie, they were yeah. they were used to working with, mm -hmm. you know, stunt coordinators and showrunners and things like that. So they already naturally had good cohesion and good uh, cooperability with them yeah. and the rest of the cast. Because they had already worked on the movie and then on the show. Yep. So... Mm -hmm. Yeah, so this is this is what I was saying before where like some things are going to seem like out of order and this is a big one where it's like, "Whoa, why are they like so good? Immediately good." <laughs> yeah. And then it's because they already had experience. So. Yeah. On a whole theatrical yeah. movie that certainly didn't make millions. Definitely not. No way. <laughs> nor nor did it feature oh uh, music from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. No, mm -hmm. yeah. Of course not. But here's something that kind of bothered me. Zordon tries to call Tommy, you know, the, the new, leader, new of the leader, leader of the Power Rangers. And he doesn't answer his communicator because he's distracted. Yeah. So Zordon calls Jason and he answers the call. All in beautiful reused footage. Yep. So they morph on out to confront the monster only to immediately be put under its control. Oh, it's no. So oh, my God. Oh, Billy man. creates a device that'll undo the frequency. However, they all get overwhelmed having the device. Not the zombies. Away, as well as them turning into zombie slaves. Not the zombies. Luckily, Rocky, Adam, and Aisha are teleported to the command oh, center and they're all able to fix Billy's device. Turning everyone oh back to normal God, it's and like, blowing up the monster. It's like they're kind of part of the team. And oh, whoa. <laughs> wow. <That's... laughs> 
That's crazy, guys. That's, that's wild. That's so wild. I, I don't know why yeah. you would assume that. that True, yeah. Here. Anyway. The power transfer. Here we are. One. The three teenagers oh who will be going God, to it's... Switzerland for the peace conference have been selected. Also, Tommy and Green again. Jason, Zach, and Shrini. Who could have seen that coming? Whoa. We get this kind they of interesting done that in the shot beginning. where the rest of the Rangers they inform them that they've they been chosen. <laughs> Tommy's once again wearing green because we need more recycled command center footage with Jason, Zach, and Shrini. Yeah. Zordon informs the team that they'll need to go to the deserted planet to find the Sword of Light in order to transfer the red, black, and yellow <sighs> Rangers powers to three new people. Man. And this deserted planet actually doesn't look like a random backyard in California. It's actually <laughs> a unique location that feels... Which, this is a Die Ranger shot. Which, yeah. the, oh. the world is ending kind of oh, shot. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this, they, got, they got this at, like, the end of, like, that that season or some shit. Yeah, it's like, no. <laughs> like three-fourths of the way through the show. Basically, um, a dragon god that looks over, like, the cosmos comes to Earth, and he's like, hey, you guys need to stop fucking fighting, and I'm tired yeah. of this shit. And if you keep fighting, I'm going to destroy the earth and everybody on it. So stop. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Feels like a completely <laughs> desolated place. Yeah. Meanwhile, Lord Zed Hey, look, it's that dragon god. Get there first it's a dragon. The oh my god. His sword is Serpentera. This massive Serpentera. dragon. That's it. Seriously, Jason summons the zords, and they're like mosquitoes yes, compared to Serpentera. Yeah. Yep. This thing is. Oh my actually... god, please don't, don't do this. Sorry. Sorry. Don't Sorry. do this. Don't do this. She, she doesn't know. <laughs> she doesn't know. I don't know. He's, I... he's, he's quoting a really, really later episode of Power Rangers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She doesn't know yet, Kane. So keep it together. I, th this quote is it's funny to me in the sense that Serpentera in the name alone invokes a certain fear in a lot of future yeah. Power Rangers, um, okay. which invokes a monologue that I constantly quote. And I think it's so funny. <laughs> yeah. What? Just the, oh. on name alone, it invokes a <sighs> Serpentera. An oh shit moment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Seriously, Jason summons the Zords, and they're like mosquitoes compared to Serpentera. This thing is so massive and powerful. Just go to Earth with this thing if the Zord can't take it down. Yeah. There is a sleeping machine that Zed also sent down to Earth that Rocky, Adam, and Aisha are choosing to deal with. They gotta fight the putties and figure out how to destroy this device without any powers. The mm. Rangers find the Sword of Light. But Lord Zed decides to just blow up the entire planet, taking out the sword. As <laughs> Fuck well as it, the I guess, Rangers. sure. So, this is what I was talking about. This is literally the dragon god in Dire Ranger towards the end of it, where it's mm. like, you guys need to stop fighting. And then they're like, nah, fuck that. And they keep fighting anyway. So, he nukes Japan, not, not exaggerating, li literally drops a, an atomic bomb on Japan again, which is crazy that Japan did it themselves, like in, in action and shots, like. And it, what the fuck? it's like all of Tokyo is basically annihilated. It yeah. is. What the fuck? It is ridiculous. Like, you'll, you'll see the shot. Like. Part two kicks off with the rest of the gang on Earth. It is, it is the actually crazy. On them and yeah. using their oh epic my. soccer skills to destroy the sleeping device. Meanwhile, before Zed manages to actually blow yep. up the planet. There you go. The Rangers manage to retrieve the sword. That's the, that's the shot that I was talking about. Oh. Meanwhile, before Zed manages to actually blow up the so, planet. So, yeah. This bam. planet is just gone. This. Oh yeah, li li literally destruction. Okay, and again, this is how they wrote it for the for Die Ranger yeah. as well. And it's oh Rangers my God. couldn't save this planet. They went to it to take a sword and just had it blown up. Yep. They I think they did say that it was an abandoned planet, to be fair. So yeah. they were like, oh well, nobody died. But in Die Ranger, this is Japan. Like these are people living in these yeah. buildings. Oh my god. So so what so what in my chat said, oh baby, a triple, don't say that. <laughs> Oh, my God. oh baby, a triple! Oh no! But yeah, Serpentera oh or God, what is what is the name of this mecha? Go Goshinryu, maybe? I believe hmm. Goshinryu. Yeah, it is. Uh, it is terrifying when it shows up, though. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. the abandoned warehouse planet. Thank you. <laughs> but no, this is this we is got a, it. We got it. This is a couple million people that die in Die Ranger right here. Not exaggerating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. managed to retrieve the Sword of Light just in the nick of time. And yeah, Zed actually destroys an entire planet. 
So, with of the Japan. Sword of Light in their possession, <laughs> the power transfer can begin. Zordon tells Jason, Zack, and Trini that they've done a great job as Power Rangers, and that they'll be able to serve the world in a new way. It should be an emotional moment, it's bad. but it kinda rings hollow when none of them are able to actually say anything. But who could possibly be Whoa. the new Power Rangers? Who could possibly be? No, that's crazy. It's none other than Richie and Curtis. Yeah! No, of course not. Oh. It's Rocky, Adam, and Aisha. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! Powers to them, get a little speech about how heroic they are and why they were chosen. Wow. And then they just kick Jason, Zack, and Trini out of the command center. And the episode's not even over yet. Zed sends down another monster, and it's back to action. They're like, please forget about the old Rangers. Because Literally. Ones, look, yeah. They legit just cram in a putty fight, Zord summon, and Zord fight halfway through the episode. Yep, immediately look, into it. couldn't have the episode oh be my. as emotional since the actors weren't actually there, but it just feels kind of slapped together and rushed. Whatever, I it's guess bad. they worked with what they had. It's bad. Yeah. But mm. yeah. This officially marks the, <gasps> the end Thunder of Swords. Jason, Zack, and Trini. Now, as a kid, yeah, I obviously hated all of this, but <laughs> I was just a kid who hated change in general. True. How I felt about True. Rocky, yeah. which is yeah. why they were hesitant about, about changing the Joe coming into Blue's Clues. <laughs> yeah, it. Like, That's why it's they very didn't iconic. Want to change yeah, the suits. Exactly. The, the helmets are iconic. The Zords are iconic. Everything about the toys are iconic. Yeah. So. By this point, you know, in Japan, obviously, kids are used to this change. Every single year, there's a new Sentai season. But for American audiences, for this being the first one, they are so attached to the Mighty Morphin suits. Yep. So when it came time to, oh, should we switch over to Die Ranger? No, we can't. Because of this exact reason. Kids don't like change. Especially American kids. <laughs> they <laughs> okay. they thrive okay. and live on, on nostalgia. And, and you see that, obviously, today. You know, a lot of mm. ki kids still talk about how, how Mighty Morphin is the best. Because it's this not. is all they wanted. This it's is not. all they knew. It's not. Um yeah, and, it, and it's, it's not. not. It's, 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 it's all right. Um, it's not the best, but you know, nostalgia. Yeah. But yeah. Clouds uh, your brain. But this is one of those instances that I was talking about earlier where, like, because of real life circumstances that were awful, it created mm -hmm. a whole lot of really cool in story lore. Like, oh, cool. There's this sword that can transfer powers. Um, mm -hmm. There's this giant Zord that can destroy a planet. Yeah. You know, all, all these, like, J uh, Jason, Zach, and Trini went off to go do their own thing to save the, the world in another way that wasn't as Power Rangers, which is a powerful thing if you think about it. Mm -hmm. But that's the in-show reason, you know? I Me also... Life, it's, it stinks. It does. It does. I, yeah. I also want to say, uh, because obviously we had decades of, you know, um, time to think about things to do to fix situations like this, storytelling-wise... Uh, obviously not yeah. actor wise, but storytelling wise, uh, comic mm. writers um, created oh, yes, yes, yes. created a new role for Jason, Zach, and Trini, and it's they didn't give up their powers to go to the Peace Summit. Zordon decided to make a secondary group of Rangers to go across the galaxy, so like in outer space and everything like that, to mm. to handle like covert missions. So another oh. strike team, a secret strike team, yeah. without revealing their identities but the, the comics obviously are a different continuity yeah uh, than the show but this creates a whole other dynamic of this is where they actually went yep. technically mm -hmm. so they become the omega rangers which I, I'm oh gonna, yeah someone in my chat just said omega rangers i'm gonna, yep. I'm gonna pull up a picture of them just so you can see them okay and They're they really are cool. Whoa. i love, I love them. Them. those costumes yo they yeah. are oh my god it's too big. Those look so nice. There we go. That's a good one. Yeah. So that's Jason. That's Trini. That's Zach. And then I can't Those remember the other so one's nice. name. Yeah. Yeah. They are. They are completely American made. They're not based on anything else. I mean, that's good. At least they somehow keep keep them in memory. Yeah. Yeah. So mm -mm. I I liked it as a, as an idea. I haven't read it yet, so I don't know. I like, haven't read it yet either, so I, I can't touch upon that, but I know yeah, it happens. Know it happens. <laughs> Beyond that, yeah. I, I know nothing about it. Yeah, absolutely. Anyway, let's continue. Who are you? You're not the guy. That's a I'll lipstick. Save how I feel about that is Jason a lipstick. It is. Compared to Rocky, and Aisha, a lipstick lady. When we reach the end of season <laughs> two. After all, we gotta actually see some episodes of these three actually a part of the core group. Yeah! Goldar's vice versa. 
we get an Adam focused episode with there being a dance coming up where the girls need to ask the guys out. Whoa. Everyone seems Aww. to be getting a date, including Bulk oh and Skull. Oh my god, and Billy. Getting the getting all the yep. It's absolutely Billy, adorable. is I doing that? Adam is the only one who hasn't been asked yet, and it feels like he probably won't be. Wait, so remember how we, we told you right at the beginning yeah. that David Yost, the actor for Billy, is gay? Yeah. yeah. How many girls has he been put with now? Around four, if we're <laughs> counting this episode as well. Yes. Gonna be four. Okay, okay. Just making sure. We get a good look into Adam's character. <laughs> He's a normal, friendly guy who just yeah. Because there's a nerd. Issues, there's one that which, like hey, I think that's pretty relatable. Tried to flirt with him, and then the third one by the picnic, and now this mm. one on this episode. Mm. 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 Well. Lord Zed takes advantage of this by sending down a perfect girl for Adam. Huh. This girl, however, she looks familiar. Ends up being Scorpino. Yeah. Oh Whoa! God. No, it's Scorpino! Oh, oh my god, I mean, I do love enemies to lovers. <laughs> oh my god, I'm screaming. I see, I see. I have to say it. Listen, I understand. Wild. Good taste, good taste. Mm. God, I totally mm -hmm. forgot about her. That's also not the original actress, in case you were wondering. I'm surprised they brought her back, though. Along with Finster, Scorpina hasn't been seen since Rita was kicked out. Yep. But hey, I guess they can use her a lot more now since they have a new English-speaking actress playing her. Mm-hmm. Right? So the she right? Oh, shows up, I think, one more time. And I'm, that's okay. it. Okay. Literally, like, I think once, yeah. And then okay. she's not even, like, written off the show. She just doesn't show up again. And there's there's a joke like in the 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 continuity and the 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 fandom that she's still out there like as a threat that exists. Yeah, she's just there. She's just waiting, hiding, just plotting, waiting. Yeah. plotting. Yeah. Well, the Rangers have yeah. been yeah. and Goldar for the Scorpion twenty million Bender. time, and mm. who could have guessed it? A nice girl ends up asking Adam out to the dance. Hey! Aww. Wow. Aww. It's another Adam episode with him and Rocky teaching karate at the youth center. Whoa! Adam because now they take over their roles. <laughs> yeah, yeah they're taking over the roles. The Rangers, they have to teach classes, you know. Yeah. Adam yeah. takes him under his wing because he got to be a lot good characters for other people. Kid. Exactly. Being picked on for his size back in the day. Lord Zed then creates the mirror of regret to try and use it on Adam, showing memories of his past bullying and attempts to break his confidence completely. It almost works, but Adam, of course, Wait, of his powers past through and realizes that his yeah, he was like, getting he was bullied. bullied? No, he was getting bullied. Oh, okay. So he whoops the okay. and goes off to fight the monster. Also, I just want to look at this scene completely. again. Look how fast he is. It almost works, but Adam That's not yeah, sped up. Holy shit. realizes that his past can't hurt him anymore. So he whoops the putties <laughs> and goes off to fight the monster. Or the Rangers get this new blaster. It's, it's a die okay. ranger thing. It's yeah. not as cool that was, as the uh, Those are a lot of balls. Whoa. You could I'm even just say saying, I just saw the balls. You could even say that they're the tin pine or the weapon where Tommy could be involved. Gosh. When is a ranger not a ranger? I love this episode. This episode so is much. easily top tier. It's so Lord good. Zed basically wipes the rangers' memories, making them forget who they are, and in hmm. turn, forgetting that they're power rangers. Zordon oh. kind of tells them that they're superheroes and lazily teleports to a field. Where mm. Bulk and Skull see this, Whoa! And actually finds out the Rangers' identities. Yeah, after all this time, they finally see it. Now, here's where mm. the episode gets really good. The Rangers <laughs> are completely helpless. They don't know what's going on. So, who stands up to the monster? None other what? than Bulk and Skull. <laughs> Yo! Wow. I the Rangers plan to use this crystal to reverse the spell. I don't know why they're Same wearing Bulk Red Dead Redemption stand up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I think I think it's they were yeah. on a stake they were on a stakeout. Yeah. <laughs> they were on like a stakeout or something like that, and they were like, okay. we have to we have to look the part, you know, to like fit in while they're hiding out in. You do, know, they, do they really have to choose a yeehaw? <laughs> You know yes, what? They, did. they look amazing. Okay. Okay. They look amazing. Okay. Also, thank you for the prime sub. I appreciate of course, it. Thank understandable. you. Thank you. <laughs> because of America. America. The outsmarted to save the day is so satisfying yes! to see. They manage to give their rangers back their memories, but in the process, get their memories wiped. Yep. So yeah, Bulk and Skull. So they never knew. Oh, it's yeah. gone. They forgot. Yeah. Their identity is there okay. Is a nice heartwarming part at the end, though. Where Bulk and Skull are recounting saving the Power Rangers, but no one, of course, believes them. Yep. But Aisha and Kimberly overhear the story and say that they actually do believe Bulk and Skull, Aww. giving them a confidence boost. Yeah. So this is what I was saying like way earlier, where I was like, 
once we get once something changes, which was the team, obviously when we mm-hmm. hit Rocky, Adam, and Aisha in, um, that it feels like they care more and try and not be just dickheads to to them. To yeah, the they're, they're finally growing up. Yeah, <laughs> a little, a little bit. Un poquito, un poquito. Yeah, I get why Bulk and Skull couldn't continue knowing the Rangers' identities, but come on now, they clearly proved themselves as honorable heroes. True. I feel like it could have been a fun dynamic, you know? Like maybe Tommy needs to sneak away from class and Bulk and Skull have to cover for him. You know, stuff like True. that. True. Yeah, yeah. It, it could have been really Rocky cool. Rocky just wants to have fun. I hate this Zed episode. Zed puts a spell on Rocky that, you guessed it, only makes him want to have fun. Pachinko! Ignoring all of his Pachinko! To just play around. Pachinko spotted! Yeah. Rocky focused episode. Damn, but time! It's nice to have one to show off his personality. Like, Ernie gets this new Pachinko machine and Rocky plays with it Oof. for a few seconds. That's and a bitch, then yes. puts the spell on him. <sighs> if Rocky's yeah. character is that he's a goofball and likes to play around, I wish they actually showed that off before putting a spell on him and making it an extreme. You know what I'm saying? This episode is also where that gif of I'm the sure. oh my Red Ranger running around. I can't yep. stand that gif. Aww. It's time. Well, it's more time. where that gif of he the Red Ranger so... running around came from. Alpha manages yep. to remove the spell from Rocky, and he saves the day, learning that there's a time for fun and a time for play. Yep. Hey, I'm gonna read. Huh? Hey, Exo. Nice. Welcome, in, everybody. Huh? Welcome, Let's everyone. Go stream. Welcome, welcome. Hope you guys are doing fantastic Hi. today. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Are you, are you? Uh, guys, we're, <laughs> we're watching Power Rangers, specifically the weird world of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Uh, Kane and I have watched we're this before. We're nearly at two hours. Woo! We are nearly Woo! at a two hours. Meanwhile, and our, we've... Meanwhile, our streams are eight to nine hours now. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. But we are indoctrinating, I mean, introducing uh, yes. Zeus into Power yes, Rangers. Yes, yes. Uh, so... Yeah, we're having a great mm-hmm, time. Mm-hmm. So pull up a chair. Uh, we're in the middle of season two. I think we're close to the end of season two. Yes, uh, but yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. Yeah, come hang out with us for a bit. I hope you had a great stream, Max. So thank you for bringing everybody over. Thank you yeah, so yeah, much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Although again, right. before the spell was put on him, he was pretty responsible. Lights, Crazy. camera, action. The Rangers come on a TV I show like this to talk episode. about the importance for of no exercise reason. and good grades and stuff like that. How did they get? How did like they get in contact with the Power Rangers in the beginning? Don't don't worry in the about first it. place. Don't worry about it. Excellent like, question. Don't. I'm sure there's an explanation. I'm for sure that. there's an explanation for that. Okay. We see in real life, you know, the Power Rangers show <laughs> usually teaches us that kind of stuff anyway. Why are they doing this in the form of an in-universe talk show? Because it's funny. I don't know. It's kind of a weird premise for an episode. It's not honestly, I, it's one it. of those things that I really wish the Rangers did more of. Like, I don't like this particular thing, but I really wish is like, hey, we should get it out there that people should be nicer to the environment or that they should stay safe during monster attacks or something. You wow. Know? It's one thing they actually did right during Dino Fury where they created That's a Ranger so hotline. Wild. Where they yep. could call in monster attacks so they could get a better, like... Exactly. Oh, that's actually nice. Uh, that's, yeah, that's a thing that happens funny. in Power Rangers Dino Fury, which is mm. season 27, 28, 29, 30. Okay, uh, okay. 28, 29. Yeah. Yeah. And then mm-hmm. and then 30 is Cosmic Fury. Although I don't think it actually works like that, but like that's just easy because years. Yeah. So. Mm. Okay, okay. Yeah. Zordon has connections, okay. <laughs> Whoa, Dino Fury did not suck. It wasn't it amazing, not. but it's like it's like a solid B. Like, it's yeah. definitely not bad. Season 2. Season 2 is where it starts to feel like Power Rangers. Way better. But Dino Fury as a whole, it was not bad. I give it a solid B. Yeah. yeah. So it's a mid, basically. It's mid and not it, a bad it, way. It's one of those mm. things that were like, we as fans were in this drought where we weren't getting good Power Ranger content. Yeah. And so we finally got it. <laughs> uh, Let's go. so, so we were just like, you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> so the, the big thing that we can say, Zeus, is um and and y- you might not be happy to hear this, but um Power Ranger Samurai unfortunately started a trend, uh, which is mm. uh, Saban took over Power Rangers again. Uh, again. In okay. in 2003, uh Disney was sold the rights of Power Rangers by uh, Saban. They, they were like, right. we're, Saban was like, we're done with Power Rangers, we're done with the franchise, we're moving on. And Disney bought the rights. So then we got okay. a bunch of seasons. And I still think the Disney era is probably the strongest era of, of yeah, Power Rangers. It's, it's for a lot of reasons, the definition of what current Power Rangers is. Yes. Um, okay. But um, Disney also did not want it at the time. So yeah. they were actively trying to find reasons to 
just let it die. Um, but the writers on the show and the people that were running it really genuinely loved the show. But it came to a point where they were trying to like, this is your last season. Don't like just end it. Yeah. It doesn't matter what you do. Just end it. And um, by that point, they were making more money than they thought. And Saban decided I should buy it back. <laughs> oh yeah. My. So Saban bought the rights back and then we got Samurai. And Samurai is not a garbage season, but it has a lot of flaws. There's a lot wrong with it. Yeah. It's not even taking into account the original Japanese source material, which raises a lot more red flags. Um, oh. But, but as a whole, like if you only look at it as a Power Ranger season, it's very, very lackluster, which yeah. is unfortunate considering the last 10 something years. Um, so we get that. And then the next season after that is Mega Force and Super Mega Force, which are two of the worst seasons that Power Rangers has ever had. Easily. Oh, God. Then we get Dino Charge, which Ninja was. Ninja Steel. Oh, Dino Charge Dino first. Charge. Yes. We get Dino yes, Charge yes, yes. season one, which, which was, was fantastic. W super good. And it was, then. Yeah. And then we got Dino Charge season two or, or Dino Super Charge, which was yes. really bad. It was. Uh, it was okay. It, they, they they took what they had and fumbled, and it's unfortunate. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and then we got uh, Ninja Steel, which is which I is really bad. I I started it because I want to watch it as someone who's very loyal to Power Rangers. I I have not gotten past episode ten. Oh God! It gets worse. I can't do it. It gets worse. I can't do okay. it. It gets worse. It's the the Watching finale. Is torture, apparently. <sighs> the, the finale of. Uh, Super Ninja Steel is why, for a while, I considered it worse than uh, Super Mega Force. Mm -hmm. So, so that that is wildly considered the uh, Neo Saban era because it was the Which second is time considered just awful. Yeah. yeah. Um, but immediately following it is Dino Fury. The reason that why no. we went Beast on this Morphers. tangent. Uh, oh, Beast Morphers. That's right. Uh, so Hasbro then bought the franchise made beast morphers which was better all right it was it was, it was kind of ned it, 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 it had was, some uh, issues because unfortunately saban still had its claws in it yeah. and had made contracts with nickelodeon that mm. they had to kind of follow and, and adhere to and um i know the the showrunners uh, and directors openly talk about how they wish they could redo beast morphers yeah mm -hmm. Uh, and then we got Dino Fury, which was, again, it was an okay season. So, Not great, but the best that we've gotten yeah. in a long okay. time. So okay. we went from, like, dog shit era to, like, okay. So it's, like, at least it's not terrible anymore. Yeah. But, man, I miss it being really good. It's not slop, but it's tasty slop. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I also love Damn. how Disney failed successfully. They were just like, yeah, yeah. Let's, they, let's they failed into success. to the ground. Yep. And then out of nowhere, it's like, what the fuck? Why are we getting $10 billion yeah. every time? <laughs> yeah. Yep. They could have just gosh. kept it and was like, you know what? Let's actually invest in, into this. And they could have like made it much more better. They awesome. could have. But no. And they really, no. yeah, no. They, like, yeah. they even started, like, promoting it, like, Disney World and Disneyland. It yeah. Was, yeah. It was very interesting. Until they sold it off and it was like, yeah, we don't yep. want to. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know. It was such wild a time. missed opportunity. It was a wild time. All right, time for an Aisha episode. This yes, yes, yes. Well, let's go. It's an Aisha-focused episode where we actually do get to learn about her character. Well, wow. Aisha gets chosen to be the volunteer fire safety expert. Yeah, whatever that means. Yeah, whatever. At first, she's doing yeah. good, looking out for safety hazards, but eventually goes on a power trip, bossing people around and telling them what to do in the name of fire safety. <laughs> and when Lord Zed sends down a fire monster, Aisha takes it upon herself to fight it one-on-one, -on -one, not working as oh, a team and just going strong alone. Where she needs to learn the importance of teamwork and not doing everything by herself. It's a good episode, honestly. I like it. Mm. That's a good lesson, yeah. Scavenger yeah. Hunt. It's not a bad one. There's a scavenger hunt throughout Angel Grove, and Zed ruins it by turning one of the objects into a monster. Again, with not cannons. one of his greatest plans, just interrupting a school scavenger hunt. That's about it, honestly. The rangers yep. get to fight the putties. That's literally it. Then they fight the monster, where they end oh, up I'm still same formula. Woo. the scavenger yeah. hunt. To be fair, though, they were probably the only kids doing it. What high schooler was doing an extracurricular scavenger hunt? Yeah. For grades, for honors. Yeah. <laughs> whose ship is powered by a powerful diamond that Lord Zed wants to power Serpentera. 
So the Rangers need to find a way to simultaneously fix the Bukala ship, hide the diamond from Zed, and send the Bukala back home. Billy ends up befriending the Bukala and wants to learn more about it's space just a, it's and just the a universe. Little guy. I know. That's some long time foreshadowing. Yeah. It's a really good episode oh, that doesn't God. really have any Duh, Not shenanigans. for a good reason. It's all about saving yeah. this alien and trying to outsmart Zed. Again, I like these kinds of episodes a lot more. Superhero yeah. stuff. Yes. Forever Friends. Aisha's friend from Stone Canyon is in town for a dance competition where, uh-oh, Kimberly is also uh -oh. taking part in. Spaghetti. Who is also oh. now Aisha's best friend. No way. Where That's crazy. Ready with each other and they need First to, of all, to share Aisha. Oh and... my god. I I want to eat at this picnic. Like best friend. Where the <laughs> two girls are bratty with Those are a what? lot of food. Those are a lot of food. I want some food. <laughs> I want those fries. I want some food. With each other Very and they need fries. to learn to share yeah. each other and maybe even become friends themselves. Oh, just what a happy ending. See what I mean about how like the Rangers have a problem and they make friends with it? Yeah. 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 Alright, let's move on. A real fish <laughs> <story>. <laughs> He's a lifeguard. Cool. Is it a Rocky focused episode where we can learn about him? No. He's just kind of the focus. Yeah. Lord Zed revives all of the past fish and water related monsters. For some reason. Because it's a lifeguard episode. Yeah. Because why yeah. not? All right, I guess. <laughs> Again, I would have liked to learn something about Rocky, but hey. Nah. No, 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 no. Rangers back in time part one. Oh, no. Here we go. <laughs> what, what, what happened? It's complicated. Um, It's both amazing and terrible. Wait. Oh, no, this is the wrong one. Not the one I was thinking of. I was thinking we're, of... We're oh. almost there. Okay, okay, we're okay. almost there. Lord Zed reverses time Bang. and turns the Rangers into children, <gasps> where they don't have access to their powers or even really their memories. Yeah. I'm not a fan oh, of these no, kinds of they're kids. Yeah. Shows, because you now have to use actual children, and kids are usually terrible actors. The best part of the episode is near the end, where there's a putty fight and they need to use their children power to defeat them. Yeah, their children power. Except for Tommy, uh... who even as a kid can still whoop these putties. Mm -hmm. The child rangers get trapped He's in a picture different, where, sure. again, build Diffy. none other than Bulk and Skull steal the picture to try and save the day. Whoa! I'm not sure why this needed to be a two-parter. Yeah. Alpha needs to create a device and turns the rangers back into teenagers. <laughs> Let's go! They defeat the monster and return everything back to the normal times. Cool. Yeah. I hope the Power Rangers <laughs> never turn into children again. Yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, man. All right, next episode. <clears throat> The wedding part one. I was gonna say, what, what is the wedding? Needing to There's do a wedding. One million okay. year recharge. Right. Yeah. That's a recharge he needs to do every one million years. Meanwhile, Whoa. Rita's space dumpster crash lands on the moon, and we see Finster for the first time since Rita was kicked out. Yeah. He's sad that he doesn't get to create monsters anymore. But hey, mm -hmm. what timing? Rita's back, and Finster manages to bring her back to her original size. Hey. She's got a devious <laughs> plan up her sleeve. I like how they just the throw in Zhu Ranger footage. Visiting Australia oh, wait. For a that's... Oh, damn. Whoa. Yeah. They're in Australia. That's Whoa. so wild. They're in wild. Sydney. Wow. Whoa. Why, what? Why could they possibly be there? Why would they be <laughs> in Australia? Hey. Mm. Also, uh, wait, give me a moment. I gotta pee again. Sure. Oh, wow. yeah, of course. Yeah, give me a moment. BRB, oh, chat. Yeah. You guys can entertain them. All right, bye. Bye. Hi, Zeus's chat. Hi, Zeus's chat. How are you? Hi, Goose. What are you all up to? Hi, Goose. You Hi. How are you, Kumnoppins? Hi. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes you do have to recharge. It's true. It's true. Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm definitely, I'm definitely stopping once we finish season two, just because it's like <laughs> we're we're encroaching on like time that you and I took to do it, and a little bit. Yeah. Oh my god, thank you for the eight tier one subs. Oh my goodness, Holy thank you so crap. much. Thank you. My goodness gracious, I appreciate thank it. Thank you so so much. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, thank seriously. you for supporting, uh, Roy. I really appreciate thank it. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Had to make it 69. Oh, that you gifted 69? Well, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> next, next we'll hit 69, 420. <laughs> we just we just need one of those, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness gracious. But no, I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh all, all the support tonight has been has been amazing. And I, I genuinely really appreciate it. I'm, I'm happy that we get to uh, accomplish some 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 goals that we set and yes. get to keep uh working towards new stuff. So mm -hmm. thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it.
Appreciate it so much, everyone. Thank you so much for supporting Roy. Thank you for supporting Zeus. Hey, really and thank you for the hundred bits. And thank you. I will. I will either do it next week or the week after. I need to see what my schedule allows because I kind of already filled up next week with stuff I was gonna do. So I'm kind of like, oh, I should maybe not try and like quadruple book myself on a certain day, mm. and instead like set it aside of like this would be a good time to do this yes <laughs> yes we are still up we're we're almost done for the night we've got like we're still going we've got like maybe it looks like like 10 minutes of footage <laughs> which is probably going to be like 20 to 30 of us watching yeah now. We're almost at the end of season two, and yeah. then we're gonna hit season three, and it'll be a big turning point. But we're not gonna, hit, we're probably not gonna hit that tonight. Yeah, we're not gonna hit that tonight. You said that already. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna go to bed once we we finish yeah, yeah, season yeah. two, just to be safe. That but way, all yeah. of you, please get some rest as well after we're done. Yeah. Um, and thank you so much for supporting us, and thank you for allowing Roy to do what he loves. Thank you. Thank you. Can't let my ocean. Yeah, you never. <laughs> my body is weak, but my soul is. Oh man! <laughs> you should know we don't rest. I I, I know that better. True, and real. <laughs> True <laughs> and real. This is coming from someone who who starts streaming in random hours of the night, and I will still see all of my MCs. So it means a lot to me. There you go. There you go. Please That's how you know that your MCs. Though. Absolutely. Elves don't require sleep, just meditation. I like that. Just meditation? I like that. I like that. Wait, I thought you were an orc. What do you mean elves? Is there a plan oh, uh, for Lord when Jane? to continue this with Zeus? Uh, I mean, I'll talk to Zeus. Uh, yes, whenever yes, yes. whenever Zeus and Kane feel like we can continue, and we'll do MMPR Season 3, Alien Rangers, and Zeo. Yes. And then probably, probably two separate ones of Turbo and then in space. I am available for you. Whenever you wow. like. Yeah. As long as my schedule allows. But yeah, whenever yeah. you like. Damn. <laughs> Everyone take a long rest. I, oh, I'm my. back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back. Hi. All Hello. right. So Hello. wild that they're in Hello. Australia. I wonder why they could be there. I wonder why. Yeah. I wonder why. I wonder Ultra. why. I believe they actually are in Australia. Since they are. At the time they were filming the movie. And that's where they filmed it. Back that's to Rita's true. evil plan. She has Finster create a love potion that they will slip into Zed's sleep machine and wow. make him fall in love with her. Crazy. She also gets a new makeover to make her look younger. The reason for oh, this wow. is to not have a reliance on the Sentai footage anymore. Yeah. Yep, What's yep, funny, yep. though, is that Rita's new actress is Carla Perez. However, the voice is still done by Barbara, Barbara Goodson. Goodson. Yeah. What? So she's still even dubbed. Carla is reading her lines in English. She's still dubbed over by Barbara. It's kind of funny, honestly, but I absolutely love it. Yeah. You will never so find another present? show like Power Rangers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot stress that enough. You will never find another show like Power Rangers. <laughs> gotta love it. You gotta love it. That just keeps re like reusing, redubbing, and having yep. to just, yeah. Uh -huh. That's it. Okay. Mm -hmm. That Rita is true. I will never find another show. And to trap the <laughs> Rangers in this evil haunted theater. I love this episode. It's kind of creepy to be honest. I remember seeing this as a kid and genuinely being terrified. Because it's just such a cool new the set because they're in Australia. Monsters, it is, yeah. It also cuts yeah. off the Rangers' ability to teleport and summon their weapons. Also, I'm surprised like, like, like they have like, a lot of budget here when yeah. you guys said that like season three was the most budgeted. So this is yeah. the yeah. end of season gave. two. So... so that's kind of why I think. Ah, there's, there's okay. also They also yeah. have access to a lot more things here because they were filming, not only filming this uh, for the show, but also for mm -hmm. the movie. Yeah. So they had like, okay. a lot of weird like budget allocations um, at this point. Um, like, for example, they couldn't reuse their... Uh, they're more their weapons. They couldn't summon their weapons because they were in a different state. Uh, country. country. Country, yeah. Whoa. Uh... Maybe I am getting tired. Who knows? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. But um, are you sure? No, I'm fine. Oh sure? gosh, I could okay. stream if I wanted to, but I, I won't. Um, oh. Sorry, MCs, I won't stream. Um, but yeah, no, they a lot of like budget allocations, especially renting out these new locations, so the way you can film. Um, but yeah, yeah. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. 
fucking up and just immediately being head over heels for Rita. Yeah, that deciding love potion. Poetry and immediately asking her to Damn. marry him. We spent most of the episode following it the turned Rangers into a real fast. Honestly, true and real. It's a really good atmosphere. Oh, hello, Andron. Andron, horrors. They're clearly outnumbered, and without the help of their weapons, all hope. I'm so not used lost. to this production. The it has production finale. values. Yeah, right? Good, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Beginning. All wedding. Zed and Rita officially get married and plan to destroy the Power Rangers together. Yeah. I love that. Aww. All because of the love potion. Yeah. How sweet. It's it, so funny oh, because it's all because of a love potion. Absolutely. Laughs that it is like a scary and threatening idea. I believe parents complained that Lord yep. Zed was too scary. So in an effort to tone him down, they made him a house husband that hates his annoying Aww. wife. Yeah. That's, that's kind of sweet. This is the exact reason <laughs> yeah. that um, they got too many complaints um, because Lord Zed was just too scary. Yep. It, it was scaring a bunch of children and turned a bunch of people off the show. So they had to turn him into a joke. <laughs> yep. No. Yep. So Damn very, it. very no. unfortunate. We had perfection. Unfortunate. And, and yeah. just... Yeah. Hope everyone here is doing great. I mean, it's literally like 5 p.m. for me, and I have mm -hmm. um, I have milk tea with me because my family went went back home to get milk tea. That's oh, why nice. I, I took a while that a little bit. So good. I'm gonna yeah. make myself some matcha milk tea mm -hmm. after this. Let's go. I think I'm more concerned for Roy and Kane right now. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm fine. This, <laughs> I know. I know you guys are like night owls, but still. <laughs> I'm. I'm getting close to it, but we're also almost done with season two, so <laughs> that's that's where I'm <laughs> calling it a night. So, mm -hmm. all right. It's so relatable for a kid. Anyway, the yeah, Rangers absolutely. eventually fight their way out of the House of Horrors, blow up all the monsters, and go back to filming the movie. I mean, enjoying Australia. Yeah, Australia. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. enjoy yeah. your vacation. Yes. Yeah. Oh, my and gosh. Yeah. Level of threat to the Rangers. And again, the Haunted Theater was also really unique. Let's see what evil schemes the combined evilness of Zed I and Rita I wish they keep the haunted to you, please. <laughs> Return the combined the Green evil. Ranger. Oh, here it is. One. Okay. Well, all right. We're not wasting any time. Rita has a plan to clone Tommy and use that evil clone to make an evil Green Ranger. Meanwhile, Zed's oh my plan God. is to use that opportunity <laughs> yep. to send the rest of the Rangers <laughs> back in time. Stop doing this to Tommy! Some, something about <laughs> you. Time or something! <laughs> Something about hearing Zeus scream about it. It's just <laughs> It's so it's funny. Just me. Oh man. It's just it's so... like been watching Sailor Moon and for some reason they just keep using <laughs> Venus to like go against everybody. I'm like, stop it, please. And this is this oh, is not funny. fun anymore. <laughs> yeah. No, you're hundred percent right. It's 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 something that gets repeated a lot, as yeah. does yeah. like the evil ranger trope. So mm -mm. Yeah. I'm glad you're picking up on it. Yeah. Let that let that trope die, please. <laughs> or at least make it make it fun and convincing. I got bad news plot, for you. You know. I got bad well, news for you. Oh, God, no. The greatest ranger of all time. <laughs> Very much so. <laughs> without their powers and without the help of the White Ranger, they really build up Tommy in this episode as like the hmm. only useful ranger, saying that the Rangers would be easy pickings if it weren't for the White Ranger. I don't know. It kind of you guys are just spreading the, the other Rangers. Like, yeah, you know, Tommy is a fan favorite, but to say everyone else is objectively weaker than him is something I never really liked. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, this Halloween uh... costume monster manages to clone Tommy and uses that clone to trick the Rangers into being teleported the into Wizard the old Angel Grove. Whoa! All except for the Ye old real Angel Tommy, Grove. He's gonna have a one-on-one -on -one battle with himself. Before that, oh, wow. two starts yep. off with the Rangers yep. back in the, the 1700s, being <laughs> the accused of being of witches and hunted down yes. the greatest <laughs> battle in the world. Wow. Unfortunately, since this is before Zordon made them Rangers, their powers won't work. Huh? Hmm. Huh? huh? <laughs> Wait, huh? Okay, so Kane and I very much dislike this because this gets retconned this season. Literally later on. Okay. No, not this season. Is it next season? What? I think it's next season. Okay, this it's gets rec season. this yes. gets rec retconned next season. Okay. Yeah. So they got sent back in time and don't have access to their powers because this is prior to them becoming rangers. Yep. How does how does that work when they have a coin to transform? See, you're thinking Excellent logically question. with yes. stuff that's been set up within universe that actually makes sense. However, however, the Remember writers that. do not think Just logically. Put a pin in that and it'll be on the test. <laughs> okay. Meanwhile, in the present, it's Tommy versus Tommy. They should have had me as a writer. Damn. 
And uh, I'd I be could... lying if I didn't say a part of me was rooting for the Green Ranger. I don't know, <laughs> man. You can't compete with the Dragon Zord. I'm sorry. No, you're, yeah, part yes, two you is pretty Wrong. scary. Yeah. Tiger Zord. From the Tommy but... fight to the Rangers running away <laughs> while Adam develops a crush on the local girl because she's just so darn cute. It takes up the sure. part three for the White Adam, Ranger to actually Adam, you do know that you're going back. You're never going to see her again. Listen, let my man dream, okay? It's, it's that tragic love story. Star-crossed time-crossed love lovers? Time-crossed lovers. Oh, like, we won't see it again helps. until Time Force. It's okay. No. Okay, all right. Okay, I'm going to pass out. Just wanted to say, just wanted to hop in and say hello. All right, good night, Andron. Good night, Andron. Good night. Sleep well. Sleep well. Bye -bye. Sleep well. Mm -mm. But not by killing him, but by whooping some sense into him. Since the Green Ranger is just a clone of Tommy's DNA, that means there's a part of his personality in there. The part mm. that yearns for good and justice. Yeah! Can so Tommy's transport Aww. back in time, save ye old Angel Grove from God. the <laughs> rats, which, by the way, oh, were supposed to be used in the Power graphics. Rangers movie, oh, yeah. but were cut yeah. into a looking low budget. Yeah. Well, yeah, what the hell? You actually wanted to put this in the movie? Yeah. yeah. The old Green These Ranger were supposed to be the villains in, in the, the movie. Town safe. Return of the Green huh? Ranger was a pretty Those solid giant movie rats order. were supposed to be the main foot soldiers of the movie. Yeah. But they didn't oh. do it, so they reused them here in this episode. Yep. <laughs> okay. Listen, don't worry about it. Wait, Just Wait, what's his what wait, wait, if he's he's got if if other Tommy, the other Green Ranger, is going to be there in the old Tommy days. I then wouldn't there yep. be a legend uh -huh. of Power Rangers in the future of like, there's this Green Ranger, yada, yada, no. yada, yada. I think he took his powers away. I but think he And live a normal life? Yeah. So this also brings up a whole lot of other things. Because there's this clone of Tommy in the past, one of the, co one of the common theories is that this Tommy is eventually going to become... Tommy's great, 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 whatever. Oh my. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like closing a time loop or something like that. Like it, it yeah. had to happen like that, otherwise Tommy wouldn't exist, kind of thing. But but there's also another instance of this later on, which we'll get to in the next video that we do together. But that does not yeah. make sense in my brain. Like, don't worry about it. That wouldn't. Okay. Listen, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> too big of a and, and here I thought Doctor Who was complicated. Oh man! Their powers. I wish they somehow integrated the Rangers being involved in the fight. Like maybe the Thunder Zord could fight the Dragon Zord while Tommy fought his clone. Yeah, and something I'm like that. At this point, still a fun three-parter. Best man for the job. Tommy and Kimberly are running for this? class oh. president, where Zed puts a curse on the two to make them absolutely hate each other. Which is funny. It's kind of <gasps> yep. cute to see, honestly. Yeah. Tommy and Kimberly have never bickered as a couple, and even though it's through a spell, it's still funny seeing them <laughs> each other. <laughs> 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 you right. Through the power oh, of love, they okay, break girl. the spell, and Kimberly becomes the first female president. Oh, I really like how you should have hair here. Yeah. Yeah. So, Rangers Part 1. Oh, no. Kimberly finds oh, her no. childhood book at a book fair. Grumble the Magic Elf. Rita and Zed then trap Rocky, Tommy, and Kimberly inside the storybook, uh, where they're now in green screen world. Hey Zeus, wow. so remember your Mr. Tickle Sneezer? Yes. Okay, anyway. Okay. Continue. Anyway. I do. And Grumble is also It'll haunt just me trees, forever. gosh dang. Well, now you don't Boy, have to wait but what was for forever. <laughs> Mr. Tickle Sneezer? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 the Rangers are at the juice bar, with Adam reading po Poetry. Poetry. I wonder poetry. what's in that book. Literally just poetry. Mm. Just be poetry, this? you know. I like the setting of the story. Probably book, a memoir. Though. Putting the rangers in these snowy conditions and woodsy areas is a nice change of pace. Part two is much of the same. <laughs> yeah. Rocky, Tommy, and Kimberly trying to finish this story since it's the only way out of the book. I honestly just don't have much to say about this two-parter. Production, at least, enough, you know. Production. They tried. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. They tried to do something new. Speaking of two parters that don't really interest me is the Wild West Ranger. I told you it was this Carl season. It is this season. Oh, okay. Vortex, you know, happens all the time and ends up in Angel. Yeah, so li yeah. literally, did, was it Zed and Rita that made the Time Vortex or was it, was it just random? No, I think. Oh gosh, I don't remember. I don't remember either. This is the so okay. She gets pulled into a wormhole, essentially goes into the past. But it's instead of mm. it being like colonial times, it's the Wild West. Yeah. Yeah, 
our bus. This, this is again filmed in Australia because they had to use the sets that were just there. Yeah. So. Okay. So um, yeah. Um, remember how powers didn't work in the past? So huh. she's basically useless. Well, well. <laughs> play it. Uh, She'll grow oh, during God. the cowboy times. Where she, of course, runs into the Rangers' ancestors and befriends them. Also, keep in mind, uh, Adam, Aisha, and Rocky are from Stone Canyon. Mm. And Adam's family, we later find out, immigrated to the U.S. from Korea. Asia. Oh, so, okay. So having Adam's descendant in America prior to this <laughs> raises a lot of questions this is obviously us thinking about this a lot but there's a lot of continuity and lore in power rangers that obviously makes you think <laughs> but because it. they are not supposed to be here <sighs> it just <laughs> doesn't make sense it makes yeah. anyway yeah, the ancestors no, no, no. aren't really that interesting literally having the exact same personalities as the rangers but now they speak with a yeehaw accent I yeah. Like to what a <laughs> Literally up. that. Like maybe make Billy and Adam rough and tough cowboys with Tommy being a timid saloon worker or something. Oh, that's the white stranger, by the way. Yeah, that's the white uh -huh. stranger. Again, uh -huh. another reason of like maybe Tommy became his own great, 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 whatever. And then that is the white real. stranger. That is. Which is another Tommy in the past, technically. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't with this writing, man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wait, wait. Wait. It gets better. It gets better. Don't worry. It gets better. It gets so much better. Kimberly, but they're too much. Whoa. Do you know what? Like Kimberly oh, morphed? The Ranger. Wait. There's no way. Gosh. Oh. Kimberly finds the command quit. center hundreds of years before they I became quit. Rangers and tells Zordon and Alpha that in the future can't. she will too become late. a Ranger. But for now, she needs to borrow the power coins, which I Zordon just gives her. Yep. Oh turning our yeehaw teenagers into yeehaw Oh, my Rangers. God. So I essentially, like these are the first instance of the Power Rangers, technically, on Earth. <laughs> on Earth. Yeah. The Wild West Rangers. No, and... Like the wild wizard, but like the first one was technically the green ranger. Cause like, unless that's like way, way before, or that's a different parallel universe. Is that a different timeline or is this a different timeline? Hard to uh, say. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, that answers a lot of my questions. Yeah. But so, so Kimberly's powers work here in the past, but three mm. episodes ago, they didn't. They because didn't. Because it was before she became a ranger. And this is also before she became a ranger. So that means mm. she became a ranger in this time. Yes. No, because she morphed before she went to see Zordon. So it's like, oh, yeah. yes. Yeah. So like literally this is just a, they changed their minds kind of thing. Oh my God. Yeah. They really wanted the pop, the yeehaw rangers to be sold. <laughs> yeah, all absolutely. All over the world. <laughs> yeehaw. Um, yeehaw. <laughs> and neckerchief are cool. But remember back uh, a few episodes ago? Yeah. When the Rangers went back in time but couldn't morph because they technically weren't Rangers yet? How come the powers work now? I just, I, I'm just saying. Anyway, Kimberly saves the cowboy town and returns back to Angel Grove. Oh my god, she still has her Southern Belle outfit. This oh is my god. the third time, though, that an episode involved the Rangers going back in time with time travel or something. Yep. And the final episode of season two... Here we Blue go. Ranger gone bad. Gone bad. It's a filler episode. Make him evil. Hey, Again. evil why, Billy episode. Why does Billy also get the uh, <laughs> Billy? <laughs> if it's not, if it's not Billy, it's Kimberly, and if it's not Kimberly, it's Tommy. <laughs> it's one of those three oh constantly. We've seen this before. Billy acts like a dick, and the Rangers are like, "Dang, this sure is weird. It's never happened before." So they outsmart the fake Billy and save the day. Yep. It's wow. pretty formulaic. Good guy acting. Oh, he gets a girl again, too. He gets, he gets, oh, he gets another girl. Yeah, he gets another girl. Oh, my God. Yep. What the <laughs> but yeah. he, he, I feel like he has a lot of data history at this point, secretly. Yeah. yeah. My God. Yeah. yeah. Of season two. Unlike season one, I don't think Saban was worrying about the show coming to an end, which is why the finale is just a random filler episode yeah plus with the movie coming out soon the power rangers franchise was once again flying high now that mm. we also had some episodes with rocky adam and aisha what are my thoughts on them well 
they're okay, I guess. In multiple interviews, Johnny Young Bosch, who played Adam, playfully joked that Adam was the background ranger. Yeah. He never really did much apart from standing in the background and nodding his head. Yeah. I called Oof. myself a background ranger, you know? Like, if you watch any Power Rangers, you see these background extras walking around. They don't really say anything, but yeah. they're, like, at a table, and they're like, that's kind of what I did, but I didn't do anything. I just stood there. Until it's, like, time to say, right. <laughs> Let's do it. So it's ironic because there, without going into too much detail, there is a later time where he is at his best. Yeah. And has mm -hmm. the best like moments he's ever had, the most development, the most character, everything like that. And he's not even mm -hmm. a main character. Yeah. So Yeah. <laughs> Being the away. Yeah. That is oof. I love Adam. He's my favorite ranger of all time. He's fantastic. I love mm -hmm. him so much. Which yeah, <laughs> is really funny because it's true. But it's not just Adam. Rocky and Aisha, hell, everyone apart from Tommy became a background character. Yeah. They really made out Tommy to be the only competent ranger, with the core five just being there, taking up space. Season two isn't bad by any means, it just could have been so much more. Again, yeah. I feel like Tommy's biggest strength was being a trump card. A force lurking in the shadows that would help the He's rangers the out of a bind. Yeah, that is true. Not so much yeah. as the leader. The Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie also came out during the end of Season 2. However, I'm going to save talking about it until early Season 3. Yeah. And you'll see why. Oh, wait. Those are yeah, kind of different costumes. Just, yeah. They're like armored. Those, they're, there's a they're whole leather. story there. They're also... They look like rubber. I think it's leather and rubber and plastic. Yeah. Ah, which okay. apparently was also very, very fragile. Yeah. Um, we learn about this uh, from Jason David Frank and some other actors. Mm-hmm move on to season three mainly because i want to talk about the movie we're nearing the finish line folks with season three not only being the shortest Wait, of are the we seasons, finishing this today but no. Also, no 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 oh. final okay. season i'm just mighty more i'm just letting Power him rangers let's see where it takes us that is where we can stop yes okay. so we'll 2 13 33 okay basically a few more minutes so left. there's there's about 40 40 minutes or so left in this video, and then the next time we get together, we can watch the Zio video as well, which is yes. only an I'll hour keep. and a half. So, tell me, chat, do you want to see more of this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bluska yeah, dude, we can... want to learn a lot more? Because for me, I don't I don't really mind. I like having to learn about this, and you guys you guys can already tell how passionate I am at having to join you guys. <laughs> I mean, are, you, are, you, are you enjoying yourselves? Like, genuinely. <laughs> Yes, yes, 100%. Yeah, yes. Okay, yes. they're all saying yes. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. Good. Nice. That matters. Nice. We want to make sure you guys are having fun. I mean, like, Kane and I love yeah. talking about this mm -hmm. stuff. And, and it's nice mm -hmm. to bring in someone new that's kind of, like, new to the franchise, new to the series, things like that. Yes. Um, no, well, not entirely new when I only, the only thing I have is Samurai. <laughs> I mean, hey, that works. That's not a very high bar to cross. I know. That's not a very high bar, but that's the bar that I have. And I cannot exchange that with anything else. <laughs> <laughs> if, if, I feel like if you give me, like, all of the pictures of the Rangers, I can tell you the ones that I have watched. I, I feel see, like. I if, see. I actually, if I actually look. Because I remember having to look at, like, wait, where is it? I can send a picture of it, actually. Hmm. In the live chat. Uh, let me actually close the pop-up. All right, there you go. I think it's right here that I sent it over. I only got it downloaded. Like, not gonna, I recognize like some of these rangers, like actually. <laughs> I'm waiting. I would I'm waiting. say. I'm waiting. Oh yeah. Yeah, I recognize like some of these rangers. Some of you. Some of you. Oh, okay, yeah. The okay. one with the, the Phoenix one, I I feel like I have seen. I feel like I have watched the Phoenix like mask thing. Mystic <clears throat> Force. Yep. Was, yeah, I watched that one. Then like after 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 the Phoenix one, like to the left ish, but like farther. Yeah, I, I already I also watched that one. Mm. Also the bottom of that one, and of course the samurai, and then. The, the left of the samurai I have watched as well. Super Some of them I just don't remember until I see the costumes. <laughs> we, oh, yeah. we will get there to some point, eventually. Yeah, yeah. No, at yeah. some totally. point, we will get there, eventually. Absolutely. Later on, we will get there. 
Zeus recognized I will learn more. some of them. Yeah, some mm-hmm. of them. That's mm-hmm. good. Well, we will definitely continue this. Um, and and th- those of you in our chats, we promise to communicate and work out uh, the next time that we can watch. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, the yes, rest yes, of yes. this video from tonight and the mm. uh, uh, the Zeo video as well. That way we can kind of mm-hmm. keep uh, Zeus on the path of indoctrination. I mean, introduction. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can, you, can, you can just straight up say indoctrination at this yeah, point. Yeah, but it's funnier well, if I try and correct the word myself. Indoctrination. I mean, like, that's never left a, our mouths. Introduction. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. introduction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. Introduction, said, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's introduction. Exactly. What? Uh, what? What? Pardon? Huh? Exactly. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Okay. I love how they cross over the uh they do cross over as a power Rangers. Oh yeah, I forgot. Later. They actually, yeah. I remember yeah, later they I remember an episode as well. I don't know which season or like which power ranger it, it is, but they showed a lot of like the red rangers <laughs> fighting something. I don't know what it All was. Right, don't talk about that because Kane is gonna uh, uh, Kane is gonna go off. Like uh, <laughs> <laughs> in a in a good way, but like in a way that you won't understand and he won't be able to stop. Okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, okay. We don't talk about Forever Red until we get there. <laughs> forever Red? It's called, it's called Forever Red? It's called Red? Forever Red. Forever Red. Yeah. It's a, wait, is that actually what it's called? Yeah. Oh what? Yeah. Sorry, no, I'm only, I'm laughing because we don't talk about it, but this is the episode I can quote to, from front to back. Yep. I know the oh. exact timing, the everything about what happens in this episode. Because I've seen because it you so like it? many times. I'm like that with uh, the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger movie. Oh, did he, they did an answer. Oh I've yes, seen yes, is the answer. So many times. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so so that means you'll okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, there was a there was a DVD that came out that included mm. a whole bunch of Power Ranger episodes on it, um, and I didn't have too many DVDs at this point, so I. Damn, that's so old. <laughs> so I replayed this episode so many times yeah. to the point where mm. I have the timing down of each and every line. <laughs> oh my god listen sometimes it's just like that sometimes, sometimes yeah. it is just like that that is true Goodness. but hey um thank you both for coming uh yes it was a really oh, fun thank night. you for inviting me yeah of course, of course. Yeah, i'm yeah, glad yeah. that you're yeah. enjoying yourself i'm glad we get to to look into doing another one of these uh and, yes, then, yes. and then get you caught up to where where kane and i are we caught are. up and then we can just have a randomly you know uh include you on the regular ones yeah yeah. Yeah, 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 it'll be easier from there. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to either watch watch the Power Rangers, like actually watch it. Yeah, we'll have yes. we'll have us sit down and we'll we'll make you watch the Power Rangers movie or something. That'd be fun. <laughs> That'd be a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Um, why do, why are you guys laughing maniacally? Because I'll quote it the entire time and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, now, are are you gonna keep streaming? Or are you done for the night? Uh, I'll be done for the night because I've been streaming for nearly nine hours. Yeah. Yeah, I do see that. Yeah, it's been uh, awesome. Thanks, Roy and Kane. Everybody's thanking, <laughs> thanking you guys. Yeah, of oh, course. Thank you so much for having thanking us. you guys. Yeah, we'll see, we'll yeah see thank you guys, thank you guys for being gracious hosts and teaching teaching all of us the beauty of Power Rangers. At least the first mm, of one. <laughs> of course, of course. Mm, 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 well, we have plenty more to teach you. And uh, I cannot wait to, to see production value in the third season. Yeah, for the let's love of go. God. <laughs> <laughs> Give me production. It'll value. be there. Trust me. It'll be there. I want to show you the metallic. Sorry. The metallic? Mm. Metal- sorry. Uh, metallic. Sorry. We'll get ones. there. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get, we'll get there. there. We'll get there. Meta- wait, metallic costumes? Metallic armor. Yeah. Con- Isn't that way too con- heavy for anyone to do stunts on? Don't worry. Anyway. Not. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> they're, not, they're not answering. Anyway. <laughs> we will see you guys later on the next one. Uh, thank you so I'm, much, everyone. I am going to go yeah, right thank out. Thank you guys so much. Uh, yeah. I appreciate you guys for inviting me. Of I hope course. you guys can also in, um, indoctrin, I mean, introduce uh, yes. to the Mythos girls, the rest of the Mythos girls, like Hades and I, Apollo. I, I was going to say, I hope we can find a time. It's just the time zones. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think the problem is, is the, the time. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, so, so far, it's only me and Poseidon so far. Yep. Hmm. Honestly, we should just include Poseidon the next time we we do everything too. Oh, honestly, oh, yeah. Did I, yeah. Did you guys not finish with Poseidon? No. On I, like... So I I did it with Poseidon. I watched the entirety yes. of the first video, but I didn't go past mm-hmm. that. Oh, okay. So and we have every intention of going past that with you. So, so yeah. Okay. It, it okay. would just work out. So yeah. The next okay, time okay. we bring in uh, Poseidon. Nice. Mm. Nice. Also, I love how we took very long and how's it be? How's it be come back to us? <laughs> I can't believe. Hazumi. I can't believe. Hazumi, Hazumi, Hazumi posted uh, saying that they were going to bed. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah. 
I didn't actually say that, but good God's night, Hazumi. Yeah. God's EPS soldier. Well, actually, <laughs> they, the only EPS soldier that I know is one of my moderators, but you know, I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want Adam. My moderators, oh my go to bed. You, you're not even moderating right now. <laughs> go, uh, yeah, go I to think bed. They're, I think they could be. They could be in their bed right True. now. Or not, All right. I don't know. Let's let's one. do that then. I'm gonna yeah. read out. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys. Let's let's communicate you soon on when we can set up mm -hmm. a next one. Thank you so much, everyone. Yes, yes. Thank you, everybody. All yeah. Right. Good night. Good night, Good night guys. everyone. Good night. Goodbye. All right. Guys, thank you so much for coming. We're going to go ahead and raid Mary. Uh, Mary's playing some Persona 5. Uh, he's having uh, a fun time. I think it's his first time playing. Uh, we're going to go ahead and raid him. Uh, be sure it's the first raid command. If you are a sub, if you are not a sub and you still want to participate in the raid, be sure it's the secondary raid command. Um, I will be back. What am I doing tomorrow? Is tomorrow Mario Kart? Yes. So tomorrow is Mario Kart uh, with Underhill and a bunch of other LGBTQIA plus uh, VTubers. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, but in the meantime, let's go send him some. Let's go send Mary some hype and some love. And like I said, uh, Zeus, uh, Kane, and myself will be uh, working on setting up another session. And we're going to see if we can get Poseidon involved. That way we can keep her in the loop uh, and everything and go from there. So, guys, thank you again. Uh, I will see you tomorrow. Hope you all have a great rest of your night. Bye-bye! Oh, and thank you again for all the subs. Holy crap. I can't believe we reached the sub goal. Bye-bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye-bye.